I see the relationship with Stasic and BMX being pretty much hand in hand and kind of one to one. I think the beauty of what Stasic brings to BMX and to cycling and to um, moto is young kids at a very young age get to experience the excitement of two wheels. Developing their skills with balance, control, throttle control, braking, and all these kind of things. It's really amazing to me to watch the kids on Stay Six and how well they perform and adapt to you know, this new technology. Whether you're riding a Stasic or you're riding a BMX bike, you're riding a moto, for the most part, you know, it's you and your machine. It's up to you what you can do with it and your passion and your skills and where it can take you. A racing legacy is built from dedication, hard work, blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. Promax. Be your own pro.
One. Bang. I see the relationship with Stasic and BMX being pretty much hand in hand and kind of one to one. I think the beauty of what Stasic brings to BMX and to cycling and to uh, moto is young kids at a very young age get to experience the excitement of two wheels. Developing their skills with balance, control, throttle control, braking, and all these kind of things. It's really amazing to me to watch the kids on Stay Six and how well they perform and adapt to you know this new technology. Whether you're riding a Stay Six or you're riding a BMX bike, you're riding a moto, for the most part, you know, it's you and your machine. It's up to you what you can do with it and your passion and your skills and, and where it can take you. A racing legacy is built from dedication, hard work, blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. Pro Max. Be your own pro.
Bad. The gate is long gone. See you later. Bye, guys. What do we got going on? A full pool on the inside. Trying to break away train right about now. That's got the Aharo flag flying high. Merton. Oh, yeah. Straight up putting down the ponies right about now. Merton, the bright light up on the front side. It's got the shark right on the back door trying to reel her on in as they head on down the line. You know, it's got to be Elder. So it's going to go Merton's and Elder. Here comes Kaylee trying to reel them on in. They all got trouble. Solano's in four trying to reel them on in like a fish on spinner bait right now. One more turn to go. Out of the final turn. Merton. Merton's going to get on in for the win if it holds together, and I believe it will. Merton's in. Followed by the Shark Ride getting on there, Lixendrew, and then Solano is going to go one, two, three, and four. Oh, yes. Shoo-wee. This one is straight up stackleberried. It is all good. It is all good. What do we got? Locked and loaded. Molina, Elizondo, Howes, Bailey, Wingo. They are on the course one more time. Elizondo got a sugar snap right about now. What do we got going on? Does he have the full pull into the first turn? Yep, there ain't no doubt about it. I'll tell you what, out of Bakersfield, California, Lottie Dottie, he likes to potty. It's got to be Pistol Pete on the tippy top side. Elizondo's got the big dog trying to reel him on in right now as they head on down to the line. It's still going to be, I believe, all Elizondo leading this thing. This one. Bailey Winkle, Howes, Molina trying to reel him on in. One more turn to go. They're going to bring it on down to the line. It's still going to be all Pistol Pete, Elizondo getting on in for the win here in Nashville. Ride's going to get on in there as well. You know, it's got to be Bailey in the mix, followed by the 4-2 ride of Lucas Howes, who's straight up been on fire lately out of the premier camp. We're moving on now. we got more big dogs getting ready to come your way today. How about this one? 5A, locked and loaded, and these guys are straight up pooling. It's going to be all Scott Harlow, Hoffman, Sanchez, and don't count out Keller. The gate is long gone. See you later. Bye, guys. Harlow trying to find a fast line. He's going to be sitting in two. He's got a lead ride guy saying, peace, I'm out of here. Like it's 10 a.m. at the Holiday Inn. This dude is straight up checking out. What do they got going on as they come on down into turn two? Hoffman Sanchez. Keller looking good to go. The Pop-Tart in the mix as well. Oh, no way. Harlow trying to show you a little sum sum as they head on down to the line. What do we got going on? Oh, man, he rolled and jumped into the final turn. That guy got more skills than you do. In and out of the final turn now. Harlow's going to have to settle for the two. Your lead ride guy is going to get on in the 419 ride. Of course, man, I ain't got him on the sheet, so Sanchez is going to get on in there. Harlow, the two. Sanchez, the three. Pop-Tart. Good to go. Oh, yes. Yes. We are underway, and I got an escort jersey coming your way today. That's got to belong to, I believe, little Baxter. Oh, Baxter out of Longmont, Colorado. I tell you what, this guy's got an AT&T long-distance lead right about now. He is straight checking out of this one. It's still going to be, I believe, all guillotine Baxter coming your way, but he's got Huddleston, Mieha, along with Chadwick, and Coda's in the mix as well. They're going to dive down deep into turn number two. The escort ride out of Colorado, he comes. It's going to be all hero Baxter. He's got all kinds of company on the back door. That's got to be your gold cup number one. How about we go with the astronaut man himself? How about Trottle Huddleston? So Trotter in there for the two. Baxter's on the top spot. These guys are both S-squared managed and coming down to the final turn now. The at t long distance lead is all hero. Trotter, they're going to go one and two. He's your gold cup number one. Then we're going to get on in there for the third, the 90 ride. That's got to belong to all Coda in there for the three. We're moving on now to number seven, guys. What do we got going on? I got some long hair rocking and rolling as they head on down the rhythm straight. Holiday, Cannon, Dissert, and then Blazing Wooldridge is in the mix as well. So they're going to rail the trail and bring it on back our way. And I'll tell you what, the king of rock, there is none higher. Little MJ Holiday. Out of Texas he comes. He's going to get on in for the win, no doubt about it. We're moving on now to number eight, guys. Number eight is on the track, and what do we got coming your way? That has got another one of our S-squared riders looking good to go. In and out of the final turn, coming on down to the stripe. How about we go with little Noyola, Dynamite Daisy up on the tippy top side of this one, blowing up the competition, if you know what I mean. Daisy's going to get on in for the win. She'll be moving on through in today's competition. 
More race action coming on strong in motor number nine, guys. We're on motor number nine. So what do we got? How about your seven ride on the front side? Is that going to be little Princess Hulk? Yep, there ain't no doubt about it. It's going to be Hulk on the tippy top side of this one. The factory bombshell ride out of New Mexico. She comes straight up representing. We're taking two of these riders out of here into the semi-main event. The Hulk going to get on in. Then that's got to be an alpha ride on the back side. How about we go to Samantha Ratzlaff getting on in there at Alhambra, California. Motor number 10 is on the course. Motor number 10 is on the course. What do we got going on? And this one is a head on down. Sedano, Canesage, Meha, Barnes, Robinson. And then how about Fifi's coming your way? I got a black plate up on the front side looking good to go. That's got to be Zoe Boogie Barnes. No doubt about it. Out of old LV, Nevada, Las Vegas. And I'll tell you what, she is straight up gambling up on the tippy top side of this one. It's still going to be all Barnes. She's going to get on in for the win, followed by the 1A ride, sitting in there for the twos at the 7A. Yep, no doubt about it. That's got to be Meha taking home the two. Moving on to motor number 11. Motor number 11, how about we go with the Rocket? How about Rory Strain on the tippy top side of this one? The Rocket is out of turn two. And then we have got Little Tornado. How about Vega coming on strong? Joshua Vega trying to figure out what has got going on as they hit out of the final turn. The Biolab ride. Straight up putting the power to the pedals. They got one more to go. It'll be all Barnes in Mieho. Well, my bad. It'll be Vega and Strain. They're going to go one and two in that one. The 40 ride Lohan in there for the three. We'll see him again. 11 and 12. 11 and 12 year old mixed open racers coming your way. I have got dope our downed riders up. Good to go. I got a Sharks ride trying to hold on to the tippy top side of this one. It might be a uh, little Kylie, I believe. Oh, yeah. One more turn to go. Kylie's got all kinds of trouble. That's got to be, I believe, the full risk crew coming your way today. Is that going to be the fast cat, Beatty? Oh, yes. Shatswell and Beatty. Beatty and Shatswell doing the dice. We're taking two of the riders out of this one. The fall risk ride looking good to go. Sitting in one right now. Sitting in two will be your Sharks ride. How about Shatty Daddy in there for the two? Number 13 now. Number 13, what do we got going on in this one? I have got one of Donovan Long's pride and joys coming your way. What do we got going on? Robinson, Bass, Sayers, Fleming, and Thompson coming your way right now as they head on into the final turn and bring it on back. Donovan Long looking good to go. Your gold cup number one. Is that going to be Daisy Robinson? No, that's a three ride in there. My bad. That's got to be Thompson getting on in, followed by the 43 ride. Or is that going to be Sayers looking good to go as well? We got more race action coming your way. How about we go with the remix ride on the front side of this one, leading the singing all the way around the course. They head on down to the line. Remix looking good to go. Bring it on down the stripe. Going to get on in. We're taking two of the riders out of number 15. National age group number three going to steal the show in that one, followed by the triple ones. Cole Bass, so Thompson's in, Bass is in as well. Number 15 is on the course, number 15 is on the course. I have got Smith, Grutz, Klein, Brown, and Fiefs coming your way out of Denver, Colorado. They're going to rail the final turn. You know the fall risk ride is going to be the little missile Brown, no doubt about that, but your Gold Cup number one getting on in for the win is going to be Trent Klein. He'll go wire to wire, coast to coast. Moving on down to number 16, guys. We are on to number 16. Yeah, buddy. Thompson, Young. How about T-Bone and Garcia in here? The Bullet Joseph is coming on strong. He's a local boy looking good to go with Knapp and Hall. In and out of turn two. I got a 5-6 ride up on the front side. Let's go with a guy by the name of Young Knapp is leading this thing in this one. Out of Gordy, Arizona. Gordy's camp, that is. Out of uh, Phoenix, Arizona. It will be, I believe, the Gordy's ride going wire to wire with the one ride. Joseph's going to get on in. The 56 and the 9 moving on through as well. Let's go with uh, Nielsen. And then how about Knapp in there with Joseph. Man, Naps kid's looking good. We're moving on now. What do we got coming your way? A bunch of big dudes on big bikes. It's going to be, I believe, 31 and over. Mixed open. One number 17. One number 17. I've got a 5-0 ride on the front side. 5-0! That means something different in my, in my community. It's going to be Chris Wooten. Chris Wooten coming your way as they head out on the final turn. Yee-hoo! Sound the sirens. The moose is loose. It'll be, I believe, Wooten's going to get on in. Followed by the 3 and the 26 moving on through as well. Smitten and Hedges. That's got to be Ironman's BMX Army. Armies, another one of our Goodyear Arizona riders looking good to go. We're running now. We're running to six and under. Now the open class is coming your way. And I'll tell you what, so is Dino. Big bad Dino out of Bakersfield, California. Dino Ryman's leading the singing in this one. One more turn to go as he heads on down the line. One of them taking off out of the six and under 
Oh, oh, yeah, dude, no way. Is that going to be Kimura? Yeah, San Mateo, California. That guy's out of the NorCal. Kimura catches up like bad credit cards, man. I tell you, that guy's good. He good. What do we got going on, Donovan? Long riders up on the front side of this one as they head on down to the line. That's got to be, I believe, another one of the uh, show, Schumann's crew. How about the laser lights of the laser show? Lincoln Schumann getting on in out of Washington. Here comes the daylight ride. Moving on through in six to eight-year-old open as well. We got more race action coming your way. I got an S-square jersey looking good to go. He's on the front side. Lock it on down. Is that going to be Gnarly Charlie? I believe so. One more turn to go. Gnarly Charlie out of the S-square national team out of Littleton, Colorado. He's going to bring it on down to the line. He's got the four right on the back door trying to get on into the semi-main event as well. Is that the tarantula? Dominic Schmidt for the fire crew out of Camarillo? Yep, there ain't no doubt about it. Here comes trouble. Little Gallegos. Gallegos is up on the front side. The racers on the tippy top side of this one. Another one of our Santa Fe, New Mexico kids coming on strong. Here comes Gallegos. He's going to seal the deal. I got a monster sitting in too. That's got to belong to, I believe, Little Jackson. Oh yeah, the little Matrix. Dude, that dude's looking good. Turn two, race action, fall risk coming your way. Is that going to be Paxman? There ain't no doubt about it. I'll tell you what, out of Henderson, Nevada, he comes. It's got to be all Pacman. Paxman coming on strong, going to put down the power to the pedals. He heads on down to the line with a four ride on the back door. Is that going to be, yep, the four ride? How about we go with Bullet Train Burnside? We're moving on now. What do we got coming your way? Motor number 11 to 12 year old open. Motor number 23. Motor number 23. Lottie Dottie. Lottie Dottie. You know Knox Perkins is coming your way. This dude is straight up two foot, I mean 210, six foot two, and a ton of fun. He is all good. Knox the Ox Perkins. I'll tell you what, this guy is straight up growing. And then he's got the seven ride. How about we go with the Hitman? Little Rojas is right there, backing it on up as they come on down to the line. Those two moving on through one number 24 now guys one number 24 i tell you what all day long we've been seeing this guy turn on the turbos henry leaners in practice he was straight up on fire at a saint francis minnesota he comes henry leaners is going to go wire to wire coast to coast for the s squared squad followed by i believe the deuce deuce the 22 of michael thompson moving on through as well what are we, leaners i can't read i was in third grade twice miss warwick and miss pratt so if I mess up, just let me know. I'll figure it out, I promise. I have got, I believe, a lead ride guy, the two ride. How about white side followed by the stone fox getting on in there. That's got to be Damien uh, Pride and Joy. A little ostrich tag coming on through out of Northern California for the Bay Area Dynamics team. What do we got going on in this one? Could it be, I believe, another one of the bad boys out of the factory LSG throwdown camp? This time it's going to be the kid himself, Colton Kid. Whoa, Nelly! Somebody getting all discombobulated out there. I tell you what, it looks like me on the dance floor getting squirrely, man. Colton Kid's up on the front side. He's going to get on in for the win, followed by the double deuces of River Larkin. They're going to go one, two into the main event. They go 15, 16, 15, 16. Oh, 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 oh. these guys are going crazy for Cocoa Puffs right about now. What do we got going on? Smith, Gosnell. Here comes Jaden Brockter along with Omara. Omara, that guy's all kinds of trouble. They're taking three. Omara's on the bubble. Fausto Radford, and here comes the Dragon Fire as well. Down the line, the three and the seven. Moving on through with Omara. You know that's got to belong to Smith and Gosnell. They're going to go one, two. Faction BMX is in the house. More race action coming your way. And I'll tell you what, I got somebody dressed in black and on attack trying to hold off a hard charge on the back door saying knock, 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 knock. Come and I come on in and play today. Carbona, Johnson, Harlow. Here comes Bus along with Crankin and Inglis and Duenas as well. The 14, the H are moving on through today. You know, it's got to be Carbona in there with Darian Ingles out of the Velocity Bicycle Camp out of Utah. And I'll tell you what, that dude's been looking good. Oh, we got somebody who needs a road map out there. What do we got going on? More 31 and overs coming your way. Two of these guys moving on to the main event. Keener, Quintana, along with Knapp, Knapp, and McGiven. Man, Chris, is that you, bro? Looking good? The 532 getting on in with the 44 as well. That's got to be Tim Knapp. And Keener getting on in. Chris, what happened, bro? Yeah, he's fast. It's so good to see Tim out riding his bike. Gordy's ride. 
What do we got going on? We got little ladies in the place right about now coming on strong. Yes, ladies crews are coming your way. The 800 girls are on the track right about now. I have got Zoe Bear, the Sour Patch One, Joy, Joy, along with Edmonds Gay and Martin coming on strong. So one more turn to go as they bring it on down the line. Your lead rider is going to be the H rider, of course, leading the scene. This one as they come on down the stripe. I've got the 432 getting on in there as well. It's got to be Gay is coming on in there. The H ride don't quite have her on the sheet. You got an H. We'll figure it on out. 913 Briella Sour Patch. You're in as well out of Las Cruces, New Mexico. What do we got going on coming your way? I'll tell you what we got coming on. We got a Biolab ride sitting on three, trying to get a qualifying spot right now. That's got to be strained. The Rocket sitting in three right about now. But the one ride, you know that's got to be all Savannah Priest up on the front side doing it to it for Sprocket. The Sprockets national, the national team coming your way. Gannon along with Leah Hergberg and Schaffe is in here with Wilson as well. Down the stripe. Strain's going to get on in. The one ride coming on through. Priest is in. Followed by, I believe that's going to be the three stealing the show. Is that going to be the little Princess Hulk in there? Little factory bombshell rider out of New Mexico? Yep. No doubt about it. We're moving on now. We've got 11 and 12 year old young ladies coming your way. We've got Starkey Beatty, v Viscurso Moody. Man, a whole gang of them coming your way. I got a seven ride on the front side. You know they got, that's got to belong to the factory bombshell ride. The Firefox up on the front side. Three of these ladies moving on through to the factory main event right now as they head on down the stripe. It's still going to belong to Viscuso. She'll get on in with company on the back door. That's still going to belong to the two ride, followed by your Gold Cup number three. Let's go with Olivia. Olivia, and then how about Avalanche Alexa Priest in the mix as well. More girls cruisers coming your way. The Gordy's Bikes ride's got to be the bomb herself. All oh, Tatum Huffman coming your way. Huffman, she's going to rail the trail out of 13, 14-year-old girls in one number 33 and get on down the line. The bomb straight up blowing up the competition for the Gordy's crew. 15, 16, locked and loaded, ready to rock the party. They are long gone. See you later. What do we got? A bright light up on the front side. That is going to belong to, I believe, the, oh, <laughs> yeah, boy. I tell you what, this lady needs no introduction to the civilized world. The factory answer rider out of Lancaster, California, Danica Anderson's the bright light up on the front side. Look like she's going to get a qualifying spot if it holds together. And then she's got company on the back. That's got to be McKenzie, the wild child out of uh, the Idaho, I believe. Yeah, girl. It will be Anderson and Palmer, one and two, S squared answer, taking the qualifying spots. We are moving on. We are straight up moving on with Izzy. Izzy's up on the front side right about now. It's got to be Isabel Sargent out of Eagle, Colorado, coming your way. She got one more turn to go as she heads on through the rhythm section. She'll get her done right about now. It'll be all Sargent going wire to wire, coast to coast, moving on through into 17, a 20-year-old ladies cruiser class. She'll be in the main event, the Alpha Ride, getting it in there for the two, followed by Biolabs. More ladies coming your way today. What do we got going on in this one? I'll tell you what we could have. The Nevada ride, is that going to be Hort coming on strong? There ain't no doubt about it. The monster up on the tippy top side of this one. Megan Hort's going to lead the singing all the way around the course for, uh, is that the COB, right? It's all good. It says here, Misfit, but it's all good. Hort's going to get on in, followed by the one ride. That's got to be all Mama Crane coming on strong for the Majesty Racing Team, followed by Pow Pow Powers, Custom Mops. More race action coming your way through the rhythm section. They go this time. It's going to be one more 37 of Iverson, Irwin, Gannon, Wells, along with Desbean and Hedges. That's got to be all bone crusher hedges out there looking good to go for the Iron BMX Army as well. Down to the line. Your national age group number nine is going to be Iverson getting on in for the win, followed by the J-Ride Irwin. They'll be moving on through in today's competition out here. Shoo-wee! We got more ladies in and out of the turn. Is that going to be? Yeah! There ain't no doubt about it. Jill Botchler up on the front side one more time. In and out the final turn, bring it on down to the line. It's going to be Botcher. She's going to go wire to wire. One of my favorite riders of all time out of Elizabeth, Colorado. Botcher in for the win. No doubt about it. Followed by the two ride getting on in there. Karen, Cassandra, another one of my buddies from the old days. Uh, that's her name before she married Lance. Yeah, she was Jill Botcher. Now she's Jill McGuire. Yeah, she'd be married forever, but I don't like Lance, so I refuse to use it. <laughs> he used to come out and stay with me. I got stories about him. What do we got going on? Susie! Shoo Susie LeVan! TNT blowing up the spot right now. She's going to get on in for the win. No doubt about a party coming on strong with Susan Black in the mix. LeVan for the win. TNT Bikes. 
<laughs> We're moving on now. We got more race action coming your way. What do we got as they head into the final turn? More ladies in the place. It's going to be Beach. How about Marsh and Amy Lee? One more turn to go. Looking good to go. This one's going to be up for grabs. Lee's got the lead right about now. The four rides knocking on the back door will be Lee, Marsh, and then I believe Beach. One, two, and three down the stripe. Oh, little guys on big bikes. The NorCal Next Generation Ride. Is that going to be Ryder Davis? No way. Davis taking over the lead. This guy's just straight up flowing like the Mississippi. Good Lord Almighty. It'll be Davis. He's going to get on in for the win, followed by the 20 ride. Moving on through as well. It's got to be, oh, Winder. Winder doing it to it. He's been looking good to go as well. We're checking on our downed rider. We got one down on the ground. Taking a little soil sample in the first turn. Want to make sure he's A-OK -okay and good to go. Yeah, Jill Botchler, man. She's super rad. Gate goes down one more time, one more time. The gate goes down. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Number 42. This time it's going to be Dax Murray coming on strong, bringing it on down to the line. The fall risk rider up on the front side out of San Marcos, California. The Daxinator. This guy is straight up leading the singing in this one. He's got the 5-1 right on the back door, trying to reel him on in. That's got to be Zip Martinez out of Fort Collins, Colorado. Dude, have you guys been out to Fort Collins? It is gorgeous, man. They got trails everywhere, Valmont Skate Park. Dude, they got all kinds of stuff. It'll be Murray. Murray and Martinez. They're going to go one and two down the stripe. Yeah, buddy. Getting the job done. The 31 ride getting on in there. That was uh, the ace. We'll see him back around out of the old S squared Colorado camp. Good to see you, Susie. Good to see you. Oh, I, get oh. I saw your hubs yesterday. I love them. I just love them. <laughs> What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way. <laughs> Holy moly, that dude's straight up shutting the door. Yeah, buddy. This dude is so good. USA BMX gave him two number ones. It's going to be the 11 ride. Mason Biaggi out of Brighton, Colorado. Oh, man, this guy is straight up lifting the world on his shoulders right now. He's got it going on. <laughs> Did you see that guy, Manuel Manuel? Yeah, buddy. Straight up rocking the party. Huddleston going to get on in there. That's got to be Hugdini. We got more race action coming your way. This could be an Albies ride up on the front side. How about we go with Jaxie Boy? Yep, out of Santa Fe, California. Santee, California. My bad. How about Jaxie Boy? In and out of the final turn. Coming on down to the line. The Albies ride. I'll tell you what. Angus has got a full roster of hitters coming your way. It will be all Jaxie Boy taking home the win. The ROC one. That's got to be all Kamikaze himself. He'll be moving on through. How about Colwell? Jumping on into turn two. We got one up for grabs. I'll tell you what, Gallegos is trying to hold off the 1-4 ride. That's got to be the beast, I believe. The hype beast. Weston Haslam coming on strong for auto racing. So what do we got? The Sharks ride's got to be Gallegos. Gallegos is going to straight up putting the power down right now as he brings it on down the stripe. Gallegos in. Haslam's in. They're going to go one and two down the stripe. They'll be moving on through to the nine-year-old cruiser main event. Motor number 46, guys. More nine-year-old cruisers coming your way. More nine-year-old cruisers coming your way. I got the two ride of Jam and Jax. Jax, are you in a New Jersey, bro? What? Are you kidding me? Shoo-wee! Jam and Jax out of Northern California. The jet ride coming on down to the line. No doubt about it. Crabino is going to steal the show. The race for two. -hoo -hoo -hoo. That's got to be Cam Bam getting on in there for the Lone Wolf BMX camp. The Biolab rider, Anthony Agron, is looking good to go. And I'll tell you what, Tucson represent right about now. It's going to be all Agron leading the singing of this one. Headed on down to the... Hey, oh, Agron going upstairs. Yeah, buddy. Agron's going to get on in the eight ride right behind him. That's got to be all Pac-Man himself doing it to it at a Henderson, Nevada. The Bassett rider coming your way is going to belong to young Chase Harp. Harp up on the tippy-top side of this one looking good to go. But I'll tell you what, he has got all kinds of company coming his way today. It's going be all, I believe, uh, Jack Attack and Irwin, Heckberg, Thompson, Harley in here, but it's all Harp up on the tippy top side of this one. He's going to go wire to wire, followed by your gold cup number two. That's going to be the wild child, Thompson, in there as well. I got a five ride coming your way, and he goes by the name of Red Rocket Hickey. Hickey all over the tippy top side of this one right about now as he comes out of the final turn down to the line. He has got the 09 ride trying to reel him on in. You know, it's got to be a little speedy Gonzalez. So Hickey and Gonzalez. Hickey Gonzalez moving on through 11 Cruiser. 
What do we got going on in this one? Oh, yeah. Check out this dude. Straight up mobbing through the hood. Stuart Gibbs, Schaffner, along with Hudgens and Christian. Then we got uh, GT Gardeners in the mix for the Acme team. Coming your way all the way down to the line. It's still going to belong to the 1-7 ride. 17 and the 8 going 1-2 and two as they bring it on down the stripe. That has got to be, I believe, Garcia and Trompner going 1-2. and two. We're going to check on our down rider, make sure he's all A-OK -okay and good to go. Carter in that one for the Rift Tangent team. And then how about Aiden for the Factory Black Crown? Hey, guys, just a quick reminder. You're going to be hearing it all day long. It's going to be a toasty day out here. So uh, be sure to hydrate. Be sure to hydrate. I said it, man. Yeah. Hey, let's get a great big round of applause for our downed rider. Come on, put your hands together, apart together, apart together. Not the way you want to start out a Friday morning, but I'll tell you what, they'll be back because they're tougher than a $2 steak. La, 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 la. You good, bro? He's putting his glove on. Look at this dude. We could all learn a little something, something from this young gun. I tell you what, he gets back on his bike, puts on his gear, just like his mama told him. He's going to finish his job just like his mama told him. That's right. That's right. You are all good, my man. Oh, here we go. They are long gone. One more time. One more time. They are long gone. This could be old Shay for himself. Is that going to be Crash Dummy? Woo-wee. Man, this dude's got more pull than you do. Yeah, dude, he's going upstairs. Holy moly. Hold on tight with all your might. It's still going to be the bad boy up on the front side of this one. Gibbs. Gibbs is in there. Schaffner's in there. Stewart's in there as well. One more turn to go. They head on down to the line. But I'll tell you what. Oh, Crash himself. Anderson Ford doing it to it out of OAZ. Mojave Valley AZ. Z, that is. Check out Schaefer. Schaefer scrubs looking good to go. Down the line. Schaefer's on in two. These guys moving on through the 35 and the 13. Gibbs right there. He's going to be the speedster. Crash, you're crazy, bro. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way. They head out of turn two and bring it on down the line. List just gone Cardenas. Here comes Lynn Roth. And then we got Kaylin White as well. One more turn to go. And I'll tell you what, check out this plane wrap coming your way. He is straight up checking out of this one. He is all good in the hood, if you know what I mean. White's going to, yeah, White going upstairs. That dude's R-A-D rad. It's going to be DeSomber right behind him doing it to it out of Boise, Idaho. More race action coming your way. More race action coming your way in and out of the final turn. 13-year-old cruiser. Is that how he says it? I'm trying to figure it out. It's all good. The 64 ride. You know that's got to be hard getting on in with the three ride coming on through as well. All Patterson. Mad Dog himself at a Bullhead City AZ. The Sharks are on fire. And this one, you know, Vicario. Holy moly. Maddox Vicario is straight up new and improved. Sitting in two right about now. He's got to deal with Ian Gibson. The Claiborne factory ride coming your way. Ian, looking good to go. Shout! That guy's smooth as a goose. He has got his shark buddy on the back door. Vicario, one and two. Fourteen cruisers coming your way. Now, tell you what, it's got to be all waters. Waters. He is straight up on fire. Comes in sitting in the three right about now. He's got company coming on strong. That's got to be old Cutter himself. How about we go with Danny Waters and Gadare? They're going to go one and two down to the stripe. The 51 ride. Keep your eyes on the El Fuego, y'all. This dude's B-A-D-D -D bad. Here comes trouble. It's got to be Logan Smith, Tarango. Tarango, this dude's out of Litchfield Park, Arizona, and he's been looking good lately, man. It's going to be big, bad Logan. They're going to go one and two out of the final turn, coming on down to the line right now. What else we got going on? That's got to be the one ride. How about we go with Sorensen moving on through as well, trying to get on into the 14 Cruiser semi-main event. It's got to be the Mongoose rider up on the front side of this one. Is this going to be one of DT, Dwayne Taylor's riders? Yep, Brandon Aguilar, Aguilar. On the tippy top side of this one is a hit on down to the line. This guy's leading the singing right now as they come on down on the stripe. Aguilar looking way fast and way smooth. They bring it on down to the line one more time. Aguilar's in there with the one ride coming on through Sorensen. No, my bad. Gunning. More race action coming your way. More race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? Caleb McCain has got all kinds of company. 15 cruisers. McCain, the factory answer ride, getting the job done right now as they come on down the stripe. The 93 ride getting on in there. Ian Westerman, he's going to be moving on through with uh, the sloppy nacho himself. 
More race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one as they head on down the line? Thompson, Wells, Owens, Westover, Roybull, Randolph, and Sunday, Sunday, Sunday in and out of the back turn. Dressed in black and on attack. I'll tell you what, this dude is straight up moving on through as they head on into the final turn now. One more to go. It's still going to be, I believe, Wells looking good to go. Owens is in the mix as well, but they bring it on down the line. The eight ride and the two ride getting on in there. That's got to belong to, I believe, Westover along with Ryan Randolph coming on through for the Biolab crew. We're m we got more race action coming on strong right now. What do we got going on in this one? Motor number 60, guys. Motor number 60. So it's got to be cruisers. How about we go 16 year old cruiser? Motor number 60. Power, Francis, and Neves, Leaners, and Mayborn in the mix. Bring it on down the line. The 10 and the 13 coming on through. That's got to be Leaners and Mayborn. One and two is they bring it on down. Lener Leners. Man. S squared, too. You'd think I'd know that one. How to read anyway. Leonard's gonna get on in. The Sharks ride going wire to wire, and that one's gonna be, I believe, the 12 ride right behind Velador is gonna have to reel on in Aaron Bleed. But I'll tell you what, that dude is so doggone fast. They're gonna go one and two in that one. Your third qualifier getting on in there as well. Who's gonna be the seven ride belong to I believe the lasers of Luthen. How about 21, 25-year-old cruiser time? Yeah, buddy. Check out Lucas Tabor along with, I believe, Mr. Mullet himself coming on down the line. You know the mullet man with the plan is going to get on in there, no doubt about it, followed by the 13 of Lucas and Tabor. They're going to go one, two, and three. Do I have a Biolab rider up on the tippy-top side of this one? Yep, no doubt about it. Biolabs, the Red Rooster, the Rooster Reed is leading the scene in this one as they come out of the final turn. The 38 ride is looking all good in the hood. The Rooster, Reed, he's going to go one front to star. Oh, look at the race for two. It'll be the DK ride. That's got to be Tim Knapp coming on through. Reed and Knapp. Michael, what happened, man? You just got treated like you were at the clinic, son. What do we got going on now? 41 to 45, 41 to 45. Here comes Brian Randolph. Randolph looking good to go. Shoo-wee. Oorah, devil dog. You're riding pretty good for an old dude. The eight ride looking good to go. That's got to be Zach is in there as well. But I'll tell you what. Oorah, Marine Corps. Brian Randolph for the win. More race action coming your way. Yeah, it's all good. Corky Gainsford on the front side, and it didn't take him long to get there. It's going to be Gainsford and Diaz. One and two, three of these guys moving on through into the main event. Who's going to be your third and final qualifier? The two ride. That's got to be Jason Simpson for S squared. Here comes, oh, that's my boy up on the front side. Is that going to be Hexamer? Yep, no doubt about it. The firecracker up on the front side. We call him that because you never know when he's going to explode and blow up. It's going to be all Hexamer. Hexamer's got Neff. Oh, look at Neff showing Hex a little something, something down to the finish line. Is Hexamer going to hold on? Nope, it'll be Neff. Hexamer's going to case that jump. He's going to need a lawyer for that case. That was straight nasty. It's going to be Neff with the win. <laughs> What happened, Hex? What happened? I got a cycle craft ride on the front side. You know Glenn Castle is back. Yeah, Castle. Oh, Castle just got treated. In and out of the final turn, the S squared ride coming your way. What do we got going on? It's going to be Miller. Miller, yee, cycle craft in there as well. Don Ho, Don Ho, Castle moving on through. Oh, man. Dude, good to see you, Turbo. Good to see you, man. A long way from Louisiana, my friend. A long way from Louisiana. Shoo-wee. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way. Five and under novice riders are turning on the turbos. are headed on down to the line. What do we got in this one? It's got to be, I believe, Shable, Picario. How about a hurdle? Hicks and the shark is in here. McMillan trying to get on in there as well. Sitting in two. Hicks, the hurdle. And then we got a jetpack Picario coming your way. That guy's out of Utah. Chase Shiabo, another one of our AZ kids coming on strong. Wrong. But the shark, the shark, the St. George, Utah kid trying to get on in there as well. Jace will take it on in. He'll get the win moving on through in today's main event. No doubt about it. Followed by, I believe, the 156 ride. That's got to belong to the shark. They're going to go one and two. They'll get qualified rides on into the main event. Hicks, Hurdle, and Picario. They'll be back around one more time. We're moving on now to number 69. Guys, I got Cunningham, McIntosh, Edmonds, Cooper, and Mary Cunningham coming your way today. Two of these riders looking to get on into the main event. And I'll tell you what, this kid is DK mounted and looking good to go right about now. Maddox McIntosh is sitting in two for the Misfit Racing Camp. One more turn to burn as they come out of the final. It will be, I believe, your lead ride guy, McIntosh, trying to reel on in the uh, Cooper. 
Yeah, you good, bro? Yee! Cooper catching some air to spare down the final stretch. So Grayson Cooper will be moving on through out of Surprise Arizona and Maddox McIntosh. They're going to go one. Yeah, buddy. Good job, E. Good job, E. He's looking good to go with, I believe, that's going to be Edmonds right there. Followed by Mary Cunningham. We got more race action coming your way this time. Is that going to be Axel up on the front side out of Brighton, Colorado? I believe so. Yeah, buddy. Six-year-old novices. Six-year-old novices are on the course, and they're going to come out of the final turn, bring it on down the stripe, and Axel is hitting on all cylinders right now. This guy's got a four-barrel carburetor or something. I'll tell you what, he's looking good. It'll be Axel. He'll take home the tip. Yeah, buddy. You should shake his head. He's like, yep. Oh, we got one down on the ground. Holding on the hill real quick. We're going to make sure he's there. okay. Oh, he jumps right back up. Nap. So it's going to be Axel and Asher. Nap. They're going to go one and two. And then Z Money. Is that one yours, Chris? <laughs> yeah. Shoo-wee. What do we got going on? Oh, we got another one down. It's all good. Looks like a, a track ghost reached up and grabbed him. He hops right back on his bike to finish the ride. Eight-year-old novices are on the course right about now. Eight-year-old novices are on the course right now. I have got Wardman, Nehemiah Wardman, looking good to go out of old M.O. He comes. He's looking good. He's looking strong as he comes on out. Wardman's going to try and hold on. He's got Z Tornado coming your way. That's got to be Hardgrove along with Ellison Moore. And then the Speedy Cat is in here and Grant and Ross as well. Down to the line. Worthen's going to get on in. Two of these riders moving on through. Followed by, I believe that's going to be, oh, the 233 ride. How about Carell going one and two? Is it locked? No. <laughs> What do we got getting locked and loaded one more time? You cra Oh, he's got one down still. So oh. You are not. No way. No way. <laughs> no way. His dad told me, bro. He can't drive. We seen it. We're still checking out our down rider. Want to make sure he's A-OK -okay and good to go. Don't forget, guys, rider safety is paramount. We always keep them down on the ground for just a little bit longer. Make sure they're good to go. Make sure we get a little uh, contract for safety, if you know what I mean. I'm going to figure out this little guy. The 180 ride. Is that Wyatt Ellison took a soil sample? Took a little crash out there. We got more guys on bikes coming your way today out here. Ten-year-old novices this time around the course. This time it's going to be moto number 72. Moto number 72 is on the course. It's going to be, I believe, the 898. How about Bora, Richland, Cooper, and Cooper coming your way. I have got the big dog up on the front side of this one. G. Bora, Gabriel Bora, coming your way out of Peora, Arizona. The attorney Richard is sitting on the back door, and then Cooper and Cooper coming on strong as well. So it's still going to be, I believe, down the line, getting on in. Gabriel Boro will be your qualifying rider in this one. The 1-3 ride, we'll see him again. That's got to be the attorney settling the law. We're on one number 73 now, guys. One number 73 is coming your way. Come on in, man. Come on in. You got this. You got this. What do we got? 14-year-old novices down the stripe. The 713. Oh, he jumps off his bike as the spot upper grabs and the 35 getting on in there as well. Be your final qualifier. Alex and Emerson Fleming. You good, bro? Hop right up, man. You're all good. <laughs> Shoo wee. Crashed on the last jump. I hate when that happens. 737 is going to get on in, followed by the 116. <laughs> no breaks. That's a great nickname, Majesty. It's a good name. What do we got coming out of the final tournament? Number 75 this time around the course. Chad Hoffman's been looking good to go. He's got Johnny Boy on the back door and Dustin Fail as well. The 63 ride getting on in there. Look at the race for two. Yahoo! -hoo 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 -hoo. Yeah, buddy, man. Hoffman, you're looking good, broski. Looking good. We're moving on now. Number 76. Number 76. Are those ones mine, Jen? Number 76 coming your way. What do we got going on as they head on down the stripe? I'll tell you what, these guys are straight up turning on the turbos and turning and burning ahead of her home. It's still going to be more intermediate riders coming your way. Meha. <laughs> Adams. Adams and Coda coming your way all the way down the line. Your national 
Was that the 17? Yeah? Woo wee! Little dog! Little dog! Looking good to go, man. That's gotta be Chris Young uh, Mieha in there for the two, followed by Coda. More intermediate riders are coming your way. This time it's going to be six-year-old intermediates. And I got an S-squared state team rider coming your way out of Colorado. That's got to be the guillotine himself. But he is in all kinds of trouble. He has got Baxter. Baxter's on the tippy-top side. But he has got a cut company coming in and coming quick. That's got to be, I believe, all Dissert. It's got to be all none. Check himself. Dissert sitting in two as they head on down to the line. Your lead ride guy, Baxter, holding on right now. They head into what the final turn. It'll be Baxter. Dissert. San Mateo, California. Straight up represent. Setting right about now as he comes on down the line. Baxter's in. Dissert for the two. Dissert the 36 ride. Liam Nunchuck. Looking good. Looking good. We're moving on now to number 78, guys. Number 78 is on the track as they come out of turn two. The 49 right on the front side. DeSomber. Big bad Nitro is in the mix as well. So it's going to break on down just like this. Nitro DeSomber coming on strong. Noah's his name. And I'll tell you what, he reps out of Boise, Idaho. One more turn to go. He's still got Huddleston. Fukuso, Curl is in the mix as well. Down to the line. Still going to be DeSomber. He's going to be your qualifier. One of the other guys. Yeah! Catching some air. Good job, bro. That was super rad. It looks like Rippin' Rye is going to get on in there, riding the bombshell flag and looking good. I got more race action coming your way. Seven-year-old intermediates, guys. Seven-year-old intermediates. What do we got going on in this one as they come on down to the line? I'll tell you what. I got an S-squared flag flying high today. This time, it's got to be the ace. The ace. The ace is hitting. Oh, Nelly. I tell you, the ace was on fire for a second. He got the little Chino Antonio coming your way. Joseph Atino coming on strong out of Yuma, Arizona. So it's going to break on down just like this. Antonio along with Schrader. They're going to go one and two in and out of the final turn. Schrader checking the back wheel, making sure it's all good in the hood. As the ace comes on down to the line, but Antonio out of Yuma, Arizona, he's going to get on in for the win. Moving on now, what do we got? Go, I got a bright light sitting on the tippy top spot of this one. How about we go with a 13 ride? That's got to be Z Train. Oh, I'll tell you what, out of Montana, he comes. It's going to be all Z Train. Zren in the mix right about now. He's got one more turn to go, but he's got all kinds of bees swarming on the back door right about now. It's going to be, I believe, Z Train. He's going to get on in. The A, a ride's going on through in the 150 as well. That's got to be Skinner along with big Max Biaggi going with Z Train. More race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? This time it's going to be nine-year-old intermediates coming on the course right about now. I'll tell you what, Gillum, Brown, Hurdle. Here comes Cunningham and Barton. Little Jackson is in here with Davey. Oh, I got one down on the ground. So the 71 ride. How about we go with young Ian Barton? Barton's got all kinds of company coming. That could be John Cunningham out of Utah for Valor BMX. In and out of the final turn, bringing it on down the stripe to these riders, moving on through the nine-year-old intermediate main event. And I'll tell you what, the 71 ride's going. That's going to be Barton. Barton's in. The 63 is going to be Cunningham. One and two. Your Gold Cup number three was in the mix, but not a qualifier. We got the 82. One of our 82 is coming your way right about now. What do we got going on in this one? I'll tell you what, Marchese, Petrucci, Vega, Linares. How about the Dill Pickle and Calejo coming? Oh, ho, ho, ho. trying the low line. That guy was trying to work his magic like Harry Potter. It is all good. The 159 and the 14 moving on through. That's got to be, I believe, Linares. Linares and Lil Tornado Vega. Vega had his wand out, man. He was straight up casting spells. 10-year-old intermediates now, 10-year-old intermediates now. I have got little Kenny coming your way today. Flying Kenny out of Edwards, Colorado. Kenny on the tippy top side of this one. One more turn to go as they come on down. Flynn, Kenny leading the singing. Edwards, Colorado coming your way. Three of these guys moving on through in the 10-year-old intermediate main event. Kenny's in. He's going to be safe. The 26 and the 40 getting on in there as well. That's got to be, I believe, Duncan. Duncan along with the little bow bullet Lothan coming on through for the Cycle Craft Squad. Moving on through now, 11-year-old intermediates. This is going to be motor 84, guys. Motor number 84 coming your way. What do we got going on? Davis, Casino, Nowell, Collins, Romero, Cahill, Warner, Hafner, and the double nickels. That's got to belong to young Callum Hafner. Viking racing. It's still going to be, I believe, Hafner leading the scene in this one. Three of these riders moving on through. The double nickels. Callum Hafner. He's going to be leading the singing down the line. Hafner is going to get on in. The 28 ride moving on through with him, followed by Nowell. So that's going to be Gabriel Casino going on through with Nowell and Hafner. 
Hey guys, just a quick reminder, man. Drink water. Drink water. The body's not made a Gatorade. Drink water. Drink water. It is all good. I have got an S-squared Utah jersey. That's got to be Mace Money Man's Matthews coming your way. One more turn to go. Matthews is going to get on in. What do we got going on? The 43 ride moving on through in today's competition. Zachary Villaverde. Sisu Racing. Your gold cup number two, leading motor number 86, is belonging to the mad dog himself, Spencer Patterson for COB at a Bullhead City, Arizona. It's going to be all Patterson leading and singing in this one. This guy is going to be signed, sealed, and delivering the win to COB down for the win, followed by, I believe that's going to be young Romero. Davey Rocket, was that you with positive impact? Yep, no doubt about it. I got a dog barking on his heels right about now in the 14-year-old intermediate division. What do we got going on? Two of these guys moving on through. Check out the man dressed in black and on attack. He's got a company coming that's got to be the 16 ride. Brown is going to get on in. The triple ones of Cole Bass out of Colorado coming your way for the two. We're moving on now to number 88, guys. Number 88, and I have got a guy by the name of Fool, oh, Octane, are you serious, Kyle? That's rad, dude. Kyle, Christopher, coming your way. And I'll tell you what, I saw your sponsor and it made me choke up a little bit. Kyle Christopher doing it to it for Redmond for the win, followed by the 154, Barry Baker. 15-year-old intermediates coming your way. 15-year-old intermediates coming your way for the rift ride on the front side. T-Bone Nielsen for show-off racing. Doing it to it out of far west Utah. It's going to be all Nielsen. Nielsen on the tippy top side of this one as he comes out of the final turn. This guy straight up in cruise control like he's driving a 55 T-Bird around downtown. It'll be the 58 ride in the mix as well. 56 and the 97. So let's break on down with Sergeant making it on through with Ryland Knapp. Nap, all your kids are doing better than you, bro. What's up? It's going to be Axman, 16-year-old intermediates coming your way right about now. Brody Young and Isabella Meyer looking good to go as well. One more turn to go as they bring it on down to the line. I'll tell you what, it could be the ROC ride. Meyer in there for the two. The 64 is going to be Young, Meyer, and then we got the Axman. One, two, three. More intermediate riders coming your way this time, 17 to 20. So, whoa, that guy got all kind of discombobulated. He like G'd out in turn two. Yeah, dude, 17 to 20-year-old intermediate. This dude is straight up out of control. Sounds like my college years. Porcella, Cornwell, along with Alex and Hayden Jones down to the line. 181 and the 257. They're going to get on in. Cornwell moving on through in today's main event. We're moving on now, 28 to 35. 28 to 35 year old intermediate race action is on the track. It's gotta be Trevor Deverspike out of, out of the Sparta BMX camp out of Arizona. Trevor, this guy's got a long lead, like 14 acres. It is all good. Trevor Doze Spike, Dover, yeah, Trevor, you're from the trails, son. She Trevor going on through along with the 921 ride. That's gotta be Devin, Trevor and Devin, one and two. What do we got going on in turn number two? The 143 ride's got to be Dustin Reed out of Fort Collins. Reed, Reed's got company coming and coming quick. And I'll tell you what, looking good to go. Hafner, Wooten, Jackson, and Hedges are in here, along with Slick Nick Picaro. Down to the line, Dustin Reed flying high, looking good to go. The 599 getting on in there along with him. So it's going to be Reed Picaro going one and two. What do we got going on now? 46, 50-year-old intermediates into turn two. This time it's going to be one number 94. One number 94, the 85 ride up on the front side. It has got to belong to All-Star Racing's very own Michael Shirley. Michael Shirley is up on the tippy-top side of this one. Whoa, Nelly! Check out the dive bomb coming your way, trying to hold on to a qualifying spot. Shirley's going to get on in. The 62 is going to take home the moto. How about Forrest? Man, that guy turned on a dime and left a nickel change in the final turn. shoo -wee. Oh, yeah. As E would say, welcome to the girls club. It is all good in the hood right about now. It's got to be old sassy pants herself doing it to it for full throttle. Is that going to be Riley Johnson? No way. Riley on the tippy top side of this one. I'll tell you what, Riley, she's got a great uh, mentor and BMX up on the front side. Of course, we're talking about her mama because Hojo ain't all that. It will be sassy pants taking home the top spot. No doubt about it. The five ride. No, getting on in there for the two. Looking good. Chadwick and Brindley Tatum in the mix. 
Seven-year-old girls coming your way. Seven-year-old girls coming your way right about now. This one's going to be a combined next round. So Gonzalez. So is that going to be Sour Patch Heart along with uh, Petrucci? Yeah. Coco coming on strong. I got a five ride and the two getting on in there as well. How about we go with Sour Patch herself? The two rides got to be Kinsley Heart. BMX Sharks. Number 97 now, guys. Number 97 now. What do we got going on in this one? Little Ripper Haas has been turning on the turbos, but I'll tell you what, Donovan Long's very own McGinley. McGinley is coming on. That's got to be the tank looking good to go. In and out of the final turn. How about Haas trying to put the power to the pedals right about now with Donovan's pride and joy. The factory LSG rider, McKinley in there for the two. That's the way they're going to come on through. We're moving on now to eight-year-old girls. Eight-year-old girls are on the course, and who's going to be turning on the turbos? How about we go with all Noyola, the dynamite kid up on the front side. Dynamite Daisy that is out of Littleton, California. Daisy Noyola is going to come out of the final turn bring it on down the line. Noyola's in. Martin Gay along with I believe Zoe Bears in the mix as well. But it will be Noyola taking home the top spot. The Albies rider is going to get on in there for the two. That's got to be Charlie Gay. Noyola your qualifier in that one. I have got, I believe that's got to be Princess Hulk up on the tippy top turning the green machine on right now. Holy moly, are you kidding me? Y'all might want to break out a pen and pan and take some notes because Princess Hulk Kira showing you a little something, something right about now. All the way down the line. Vicuso is going to get on in, followed by the eight. Shoo, I don't know your final qualifier on that one. I ain't touching it. The Gold Cup three, that's going to be the rocket is your final qualifier on that one for the BioLad squad. More race action coming your way. This time it's going to be 10-year-old girls coming in and out of the final turn. Bring it on down the line. Barnes, Wilson, along with the Goose. The Goose has got Priest in there as well. That's got to be the Banana. Savannah Banana, that is the one ride followed by your national age group number seven. But it's going to be all Savannah Priest, your qualifier, doing it to it for Sprocket Kings. We're going to do a restart. We're going to do a quick little restart, a little uh, issue coming your way, if you know what I mean. So, uh, ladies, come on down. Head back up to the top of the hill, and we'll get you guys restarted. So, 102 is in the gate. 102 is in the gate. Vescuso, Load Dog, Franzen, the Fast Cat, Beatty, and uh, that's got to be Athena Dunn. We're going to rerun this one, guys. Just, just take a chill pill for a second. Head back on up. Spencer and the crew, they'll take care of you. Don't trip. Yeah, Spencer's in the back. Right? I love those guys because I never know where I'm supposed to go when I'm racing. They take care of me. Kind of remind me of my wife. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go. One more time. They are long gone. The 102, the 102. Moto 102 is on the track. You know Fast Cat. Don't take long for her to get a whole shot. Holy moly, man. It is all good. Avon Beatty on the tippy top side of this one out of Bakersfield, California. I'll tell you what. Bako is producing some top riders right about now. Beatty's on the tippy top side of this one. Low Dog, Franson. Here comes Firefox and, and Dune as well. So it's going to break on down just like this. They head on down to the finish line. How about we go with all Avon Beatty? They're going to go one and two right now into the final turn and then it's going to be I believe all, all uh, Athena Dunn sitting on the three right now she's going to be another one of the fall risk racing riders the T ride take home the top spot followed by the double ones Beatty Firefark Vescuso getting on in there as well I got the 8-7 ride. Oh, yeah. Walski. Walski dressed in black and on attack right about now. They're going to head on into the final turn. Shoo-wee. Walski, the lead singer, singing a song right about now as they come on down the line. Walski's going to get on in for the win. No doubt about it. Walski's in. The two's got to be the one ride getting on in there as well. How about we go to the Shatwell. Kylie coming on through for the Sharks. Moving on through now. What do we got going on this one? The Alps ride. They're getting way bigger and faster, and it's got to be, I believe, the Talia Kovacs. Flash is up on the Tippy top side one more time. It's going to be all Flash leading the singing in this one. Two of these riders moving on through. Flash is in. Is that going to be the Bio Labs jersey at the national age group number 14 at the line? Yoo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Gold Cup number two. Priest. Priest. 
13 year old young ladies are on the course right now 13 year old young ladies are on the course right now Thompson Crane basket along with Crane Smith Brown and here comes Caitlin Caitlin oh man so good so good Thompson's going to get on in for the win no doubt about it the 7 ride coming on through as well followed by the 5 that has got to be I believe young Brown and uh Man, Caitlin, I can never say the last name, but you know, Renseller. Van Renselar. 101. Oh, okay. 101. Oh, we lost one down on the ground. Going to make sure she's A-OK -okay and good to go. I got my Sharks ride up on the front side. Headed on down into turn number two. We're going to check on our downed rider. Make sure she's A-OK -okay and good to go. 101. Moto 101 is on the track right now. The restart is coming your way today. And I'll tell you what, that's got to be too much. She's going to get on in if it holds together. We're still checking on our down rider in the first turn. Make sure she's A-OK -okay and good to go. The Sharks. The Sharks. I'll tell you what. They are on a title chase right now. Let's see if they can get it done. She's going to get in, no doubt about it, followed by the 7 ride. That's got to be Ferris. Ferris will be moving on through with Alvarez. Is that you, Moody? Moody took a little soil sample in the first turn. That's got to be... Uh, Old Blue Raptor herself. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah. I'll tell you what, man, crashing on the street hurts. That first turn when you're going full speed and all of a sudden you're skipping on the asphalt. Woo hoo hoo. Woo hoo hoo hoo. That's all I got to say about that. Gate goes down one more time, one more time. The gate goes down. This could be Huffman up on the tippy top side. This one is a head into the first turn. I'll tell you what, Gorey's straight up producing some top notch. Oh, some bumping and banging going on in the back of the pack. What do we got going on? Taylor Nader trying to find her way to the front side right about now. Wells is in the mix as well. So as they head on into turn two, this has got to be, I believe, Gordy Bike Shops, Huffman, Huffman and Wells. Wells throwing out the elbows saying, I'm going to get a little something, something right about now as I head on down to the line out of Sand Springs, Oklahoma. Homa. So it's going to break on down just like this. Huffman, Wells, one and two, down to the line. The escort ride getting on in there as well. Moving on through into the second turn now. What do we got going on? This one has got to be, I believe, yep, no doubt about it. I'll tell you what, if you want to learn how to ride a bike, you want to, might want to break out a pen and pad and take some notes because teaching class right about now is got to be all Solano. Solano, not whatever. Solano is going to get on in. The R ride is on the back door trying to find a fast line as well. It's got to be hidden. Tiger Lily getting on through as well. Here comes more company right about now. Is this going to be Elder? Shelby Elder? Oh, yes, out of Texas. In and out of the final turn. Coming on down to the line. She's got a full pool coming your way right about now. Morgan Sam Hammer. It's going to be the remix ride. Sitting on in there for the two. Elder's in. Sam Hammer's in. They're going to steal the show. Moving on now. One number 109. This one's a Doozleberry. It's going to be Merton. Merton's got all kinds of company on the back door. That's got to be, I believe, Danica Anderson. So Merton's up on the tippy top sides they head on in the final turn Anderson trying to hold on to two Merton Anderson here comes company Palmer's the wild child at the line Danica moving on through more 17 to 20 year old young ladies coming your way more 17 20 year old ladies coming your way Boston Reed on the tippy top side of this one don't count out slam hammer coming your way in and out of the final turn she's the king of rock right about now but Reed and Sam Hammer are gonna go one and two down to the stripe down to the stripe 21 30 year old ladies are on the course they hit on into turn two Wilsley Zimmerman along with Boxwell as well so I have got the 38 right on the front side Maria Wilsey at a good year AZ Arizona Maria Wilsey is going to rail the trail and bring it on back home one more time I'll tell you what she's going to take the win no doubt about it in there for the race for two's got to be I believe the 10 ride Zimmerman Zimmerman the 266 has got to be Boxwell C O B is gonna be Enja Powers. Yep, there ain't no doubt out of Apple Valley, California, the high desert she comes from. Pow Wow Powers coming your way today. Anja. Anja's on the tippy top side of this one. She's gonna come out of the final turn, bring it on down the stripe. She got Iverson and Crane trying to reel her on in. But I'll tell you what, Powers just got all those ponies, Crane and Iverson.
Here comes McGuire, Jill McGuire, my favorite McGuire of all time, and there ain't no doubt about that. Jill's going to come out of the final turn, get on in for the win if it holds together with Parti Caron and Sherhart. One, two, three, and four. Jill McGuire makes the best cup of coffee in all of Colorado. Thank you, Jill. Followed by the three ride that's got to belong to Mama Cheerheart. They're going to go one and two. Yee-hoo, Susie LeVan. I tell you what, I got some stories, man. Back in 1993, ah, we won't talk about those stories. It is all good. Susie LeVan, I tell you what, she is all good in the hood. One of my homies from the old days. LeVan's going to get on in and seal the show, followed by the five ride. Marish, they're going to go one and two. And then I tell you what, it is all good. Black is in the house. Susie LeVan, I'll tell you what, when she started racing BMX, there was just a handful of people. It was like Jesus and Moses and Abraham was building an ark. That's how long Susie's been doing this. Yeah, buddy. Nino. Nino out of Manzanita Park, California, showing you how to get the job done. It's got to be Dino Ryman. They're going to go one and two. Six-year-old expert Nino Kamura, Mantis Racing out here in Colorado, doing it to it out of the Manzanita program. I love you. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way. I got a six ride up on the front side. Dope, it's going to be the five. The five, the seven. Moving on through in that one, we got Hicks and McConnell. Hicks and McConnell are going to go one and two. The BMX Sharks team on the front side. Amber Boys leading the singing in this one with the K ride on the back door. Fast, check cash coming your way. Oh, yeah. A Acme BMX racing out of West Jordan, Utah. Winder trying to find the fast line to get on by, but little Amber Boy is on fire right now. He's going to get on in for the win. Yeah, buddy. Savis is in, followed by Amber Boy himself, Fast Cash. We're moving on now. What do we got coming your way in and out of the first turn? Let's go with one of the uh, laser lights. <laughs> oh, yeah. The laser show. Lincoln Schumann. This dude's coming out of Washington, Utah. Oh, man. The Alpha Ride trying to dig down deep to take over the two ride as they head on down. Is that going to be Colwell? Yep. No doubt about it. The laser show is up on the front side. And I'll tell you what. He is just hitting on all cylinders right now. Schumann's going to get on in. Colwell's in there for the two. Donovan Long picked up a star. And this guy, Schumann, the 87 ride, Cowell, one and two, moving on through in the eight-year-old expert semi-main event coming later on today. Biagi, Biagi, this guy's a home run hitter sitting on the fences right about now. He's up on the front side with all kinds of company coming your way today. Could it be Young Mason, Connor Rowe coming your way, sitting in two out of Boulder City, Nevada? Oh, man, the LRC rider, he's going to lock it down and take home the two-spot. Biagi in there for the tippy-top side out of Brighton, Colorado. What do we got going on coming your way? Is this going to be, I believe, Chase Eckel, La Hambra, California? Oh, man. Claiborne is up on the front side one more time, bringing it on down to the line. He's going to get on in, followed by, I believe that's going to be Angus's very own pride and joy. Jaxi Boy in there for the two for the Albies camp. Is this Quincy Williams out of the NorCal? It is Williams, the six ride, holding on tight right about now. It's going to be all Quincy Williams leading the scene in this one. He's got Alexander Martin. They're sitting in two. So it's going to break on down just like this. Two of these nine-year-old experts are going to be headed on down into the semi-main event. Quincy Williams, remember that name, ladies. Williams is in, followed by, it's going to be the three, woo-hoo-hoo, December. More race action coming your way. Another Sharks ride up on the tippy top side of this one. He's got the 16 ride of Kovacs on the back door. So it's going to break on down just like this. The boss up on the front side. Hugo boss, that is to you, son. It's going to be all Hugo. Hugo and Liam, they're going to go one and two out of the final turn. The Albies rider is going to settle for the two right about now. Looks like Sharks is going to get on in. Hugo's in. Liam's in. They'll be moving on through. More number 123. More number 123. Who do we got going on? Oh, yeah. The racer himself. That's got to be Gallegos. But here here comes Kerr, Gallegos and Kerr, one and two in the nine-year-old expert division. One more turn to go. Gallegos leading the singing of this one as he heads on down to the line. Kerr's going to take it on home for the sh rift tangent ride. Shoo-wee, that boy bad. That boy bad. What do we got going on now? How about the Basset Rider coming your way today? And he's looking good to go. That's got to be the Hummingbird himself. How about we go with Harp? Harp. He's got all kinds of Pac-Man on the back door right about now. Two of these guys trying to get on into a semi-main event. A semi-main event in number 124. So out of the final turn, bringing it on down to the line. Harp is going to get on in. Paxman is going to get on in. They're going to go one, two. They are safe. One number 125. One number 125. Holy moly. Check out this dude. Are you kidding me? The Sharks Rider up on the tippy-top side of this one. Carterman Hart. He is straight up 
up moving out like my girlfriend. Good Lord, this guy is long gone. See you later. Bye, guys. Shoo-wee. Hart up on the tippy top side of this one trying to lock it on down. Looks like this dude is straight up working for UPS because he is delivering today. It's going to be the D-Ride getting on there as well. Going supersonic for 110% nutrition. That's got to be Sutter Irwin. Sutter Irwin, the four ride. Oh, yeah. This dude must be straight up working for the McDonald's as well. This guy's faster than the drive through Good Lord. Dominic Schmidt is up on the tippy top side of this one as he comes down to the final turn trying to hold on down to the line. It's going to be all Schmidt. Schmidt's going to get on in. The race for two. Is it going to be the escort ride? You Your gold cup. Noyola, the gnarly one. Looking good. Looking good. Your gold cup number two, the wild card himself. How about we go with all Nixon Thompson up on the tippy top side of this one as it comes on down the line. Thompson, this gun's like a Thompson gun right about now. And I'll tell you what, he is straight up shooting him down as he brings it on down to the line. The 17 ride, that's got to be the crusher himself. He's been moving on through in the 10-year-old expert division. Oh, our downed rider, you good, Cyclecraft? You all good? All right. Just want to get the nod, make sure you're good to go. We'll see you next round, no doubt. You'll be charging hard. 11X. 11X. What do we got going on in this one? Is this going to be Garcia? Oh, yeah. Carter Garcia. The factory rift tangent rides up on the front side, pumping his way through turn two. But here comes the national age group number 18, speedy one. That's got to be Gonzalez in the mix as well. Gonzalez is going to have to settle for two right about now. We're going to check on our downed rider. Looks like he's back up and charging hard. It's still Carter, Carter Garcia. He's going to take home the tippy top spot of that one, followed by the 09 ride, getting on in there as well. Gonzalez. Gonzalez. This sir, you good, brother? We have got more. The ox, the ox. Sound the sirens. I tell you what, this boy's got an APB out for him right about now. It's got to be Knox Perkins, the factory escort rider out of Utah. He comes. Perkins, he's got company on the back door trying to reel him on in. That could be one of the remix rides coming your way today. I tell you what, the loco one, he's been looking good to go as well. Tegan and Daniel Leha. So they're going to got one more turn to go. Leha sitting in the back of the pack trying to reel him on in, but he's good to go as well. It's going to be the escort ride followed by the 13. One and two. Is that going to be loco? Yep, loco moving on through. More race action coming your way right now. What do we got? Bombing out of turn number one and one number 130. Mo number 130. Jansen's, Eakins, Trompter, along with Racine and Wood. In and out of the turn, your national age group number 20. Aiden, Trumpeter, along with the Rattler going one and two right about now. The BMX Sharks ride, trying to figure out what they got going on. One more turn to go. Aiden, Trompter, they're going to go one and two down the stripe. They'll be moving on through, no doubt about it. We got more 11-year-old experts coming your way this time. It's going to be one number 131, guys. One number 131, the 16, the 16, and Martinez. Let's go with a guy by the name of Lil Lili. Lil Lili. Oh, yeah. Lili doing the job right about now, working 40 hours a week and some overtime out here. Man, this guy is straight up working them like they're crops. The 16 ride, followed by the one getting on in there. Martinez moving on through as well with uh, Zayden Alex. What do we got going on in one number 132, guys? One number 132. Ah, yes. Cohen James up on the tippy top side of this one. I got some stories about this young gun. He is straight up B-A-D-D -D bad. It's going to be Cohen James bringing it on down to the wire. The one ride. Is that going to be Super B? There ain't no doubt about it. Super B. How about Kyson Christensen? They're going to be your qualifiers in 12X. 12X. I got more 12X riders coming your way. It's got to be Braden Gibbs. Oh, man. Check out Gibbs. This guy got more skills than you do. Man, he's going to get on in the final turn. Is he straight up smooth as a goose? Good Lord Almighty. Gibbs going to take home the tippy top spot of that one, followed by the S squared ride. Your national age group number one's got to be Henry freaking Leners. <laughs> What do we got going on now? 134, 134. You know we got Montano, old devil dog himself. Oh, uh, yeah. The devil dog up on the tippy top side of this one. And I'll tell you what, this dude must be an 03 grunt coming your way. Montano's going to get on in. Yee, followed by the one ride. He'll be moving on through. That's got to be, I believe, Soroida. I believe so. 
12X, 12X, yeah, we got a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, jam packed up on the front side, Skinner, Gardner, Cardenas, Roth, and White coming your way. It's going to be the S-squared ride sitting in too. How about we go with the big bad boy on the tippy top side? This one has got to be all white, taking it home wire to wire, and then we got Skinner in there looking good. Man, Skinner making his way back, making his way back. I said it. 13X, 13X, I've got the 23 right up on the front side. Maddox Perry coming your way out of old Gilbert, Arizona. But don't count out this guy sitting in two. You know Tegan, Tegan's got some moves to prove as well. Tegan Stiebel, Maddox Perry, they're going to go one and two down the stripe. The, the daylight ride, oh, got, ooh, I ain't touching that one with a 10-foot pull. <laughs> Let's go with the 10 ride, getting on in there. Stiebel, check it out. One number 137 now. One number 137 now. Yeah, buddy. This dude rides a bike better than you do. I don't care. It's got to be the one and the one coming across the line. Colton Kidd and Tyler Wagner. Wagner doing it to it for One Life Health and Fitness. Check him out on Instagram, man. Follow him. You know. Ian Gibson. Ian Gibson. Holy moly. This dude's another one of those guys with more power than you. Gibson. He's going to steal the show in this one. The nine ride on the back door. James DeSomber getting on in there as well. Gibson for the win. 13X. They're getting bigger and stronger and faster and smoother. And this dude's S squared mounted and looking good. Hart. Chavez, Vicuso, Tafoya, and here comes Maddox as well in motor number 139. 139 out of the final moto and headed on down to the stripe. One more time, it's got to be, I believe, the double ones belong to Hart. Hart's going to get on through with uh, Maddox, I believe, at Vicuso coming on through. 14X, second round of staging. Second round of staging, 14X. Oh, yeah. Rago Bagel. Rago Bagel. It's going to be, I believe. Oh, Bagel's dropping backwards. Looks like he wants to practice the second round after all. The one ride, the 10 ride. Moving on through Sorensen and Nielsen going one and two. Here comes the LRC Mongoose. Oh, yeah. This dude getting the job done. Aguilar, Brandon. They call him the banana because he's full of potassium. I get, I think it's potential that I see. Aguilar up on the front side one more time. Bringing it on down this stripe. He'll get on in with, I believe, the Osho. Oster tag. The Stone Fox himself out of the Bay Area Dynamics crew. 142, 142. This time it's got to be, I believe, another one of our guys from the Fall Risk Camp. How about Smith Tarango? Tarango up on the tippy top side of this one. Hey, second round, guys. If you're not headed into staging, you are wrong. Tarango going to take home the top spot, followed by the 1 2 ride. That's got to be Herman. Tarango, Herman, 1 and 2 down to the stripe. More 14 experts headed on into the semi-made event. It's going to be, I believe, Danny Waters. Oh, yeah. Waters got this one going his way today. He's got a shark rider sitting in the draft. He goes by the name of Gadir. Cutter fly himself. Waters followed by the one ride. That's got to be Gunning getting on in there. Looks like uh, we're going to see Gadir next time around. 15X is on the course. 15X is on the course. And I'll tell you what, young Westerman, factory black crown coming your way. Oh, man, black crown so good. Ian Westerman, I'll tell you what, this guy's been straight up moving out big time. He has got Gutman on the back door. He's going to take home the two for the Alpha Camp. What do we got going on in this one? Omar's trying to reel on in. The big dog up on the front side of that going to be the dude himself. Yep, Gosnell. Gosnell. He's got Omara. Gosnell. Omara. What's going on with, I believe that's going to be, oh, McCain trying to find a little something, something in the final turn. Omara dropping back now. So it's going to break on down just like this. Sharks answer. One, two, one, two. Here we go as they head on down to the line. Somebody's going upstairs. Yeah, buddy. That dude is straight up right and high, looking good to go. Whoa. -ho 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 -ho. Somebody ramps the pro section and flies right on by as they head on down to the finish line. This is going to be, I believe, Westover looking good to go with Randolph. Randolph's right there. Thompson and Owens as well. One more straight, one more turn. The five ride. Westover's going to get on in. The one ride's got to be Hayden Thompson. Westover and Thompson moving on through. More race action coming your way. 15X trying to get on into a semi-main event. Trying to get on into a semi-main event. Wells, Bergelson, Peddler, Smith, and Bulch is in the mix. One more time. In and out of the final turn. Bring it on down the line. Blue still. BMX's Aiden Wells has been looking good. Let's see if we can figure out where that guy is. The three ride is going to be Smith. Smith in the nine. How about Dragon Fire himself out of, out of Texas? Isaac Peddle. 
Yeah, boy. Is that going to be a power light DFR jersey on Oliver Molina coming your way? Herman Nevs is in there. How about Scott and Hoffman? Twinkle Winkle as well. Down to the line. Two of these guys moving on through the 15 and the 1. That's got to be Molina, of course, and Hoffman twice. Hoffman getting her done. Regulators. The 149, motor number 149. Impact is all over the front side of this one. True Dat Bailey is handling business right about now. Bailey looking good to grow. This dude is straight up laying down the laws. They head on down the line. Bailey's going to get on in. The A ride's going to be Hollywood himself. Jet Fausto taking home the two out of opening innovations. Whoo wee. Holy moly, there's a whole lot of ponies on the first straight right about now. That's got to be, I believe, the bad boy, Elizondo. Elizondo's got another buddy on the side, Aaron Blee. It's going to be Blee and Elizondo. The Sharks going to go one and two down the stripe. Number 151, it's got to be the Diesel. Drake Velador, don't waste no time shifting through the gears. This guy's like an 18-wheeler coming on strong. How about all Drake Velador? Velador's got company on the back door. The long hair is rocking and rolling one more time. I'll tell you what, Grady White's been looking good to go. Down to the line. It will be all Darian Inglis. He's going to go. I, I think Inglis and Velador are moving on through. 152, Moto 152, I got the 15 right of Stenson along with the laser himself, Luton, trying to get on in there out of the factory cycle craft camp. One more turn to go. Stenson's in. Lotham is in. They're going to go one and two down the stripe of the 13 ride for the dirt addiction right there as well. That's got to be Johnson. Round two to staging, round two to snaging, man. You snooze, you lose. You sno Well, you know, man. Come on, son. Carbona, Carbona doing it to it. I'll tell you what, he's the block star doing it out of the final turn and coming on down the line. Caden Carbona is going to take home the win. Carbona's in. Followed by, I believe, the 25. That's got to be Hunter Gossage. He'll be moving on through in 1720 as well. We got more big dogs coming your way. DFR all over the front side. What do we got going on? Lopez, Asado, O'Gorman, along with Johnson Sanchez. And here comes company. That's got to be Mr. Mullet Man with a plan. Ca Cavallaro. He's going to take home the top spot, followed by, I believe, that is going to be your national age group number nine of Andrew Sanchez. Yeah, buddy. Demonsta. Factory Vendetta on the front side. That's got to be all Harlow. He's got a bride on the side trying to reel him on in. But Harlow, Baxter, along with Zachary and Jacob Murray and Jacob Reed is in the mix as well. Harlow is going to put it on cruise control and come on down to the line. The L ride is going to be the bride on the side. That's got to be the tree himself doing it to it. Cole Baxter for Aspen last camping. Yeah, buddy. Oh, Hojo himself. Good Lord Almighty. This dude hasn't been in the lead since like 1991. It's going to be all Hojo. Hojo Johnson up on the front side for the factory answer team. He'll take home the tippy top spot. Johnson's in. Followed by, I believe that's going to be the one two ride. How about let's go with a guy by the name of uh, Jason Mickelson? They're going to go one and two. What's that? Oh, in the 15 ride, you're the third and final qualifier in that one. My bad. I was sleeping. 41 to 45. 41 to 45 year olds. What do we got going on? Marchese, Keener, Basket, Iverson, Davis, Haworth, Johnson, and Lance McGuire. He's on the front side. We'll call him Lance Botchler, along with the 71 and the 70 moving on through. That's got to be John Basket in there as well. Haworth and Lance Botchler. More race action coming your way. Corky Gainsford. Oh, yeah. Gainsford's got my buddy Christopher Diaz on the back door. Gainsford and Diaz. Dude, that sounds like a race from like 1988, bro. Gainsford's getting on in there. <laughs> Diaz in there for the two for the factory TNT. Emery Blee, you can't let him run away like that, bro. Those dudes are like factory from the 90s, bro. You got to stay close. Get a rope. What do we got going on in this one? How about we go with number 159? 159? Oh, my good buddy. Swifty O'Gorman doing it to it for the Supercross team. A legend in his own mind. It's got to be O'Gorman. He's going to take on the top spot. Thank you for your service in your 30 years in the Air Force. Then we've got Hexamer. Oh, he's going to be back second round. I love that guy. I don't know. Have you seen Hexamer's wife? What? Some... I don't know. <laughs> What do we got going on? More race action coming your way. Harry, Larry, my good buddy. I'll tell you what, the Hall of Famer taking home the top spot in this one. It'll be Larry. He'll be your qualifying ride. Getting on in there. The Cyclecraft rider getting on to the two. Castle, castle, castle. Second round, man. You snooze, you lose. You know the rules. Get there, be there. Hexamer, 
I love you, man. Welcome back to BMX. Hexamer, he's like... Second round tangent pro am in the gate. Ooh, I'm a little bit louder than y'all. I gotta tone it down a little bit. We've got Elder Lux and Drew Grassy, and Mert and Solano locked, loaded, ready to go. Gates laps down. Good shout out to Merton, but it's Elder on the inside. Let's see what shakes up. Going into turn number one, it's Merton. On point now, you've got Elder in the two spot. Looks like Sala, la, 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 no, taking over the three. Licks and Drew sitting in that four spot right now. You got Hinton in the five and Grassi the six. But it's still the factory Harlow colors of Darren Murren out in front. Might have a shark and two looking to take a bite. One more straight to do it. Looks like it's not going to be happening this round. Back to the finish line. It's going to go Murren for the win. Elder for the two. Solano the three. Licks and Drew the four. Hinton the five. And Grassi scoring up the six. First rack of the pro am man starting to load in the gate right now. You've got Sanchez, Winkle, Harlow, Keller, and Elizondo. I know a couple of the guys, those guys just finished up round one of Expert. I think they might still be making their way over there. I know it's a hot one. It's definitely a little bit tougher going back to back and heat like this. Man, Peter, now that we waited for you, you got to do something cool out there. I want to see a backflip 360, something with a little extra flair. Give Justin a good shot for pull BMX. Looks like it's Peter Cho with the whole shot in this one. He got the local boy, Max Austin, sitting in the two spot. Looks like the monster, Harlow, sitting in the three. Max Austin put, looking to put something together down the second straightaway. But it's still Elizondo on the inside. Now Harlow looking to stick a tire in, little side-by-side -side down the third straightaway. Harlow finds one. Let's see if he can make a move on Austin going into three. Not quite. 
Back to the stripe. It's going to be the factory bombshell ride of Max Austin picking up the low point win. Harlow's going to get the two. Elizondo the three. Sanchez getting the four. Second rack up in the gate. You've got Oliver Molina, Lucas Howes, Garrity Scott, Chevy Hoffman, and True Dat, True Bailey. Looks like it's the pro right of house. Not anymore. Getting pulled by True Bailey down the first straightaway. It's Bailey on that top spot. House sliding back to the two. Three rounds of total points going on for the pro and man. Top eight going to the main event. Right now still True Dat. Bailey House holding on to the two spot. Hoffman looking for a way up into the mix. Molina sitting back in the four. Down the final straightaway, it's going to be Bailey with the one. House picking up the two. Hoffman the three. Molina the four. Scott the five. Back to the amateur race in action. We got the six and under Navis. We put six and seven together. Put five riders out onto the track. Top four going on to the main event. Looks like you've got Mejia, Chadwick, Kanashigi, Gannon, Dissert, and Woldridge. It's Liam Dissert on the top spot right now. Looking to be one of four riders moving on. Blaine Woldridge sitting in that two spot right now. You got the 96 of Hero Baxter. I oh, know Hero already qualified. That's a 93 of Mejia in the three spot. But again, looking for four to go straight to that six and under main event. It's going to be Dissert, Woldridge, Mejia, and the 11 ride. A break and Chadwick with that final qualifying spot. Out of Moto 6, 7 combined. We've got Moto 8 bringing it back around. Three riders on the track. Two of them going to the 7 8 open main event. Little rubbing going on in three. Drag race down the final straightaway. It's going to be Joseph Antonio and the 16 ride of Cameron Steed moving on out of Moto number 8. Nines the Moto on the track now, bringing it back out of that second turn. Looks like it's the 56 ride of Gavin Petrucci on the top spot. Join us from Peoria, Arizona. Looking for two riders to move on to a semi-main event. Back to the stripe. Gavin Petrucci is picking up that first qualifying spot. Second one's going to go to Nico Marchese out of Moto9. Second rack of 9-10 mixed open on the track. Is that a little salami out in front? None of this one. It's Sedano bringing it back out of that final turn. She's getting that top qualifying spot. Your second qualifier is going to be Peter Pfeffes out of 10. Third and final rack of the 9-10 mixed open. Last two going to the semi-main event. You've got Kayla Gannon and Bo Lothan battling for that one spot right now. Mackenzie Gilliam has some work to make up in the three. Final straightaway race in action looks like it's going to be Bo Lothan. And the one of Kayla Gannon moving on out of moto number 11. Moving on to moto number 12, first rack of 11-12 mixed open. Top two going to the main event. You've got Hope Novaro, Caden Brown, Brennan Collins, Wrigley Lloyd, and Crazy Brooke Walski. Looks like it's Walski on point right now. Navarro sitting into the two spot, doing it for the LSG crew. Hope, why'd you skip out on the parade lap? Was it too hot this morning? I know it's a little bit toasty out. Doing the parade lap's cool. Well, back to the finish line, it's going to be Walski 
And Navarro moving on out of Moto 12. We've got Moto 13 on the track. Looks like Callum Hafner on point right now. You've got Athena Crash doing it in the two spot, doing it for the fall race crew. New rider trying to slide a tire in. Uh-oh, Dune on the move, takes over the top spot. Now a drag race for the two. It's going to be Dune. And Hafner holding on at the line, moving on out of Moto 13. Right now it's the 45 ride of Caleb Sands out in front. Looking to be one of two riders moving on to a 13-14 mixed open main event. Back to the line it is going to be Caleb Sands. And Daisy Robinson moving on out of Moto 14. 15's on the track now, second rack at 13-14 mixed open. It's Riley Smith out in front. Michael Pfeffis sitting in the two. Got one turn, one straight away to go. Smith keeping it solid and smooth out in front. She's going to go ahead and bring it back to the finish line for that first transfer. And your second will be Michael Pfeffis out of Moto 15. Uh oh, a little move being made for that three spot. Can't quite make it stick. Right now it's Kay Thompson. Out in front, doing it for the Acme crew. Got three spots available in this one. Time to find out who's the odd man out, bringing it back. It's going to be Thompson moving on along with David Hall. And that last spot's going to go to the 64 of Brody Young at the line. Right now you've got the 10 right of Jay Jackson, the third out in front. Just like in that last one, top three, moving on to the main event. Right now, it's Jackson the third. Little move being made. It's going to be Hafner, Jackson, and the local guy, Chris Wright, getting a spot to that 31 and over mixed open main event. On to some expert open race in action. You've got Max and Ayers, Rowan Tucker, and Dean Ryman. It's Ayers bringing it back out of turn number three. He's going to take that first transfer spot. Second transfers going to be Dean O'Ryman out of Moto 18. Got Moto 19 on track now. A little move being made. It's now Cade Gannon taking over the top spot. But don't worry, man. We still got room for two. If you qualify first or second, doesn't matter. You still go to the main event. Bringing it back to the stripe. It's going to be... Cade Cannon and, ooh, little slip there, but Hayden Hedges is still going to go out of Moto 19. Bringing it back in Moto number 20. Looks like it's the Ripper boy, Gage Hartley. Got to see him a lot out here for state qualifiers and state finals in the past. Good to see him back out here for the national. He's going to take that top qualifying spot to a semi-main event. And Harrison Dixon's going to join him there out of Moto 20. Bringing it back out of turn number two, it's the speed goat. Jeremiah Thompson on the top spot. I'm seeing the DFR power light colors of Hunter Ashford sitting in the two spot. Everyone's looking to do some shopping. Everyone forgets their wallet at home. It's going to be Jeremiah Thompson and Hunter Ashford moving on out of Moto 21. We've got 22 on the track right now. you got McIntosh, McNiven. And Sodi. It's Ray on point right now. Looks like Carter McNiven sitting in the two spot again. Only have room for two riders in that 9 10 and open semi main event. Those two riders will be Ray Soda and Carter McNiven out of 22. I'm seeing a 3 and a 14, so that means it's Mason Gibson out in front. With Dylan Marchese in the two spot. Both of those guys have a little space, have some breathing room coming back down that final straightaway, moving straight to an 11 12 open main event. It is going to be Gibson and Marchese moving on out of 23. Looks like it's Bowden Bryson out in front right now, another Colorado boy looking for a place in the main event. Last straight race in action. It is going to be Bowden Bryson in the J-Ride of the Bulldog, Rufino Cordova, moving on 
out of 24. Looks like we're picking up some pieces over there in turn one. Lost somebody over the triple. Hearing a little cheering. Does that mean he's back up? If he is, you guys can make some more noise than that. But bringing it back, it's Shane Mathias styling it up back to the finish line. Followed by Jackson Gibson. Those two are going to go to the 13-14 Open main event. You had a Moto 25. I heard a let's go Gavin. Is that Gavin down over there? In the gate? That's Gavin Lewis. We got a couple Gavins. I know it's a hot day, but don't be afraid to walk out in the parking lot. We've got all kinds of amazing vendors here. We've got Tantra Pro Shop in the house, skewed bikes, selling all kinds of cool jerseys and pants. Saw for sale sign out front over there as well. Don't know what the sale was for, but you need to go over there and check it out yourself. <laughs> if you're looking to stay loose and do some gate starts, I know Snapgate has their whole setup over there. We've also got Pro Start in the house. If you're looking to soup up your local tracks BMX game, make sure to hit up Pro Start. Check them out. Of course, we've also got our food truck vendors on the inside of the fence right over here behind me at the finish line. You guys could do better than that. I hear more noise at the local races. Come on. Both down riders back up. I hate seeing them go down, but I love it when they get back up. Hey, give it up one more time for Dason Knight as he brings it back around. Luckily, this is still just open. He's got a chance to make it in class later on today. Looks like the bike's working fine. Body's working fine. Well, now we're on to the second rack of 13, 14 mixed open. Looks like it's a 23 ride of Maddox Perry bringing it back around right now. You've got Ian Herman sitting in the two spot. Again, even though we've got five riders out there, only two of them moving on straight to the main event. And bringing that back, it is going to be Maddox Perry and Ian Herman, Adamoto 26. It's Jet Hollywood Fasto out in front right now. You've got Isaac, the Fire Dragon pedal, knocking on the door in the two. Nothing doing right now. Single file style back to the finish line. It's going to be Jet Fasto and the Fire Dragon. Isaac pedal moving on. Out of 27. Well, you've got the monster Shane Harlow picking on the young kids out in front right now. Everybody else just now finishing high school, doing their junior year. Shane's already married with kids. He's still beating you guys out there, but bringing it back, it's Kerry McGreedy, Coulter Busk, and the monster Shane Harlow moving on to the main event. Adam Moto 28. Last rack of open on the track. I'm seeing Chris Knapp on point right now. Looks like Casey McNiven on the move right now. He doesn't want to save it for the main event. He wants to settle it right now. Who's quicker? Chris, you should have sat down. You gave him confidence. Now it's going to make it that much harder in the main event. It's going to be McNiven and Knapp moving on. Adam Moto 29. On to some girls cruiser race in action. You got Zarin, Gonzalez, Edmonds, and Martin. It's the 0-9 ride of Joy, Joy, Joy Gonzalez. Out in front right now, there's two more that are going to join her in the main event as long as she keeps it clean back to the finish line. And it looks like she will. It's going to be Joy Gonzalez taking that top qualifying spot. Second's going to Skylar Martin. And your third and final qualifier will be Zobair. Zoe Zarin, Adam Moto 30. 
Is this a boat ride going on right now in the 910 Girls Cruiser class? Gotta love to have a Friday boat ride. Start the day off in the main event. Don't have to work too hard. Well, Leah Hedberg's moving on. Kayla Gannon's moving on. And Harper Wilson's moving on out of Moto 31. No boat ride going on here. Top four going on straight to the main event. And back to the stripe. Looks like it's going to be Avon Beatty, Taya Mathias, Joanna Moody, and Kylie Sarkin moving on out of Moto 32. Looks like it's a Tiger Lily. Lily Hayden getting it done. And in the one, joined by the possum, Emily Wells in the two. Both of those ladies are moving on to the 1314 Girls Cruiser main event. Moving on to the 15, 16 girls. Good move. Adam Meyer in turn number two. Let's see if she can keep the door closed all the way to the finish line. Great battle going on, but it's still the little savage Briella Barrett out in front. She's going to bring it back to the finish line. And after a great move in two, Meyer's going to lock it down and move on to the 15, 16 girls cruiser main event. Moving on to the 17, 20 women's cruiser. I'm seeing the alpha colors of Kate Sifford. Out in front right now, looks like Boston Reed in the two spot. They're going to keep it smooth back to the finish line, so it is going to be Kate Sifford and Boston Reed moving on out of Moto 35. Little total points race in action going on here in Moto 36. You've got Carla Crane, Anya Powers, and Megan Hort. Al, you forgot to mark how the total points ended up. Well, right now it's Anya Powers out in front, Carla Crane in the two spot, Megan Hort in the three. And I'm going to look real dumb if I'm wrong, but I'm going to assume that's how they finished up in round number one, single file back to the finish line. It's going to be Anya Powers. I'm guessing with another win in her pocket, Carla Crane will get the two, and Megan Hort the three. Moving on up to the 36 to 40 women's cruisers. I'm seeing Patricia, the bone crusher hedges out in front. Oklahoma S squared colors of Wynama Wells sitting in the two, bringing it back to the finish line. Time to figure out who that third and final rider is moving on to the main event. It is going to be Patricia Hedges, Wynama Wells, and Christine Gannon out of Moto 37. Now onto the 41-45 women's cruiser. You got Mama Cheerheart out in front. Glad to see her moving quick on a bike. She had a little bit of a spill on practice Thursday. Looks like she's all good, going fast out in front, finding her way in the main event, along with the two ride of Cassandra Karen out of Moto 38. Looks like it's LeVan out in front right now. Suzanne Black holding on to the two spot. But Aunt Sizzle, Cindy Partee's on the move on the outside. She finds her way up. One more space on that podium. Back to the stripe. It's going to go LeVan for the win. Partee picking up the two. And Suzanne Black will get the three. Last rack of the ladies' cruisers coming at you. It's the body armor, Paula Maresh, out in front. Is that the fun chick? Oh, no, she's back in the three. It's Amy Lee sitting in the two spot. And Don Beach in the three. Maresh has two points in her pocket right now, looking to get her score a little bit lower after this round. Amy Lee's on the move, though. She got the win in round number one, looking to take it back here down the final straightaway. Time to find out who's been doing their sprints. It's going to be Paula Maresh picking up the win. Amy Lee will get the two. That's going to tie him up at three points apiece for the main event. And the fun chick, Don Beach, with that three, will put her at six points for the main. On to the little tykes on the little bikes. You got Salerno, Hoffman, and Hicks out there right now. Looking for two of them to go straight to the 7 under Cruiser main event. It's Weston Hicks out in front. Looks like the wild child, Abel Hoffman, in the two. Spreading out now down the final straightaway. It is going to be Weston Hicks. Followed by the wild child, Abel Hoffman, moving on. Out of Moto 41. Looks like it's Kid Rock, Roxy McConnell, out in front right now. 
I'm seeing the S squared, Colorado chapter of Adam, the A straighter in the two. I don't remember if Adam was doing balance bike when he started, if he started with five and under. I've known that kid for a long time. It's going to be Kid Rock Rocks and, and Adam, that A straighter moving on, Adam Moto 42. I'm seeing a Lish out in front right now. It's Brian Lish bringing it back out of that final turn. Max Biaggi trying to hold on to the two spot. He's got company coming in a hurry. It's going to be Lish and Biaggi moving on out of Moto 43. It's Cash Nelson out in front right now. Looks like Jace the Ace sitting in the two spot. Maybe now back to the three. Looking for two riders for the eight cruiser main event out of Moto 44, bringing it back. Cash Nelson's going to find his way to the main event along with the NAG 6 of Wade Shirley out of Moto 44. You've got Calvin Cummings out in front right now. Looks like Hurdle sitting in the two spot. Thorpe trying to find a way. He's got one more straight to do it, but it's going to be supersonic Calvin Cummings. Moving on along with the three ride and the flying lion. Leo DeSomber out of Moto 45. It's Alexander Martin out in front of this one. Looks like great move right there. Josh Vega shutting the door hard on Folly. Yeah, it's going to be tough to make it up. He's running out of track. Down that final straightaway, it's going to be the factory battery ride of Alex the Rocket Martin. And Josh the Little Tornado Vega moving on out of Moto 46. We've got 47 on track now. It's the two and the five running one and two. So that's Gage, Takeoff, Thomas, and the squirrely tank, Colin Wooden. They're both sitting in the one, two right now, looking to move on to that 10 year old cruiser main event. These guys don't have to deal with semis, quarters, or any of that fun stuff. They're straight to the main. So it's going to be Gage Thomas and the squirrely tank, Colin Wooden, moving on out of 47. Second rack of 10 year old cruisers. Looks like it's the R ride of Sutton Irwin out in front right now. Alpha Development Ride of the Ripper Boy, Gage Harley, sitting in the two. They're going to bring it back. Looks like Harley's going to try to get a little bit more of a piece of him. He is. It's going to be Harley. And Irwin moving on. And a Moto 48. I'm seeing some factory bombshell colors of Jet, the Red Rocket Hickey, out in front right now, joining us all the way from Canada. Thanks for coming down, Jet. Well, Jet's going to find his way into the main event with a great move right there. Looks like it's going to be the Shark. Zeno Marti Martinez, Snipe, and Eakins out the line, moving on out of Moto 49. So, again, that's going to be Hickey. And Martinez moving on out of Moto 49. Fit, he's the Moto on the track. Now you got Rodney, Wood, Racine, and Dittman. It's going to be Rodney. And Wood bringing it back one and two, moving on to at the 11 year old cruiser main event. Adam Moto Fitty. Fitty wins the moto on the track now. More S squared colors out in front. Looks like it's Kyson Christian getting it done in the one right now. You've got Dylan the slingshot, Stewart in the two. Back to the stripe. It is going to be Kyson Christian. And Dylan Stewart moving on out of Moto 51. 52 on the track now, second rack of 12-year-old cruisers. You've got Lish, Cardenas, Lynn, and Roth. Just like most motos in the heartbreak round, taking two straight to the main. Bringing it back right now, it's going to be Jam and Jake Roth. And Kobe Lish moving on out of Moto 52. 53 is on the track right now. Answer Army Rider Carter, Chappie McCain out in front right now. Grand Junction, local boy. He knows the fast way around here at Grand Valley BMX. It's going to be Carter, Chappie McCain. And Crew Rodney moving on out of Moto 53. I'm seeing Daylight out in front right now. It's Tegan Stiebel on point. You've got Taryn, the Roadrunner Nicholas in the two spot. Tegan setting up wide Roadrunner. Couldn't quite make the move on the inside. Needed another bike length to do it, but bringing it back, it's going to be Stiebel. And Nichols moving on out of Moto 54. Looks like you've got the little bowl, Mason Bowler styling it up out in front. El Fuego, Julian Cumston looking to do a little shopping and two. Couldn't make it happen there. I think he's going to take one more peek out of it out of turn number three. Ah, now he changed his mind, putting it back on cruise control. 
Going to settle in for the two spot. It's going to be Bowler. And comes to moving on out of 55. First rack of 14-year-old cruisers. Second rack of 14 cruiser coming at you. It looks like it's Nielsen and Christopher running one and two. Klein. Not throwing a little style on it. But it's going to be Kyle Nielsen and Kyle Christopher moving on out of Moto 56. Leading the way out of the turn right now. Man, I missed, but I know you got me, Cubs, Gunning. Oh, no, Gunning already qualified. Missed that mark. But coming back to this stripe right now, it's the 724 ride of Brock Beek, followed by the 665 of Daniel Brown moving on out of Moto 57. It's Ryder Robinette out in front right now. Looking to be one of two riders moving on to the main event this round. Got a whole lot of company trailing behind him, but Robinette's going to get a spot in the main event, along with the X-Man, Axel Gutman, out of Moto 58. Second rack of 15, Cruisers, new rider sliding into that three spot, still has a lot of ground to make up if he wants to be one of the top two moving on to that 15-year-old Cruiser main event. Bringing it back right now, it's going to be Aiden Wells side-by-side side with Hayden Thompson, both of them getting spots in that 15-year-old Cruiser main event. Franson taking the high road right there, looking to move on to the 16-year-old cruiser main event, taking two of them. Well, you got Steven Power on the inside, doing a little shopping on Franson now. They decided to play it friendly. They're going to save that move for the main event. Just want to let them know we did have it in the bag. So it's going to be Franson and Oliver Power moving on out of 60. Y'all good, Devin? That doesn't look like too much fun. Well, we got three riders that stayed upright coming back at you. It's going to be Brendan Johnson, Greg Scott, and Grady White moving on. Hopefully, Devin Porcell is all right. Y'all good, Devin? There we go. Hey, come on, guys. Show Devin some love as he walks it off. Here comes a little total points race in action. It's Jacob Cavallero picking up the win this round. Dustin Tabor will pick up the two. And Dustin Lucas will get the three. Moving on up to the 36 to 40 year old cruisers. We took two in the first round of qualifying. We're taking two more this round. We're left with Makeham, Rugels, and Jackson the third. It's your current Gold Cup champion, Big Mike. Mike Meekham out in front right now. Newell Ruggles sitting in that two spot. Y'all good, Jay? Too much horsepower? What's going on? Ah, checking on the bike, seeing if something's wrong with it. It's going to be Meekum and Rugels moving on out of 63. Hey, don't worry, Jay. You can take that over to the Tanger Pro Shop. They'll get it strained out for you. Right now, it's El Jefe. Joel Marchese bringing it back out of turn number three. It's underneath your cleat. What, you got something stuck in your shoe? Marchese's moving on, and Mark Johnson's moving on at 64. Did the whole pedal come off? What's going on? Nice. Yeah, it's a lot better when that thing's attached to the crank. Good luck getting that thing off. You might need a hand or a wrench, a screwdriver, something a little fancier. But back to the finish line right now, it's Gene Ferris moving along. I see Emery Blee moving on, James Buchan's moving on, and Chris Knapp moving on out of Moto 65. It's Hexamer out in front right now, looking to be two, one of two riders moving on to that 51-55 Cruiser main event. Bringing it back at still all fall wrist colors of Ken Hexamer back to the stripe. He's going to move on along with Ken Quintana. Out of Moto 66. You know, I didn't see you up there for round one, Big Daddy. I knew you'd be out here leading for round two. You've got one of the legends of BMX, Eric Roop, out in front right now. He always likes skipping round one. I don't know, fewer laps, saving the energy, going fast in the main. Hey, Roop's going on. Looks like Frank Pruce is moving on. And the 33 rider, Joel Turbeville, is moving on. 
Adamoto 67. Back to the Little Tykes. Little Bikes. You've got Bacaro, Hurdle, and Hicks running one, two, and three right now. Two of them moving straight to a five and under novice main event. Again, it's June Hurdle out in front right now. Jack Bacaro sitting in the two spot. Do you want me to hot mic you, or what are you thinking, Al? That means I gave it to you where it's live. Thank you, Al. No, thank you. Thank you. I love you, kind of man. It is all good. It is all good. Man, I tell you what, sign that dude up. Holy moly, I was getting all jazz and giddy. The 14 ride is going to get on through as well. Hurdle's going to go with his buddy, Spence. You're okay in my book. I don't care what they say. I don't care what they say. I'll tell you what, man, that guy's whole goal in life is to keep kids on the right track. That's why I kind of love him. I'm serious, Spence. And because you give me my lanes all the time. <laughs> so what do we got going on? We got more little tykes on little bikes coming your way today. And I'll tell you what, it looks like this is going to be more number 69 coming on strong. I think I got the 276 leading the scene in this one. That's going to be Red Edmonds. Edmonds is going to get on in there, no doubt about it. Followed by the 185. That's going to be Eric Cunningham trying to come on through as well. They're going to be moving on through. Mary, yeah, Mary, Mary. Let's get it on. Down to the stripe, the 291. Mary's going to come on through for Valor BMX. We'll see her next time. We got one down, two down. They're dropping like my Bitcoin stock right now down the rhythm section. But we got one guy who's, oh, man, you guys got to get on it. There's a spot up for grabs, y'all. There's a spot up for grabs, y'all. What do we got? It's going to be Axel. Axel's going to get on in there. The tippy top spot. Check out this dude. He jumps off the bike. He's going to run it. Run it. You got all kinds of guys coming. Pedal, pedal, pedal. What do we got coming your way? Moto 70 and Moto 71 here on the third straight. It's all good. In and out of the final turn. Coming on down to the line. What do we got going on? I'll tell you what. Yeah, buddy. One of these guys. Two of these guys going on. The main. Actually, three of the five are going on the main. We gotta, gotta figure it on out as they come on down the stripe. So your second qualifier, the 239, he's going on through. That's gotta be more. More's gonna get on in. The 11's gonna get on in, and the 839. The 11, oh, that was Nap. The 39 was that Mason Moore? Shoo wee. Man, 839. That was uh, the Z Tornado Hargrove. Man, that was two motos, Jen. You're amazing. I don't know how you do that trash. So good, so good. Oh man. Yee-hoo! So, what do we got going on? More race action coming your way. Ten-year-old novices are on the track and on attack right now as they come on down the stripe. Who's going to be your whole shot here on this one? Two of these ten-year-old novices are going to be heading on to the main event out here at Grand Valley. That's right, I said it, at Grand Valley. It is all good. Grand Junction, Colorado coming your way today. I tell you what, BMX is in the hizzy right now as we come on down the stripe. It's still going to be, I believe, 10-year-old mo novices in motos number 72 bringing it on down the stripe. So what do we got as they come out of the final turn, bring it on down the stripe. It's still going to be the big dog up on the tippy top side of this one as he comes on down to the line. That's got to be the 008, that is. 69 moving on through as well. It's going to be Urban. Urban's getting on in there along with Xander Diesbin in 14 Novice. More Novice race action coming your way to these guys. Moving on through. It's going to be Ryan Diesbin, Kelly. Are they you guys in the mix right about now? Is that going to be Crane old No Breaks himself? Is that going to be you, buddy? It is all good. Dressed in black as he comes on down to the line. He's going to get on in there on the 115 ride. 116 ride. So it looks like Crane's going to be moving on through with his 141. That's got to be D's been. D's been. Oh, man, I have no idea. No idea. I, I literally jumped it because I didn't see any of them. I got a 63 ride with Lehan. No, it's going to be, I believe, woo -hoo -hoo. I don't know that second qualifier in there. Oh, yeah. Yee-hoo. La 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 la. Well, where are we going tonight to watch the UFC fights? Winkles or something like that? Winkleman's? 
Is it tonight or tomorrow night? I think it's tomorrow. What tonight? All right, I trust your skills, son. You know, Wall's a good kid, man. All that social media stuff he gets doing. But, uh, Jim, if you're uh, listening, just want to let you know, I owe you one from the Grands in uh, 2002, buddy. Just a quick reminder. Just a quick reminder, buddy. Dun, 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 dun. Man, what a great day out here at Grand Valley. You know, we've been kind of on a, a little journey ourselves, driving out here from California, stopped at a bunch of the local skate parks, tracks, and trails. So good. Stopped on by the uh, Rad Canyon in Utah. Moto 72, Moto 72 to the top of the hill, Moto 72. Three, two, one, bang. Moto 72, Moto 72 to the top of the hill. Brody Richard and Summer and Brian Cooper. Summer and Brian Cooper along with uh, Bora. Gabriel Bora, you guys should be at the top of the hill real quick here, guys. Let's get this thing figured on out, because that's what we do. That's what we do. So we got more race action coming your way right now. What do we got going on? It's going to be a little guy charging hard, the 9-3 ride, trying to get on in there as well. So I'll tell you what we got going on. We got little guys coming on strong. Intermediate riders are all over the tippy-top side of this one. They bring it on down to the line. The little guy up on the front side, 93, sitting on the back door saying, knock, 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 knock. I'm going to come on in and play. Today's got to be Meha. Meha down to the line, down the stripe. One more time, Adams is going to get on in. Then we've got the 93 right. That's got to be Meha, followed by Coda. They're going to go one, two, and three. Oh, yes. Drink water, y'all. Drink water. Drink water, y'all. Drink water. That's right. I said it. More race action coming your way out here. Oh, yes. Call this guy a Tide Pod because he is straight up on the spin cycle right about now. Shoo-wee. Check out the little guy coming your way. That's got to be, I believe, Cannon's going to go on in. The 93, the 41, and the 1. The 93, the 41, and the 1 moving on through as well. That's got to be, I believe, Woodridge. And Carell is in. <laughs> yeah, buddy. I got a bright light up on the front side of this one. I got a bright light up on the front side of this one. This time it's going to be number 79, guys. Number 79, seven-year-old intermediates, seven-year-old intermediates. Oh, uh, trying to bring fame to the name right about now. What do we got going on? Is that going to be Curly Fry bringing it on back your way? Or how about we go with young Leona, the 99, the 28, getting on in there. That's going to be Salerno. Salerno in the mix. Lynn as well moving on through. We are on number 80 now, guys. We are on number 80. And I tell you what, I got an alpha flag flying high in the first turn. An alpha flag is flying high in the first turn. So Kudo Crane. Here comes Thomas D. Johnson is in there full throttle as well. They're going to head on into turn two. What do we got going on? This lead ride guy is spinning to win right about now as he turns and burns. That guy is going to come on through. The 1-8 ride is that going to be Zahern. Zahern was looking good in the earlier motors, but Steed is in there as well. That's right. Get some. Cameron Steed that is for the Impact Academy. We got four of these guys moving on through in today's main event. Five of them are on the course right about now. Out of the final turn. Coming on down the stripe. What do we got going on? Steed is going to get on in. He's going to be a qualified ride. Then he has got company coming. 32, 40, and 28. The 28 Johnson, the 32 Koodle, the 40, of course, is the fire. He's Crane. He was signed, sealed, and delivered. Nine-year-old intermediates now, guys. Nine-year-old intermediates in and out of the first turn. Bring it on down the line. Gilman, Brown. Here comes Hurdle. Hurdle's got a little something, something in the gas tank for these nine-year-old intermediates. Jackson and Gillum as well. Gillum's out of Colorado. He's another local boy looking good to go. Two of these guys moving on through in the nine-year-old intermediate. Main event as they head on down the stripe. I got a 1-6 ride followed by your Gold Cup 3. So Gilliam is in. Gilliam's looking good to go. His Gold Cup rider is trying to find a fast line right about now as they head on in the final turn. One more to go. Down to the line. Nine-year-old intermediates. Check out Mackenzie Gilliam in motor number 88 down to the stripe gold cup three at the line is he gonna get it Yahtzee the three ride I don't have him on the sheet 
We're moving on now to moment number 82, guys. We're now on to moment number 82. Callejo, Fahil, Linares, and Vega are out of here. Marchese and Pitarucci's in here as well. In and out of turn two, bringing it on back our way. What do we got going on? I've still got a three ride looking good to go. Is that going to be Marchese? No, he's got the D on his plate. So that could be the dill pickle along with Landon Callejo. Callejo's out of old LV, Las Vegas, Nevada. Two of these guys moving on through the nine-year-old intermediates. Oh, uh, yes. He's going to put the power to the pedal and get on in for the win. If it holds, 5, 6, 39, moving on through. You know that's got to belong to Young. Petrucci is getting on in there, along with the 39. Was that going to be dead set Tiki? Looks like it, Laverne, California. 10-year-old intermediates now. 10-year-old intermediates now coming your way. What do we got going on? Ah, oh, yes. These guys are straight up mobbing through the hood right about now. Check out the race action going into two. We got three 10-year-old intermediates going on into the main event right about now. You know PD. FIFAS is going to be one of them out of old Denver, Colorado. The Mile High kids coming your way today. FIFA is up on the tippy top side of this one as he comes out of the final turn. Going to roll his wrist and get on the throttle in a little bit, if you know what I mean. It's going to be all Peter. Wire to wire, coast to coast. He has still got the 39 right on the back door trying to get on in there. That's got to be Kaysen. And then the 60 ride. How about we go the guy by the name of Mason Howarth out of Salt Lake City, Utah. 11-year-old intermediates. More of these guys coming your way right now. More of these guys coming your way. This time we're going to be taking four of these guys on through into the main event. We're going to pick up your lead ride guy, Davis, Collins, Romero, Calejo, along with Warner. That's got to be Lightning himself bringing it on back. So out of turn number two, bringing it on down to the line. What do we got going on? It looks like it's still going to be, I believe, young Calejo trying to reel under Romero and Collins. And then Davis is in the mix. Warner, he's got one signed, sealed, and delivered as they come on down to the line. Yeah, buddy, running away. The breakaway, 47, moving on through. You know, it's going to be Collins. Collins is going to get on in. So it's going to break on down. Warner's in. Romero's in. That's got to be old Red himself for positive impact at a New Mexico and Blake Davis. 12-year-old intermediates now are on the track. 12-year-old intermediates now are on the track. I got three of these guys trying to fill two spots. The Jet and the Bad Boy Brown coming your way today. But I'll tell you what, the peak... The peak performance, Biolab Rider trying to get on in right about now. Trying to get on in. Here comes Jet, Jet Meyer looking for a little something, something, a little gas tank action right about now as he heads into the final turn. Oh, Are you kidding me? It's going to be the bad boy, the Biolab Ride. He's going to thread the needle down to the line. Yahtzee. It looks like Biolab's going to get on in. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way this time. It's going to be moment number 13. Oh, my bad. Moment number 86. 13-year-old intermediates today. It is all good. You shaking your tail feather out there? Shoo-wee. I love it. It is all good. What do we got going on? Billings Reed. Here comes company as well. That's got to be Michael's little brother just made it out of Denver, Colorado. And then Randolph is in the mix as well. In and out of the back turn coming your way. The one, two, six ride. Big bad Michael. He's on the tippy top spot right about now. He's still got Razzle Dazzle. And here comes the dominator. Billings. Billings. Billings is trying to find a little something, something right about now. But I'll tell you what, the Stay Strong Rider out of Las Cruces, he could be your second qualifier. Razzle Dazzle, Razzle Dazzle. Yeah, buddy, Dazzle's going to get on in, no doubt about it. He'll be your second qualifier in that one. But he had a hard charge coming his way. The 14-year-old intermediates now around the course and looking good to go as they head on into the first turn. Little Squishy himself, the Iron Man out of Buckeye, Arizona, trying to get on in right now. But he has got some serious hard charging coming his way. Cups and Trenton Klein, the peak performance by a lab ride, trying to get on in there as well. They're going to get on into the second turn second turn and I'll tell you what Trent and Klein this guy is on the pony and riding and I ain't playing no games he's got squishy on the back door so it's going to go Trent and Klein and here comes Caleb Sayers one and two so you got Arizona and Tempe Arizona doing the dance right about now two of these AZ kids running away from the heat coming to Colorado to get on into the main event Motor number 88 now. Motor number 88 now. Doing it to it. Remember, and K. Kyle Bennett, White Dodge. What do we got? The dude Brown. He's looking good to go as well. First turn race action. I got a whole shot hero coming your way. It could be out of Cortez, Colorado. William White. White trying to run away like a big old linebacker right about now. He's got Mayhem National Team Key of Dodge in the mix along with the dude himself. They're going to come out of turn two. The four ride coming your way today. What do we got going on? That one could be White. Yep. Brown in there as well. Oh, yeah. He He's got a bright light. Check out some race action coming out of the final turn. We might have a full pull down to the stripe. It's still going to be, I believe, the 4-6 ride. Brown's going to get on in the 49 and the 48 going on through. So white and brown, white and brown. Sounds like my crayons. 
So we're moving on now. 15-year-old intermediates. 15-year-old intermediates are on the track looking good to go. Oh, check out this dude. I'll tell you what. Six foot three and a ton of fun coming out of turn two. Yeah, buddy. He's going to lay down the ponies right about now. Is that going to be a haul and haul haul? Yep. No doubt about it. Eclipse BMX is up on the tippy top side of this one in a fine tune. He is singing. It's going to be all haul. Hall's going to get the deal. American Fork, Utah coming your way today. Hall is in. The second qualifier, the final qualifier. No, there's three of these guys. 35 moving on through as well. So, you know, Stearman and Trey Press are moving on through. The local yokel out of Grand Junction, Colorado. 16-year-old intermediates, 16-year-old intermediates. Now, I'll tell you what, this guy is straight spinning to win right about now. Meyer and Young, along with Axeman, coming your way. Yeah, buddy. I'll tell you what, this dude ain't chopping wood, but he is the Axeman. It's all good. Coming out of the turn and bringing it on back your way. What do we got going on? The lead ride guys at the 41. Axeman trying to reel them on in right now. They got one more turn to go. And then we got Young and Brayer doing the dance as well. Out of the final turn, your king of rocks is going to take home the top spot, followed by Brody Young into three. The Axeman for two, Isabel Meyer. She we teaching class, son. 17. Oh, Nelly. That 17 to 20 year old intermediate just released the sandbags as he jumped the dubs. Looking good to go. Holy moly, are you kidding me? That guy was straight up riding like Cheech and Chong. He was getting up there. Porcella, Loreno, along with straight face Jones coming your way out of the final turn. This dude's getting way high. It is all good. How about Loreno? He's going to be moving on through the 54 ride. That's got to be straight face Jones in there for the two. We're moving on now. What do we got going on this time? It's going to be, I believe, more number 92, guys. Number 92, 26 to 35 year old intermediate riders I've got pinned. Stidham and Panda Hort coming your way. Out of the final turn, the two rides got to be, I believe, Drew Panda Hort. He'll take home the top spot, no doubt about it. Followed by the 26, Steve Stidham for Sparta Racing out of AZ. 36 to 40 year old intermediate riders are on the track right about now. This is going to be one number 93, I believe, guys. One number 93. So they're going to come out of the final turn, bring it on down to the light. It's going to be your gold cup number three rather. It's got to be Hedges. Oh, yeah. Hedges. Iron Man's BMX Army is up on the front side. Yoo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Man. So it looks like Wooten and Jackson are in, if you ask me. Cody Hafner looks like you'll be sitting it out. We're moving on now. What do we got going on in 46 to 50 year old intermediate class? 46 to 50 year old intermediates. This time it's going to be motor 94. 94 guys in and out of the final turn rail on the trails. It's going to be right Cutler. Cutler along with I believe Eaton and Tullin is in there as well. So it's going to break on down like this. Eaton is in. The 31 is in. And the 243. Cutler is in. Cutler is in. Motor. Oh. Number 72, guys. Number 72 is on the course. Number 72, guys, is on the course. I got the 013 up on the front side. Yeah, buddy. Check out this dude. Are you kidding me? He's going to try and hold on, but he's got all kinds of drama on the back door. That has got to be Richard. They call him the attorney. Oh, no. The attorney getting squirrely out about now. He's going to have to amend the law. The 235 getting on in there as well. Cooper's in. The attorney, you are in. We're moving on now. What do we got coming your way? Oh, yes, the little ones. I love it. Welcome to the, well, you know. It's going to be the five-year-old girls coming your way today. What do we got going on? How about Riley Old Sassy Pants won the last one? Chadwick and Brindley, they're in the mix as well. They're going to head on down into the final turn right now and bring it on down to the line to tell you what Denver, Colorado straight up represent. But can anybody beat her? Can anybody hope to contain her? It's got to be all Sassy Pants coming on down to the line. Your national age group number five, Riley. Johnson's going to get on in for the win, followed by the nine. Riley's got to be Brindley. They're going to go one and two. One and two, followed by Skittles herself. Little Chadwick. Chadwick. Seven-year-old girls are coming your way right now. What do we got going on in this one? <laughs> this is a combined race action coming your way. Four of these gals moving on through. One of them's going to have to pack her bags and head home. The king of rock, holidays in. The two, the R, and the 13 is that Hart is going to go in. The R's got to be Gonzalez as well. More race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? The 98. More number 98. Eight-year-old young ladies are on the course. They're heading on in the final turn. It's got to be Zoe Bear along with Charlie Gay. And here comes uh, young Sky Sky Martin as well. The Albies ride up on the front side. That's got to be G Charlie Gay going to get on in there. Followed by the two. Sky Sky Martin. Sky Sky Martin. 
More race action coming your way. What do we got going on? Oh, yes. Kayla Gannon. Gannon showing you how she got that number one on that plate out of Broomfield, Colorado. Yeah, girl. They just got a new pump track, by the way. It's going to be all Gannon. Gannon's going to get on in. Four of these riders moving on through as they come on down to the line. So it looks like it's going to be Supergirl. Sedano's going to get on in. Lair Hegberg is going to move on through as well with Meha. More ladies on the course right now. Ten-year-old young ladies are leading the singing of this one. Zoe Boogie, Harpoon. Here comes Goose as well. In and out of the final turn. Two of them moving on through. Two of them moving on through. It's going to be your current reigning defending national age group. Number seven, Barnes are going to take it on home. Followed by the 28 ride of Goose. Chaffe doing it for the factory mom and dad's team. Here comes trouble. The fall wrist team. That's got to be the blue raptor all over the front side. Yep, no doubt about it. The blue raptor looking good to go. She's got a buddy on the back door. That could be the BMX queen, Thornton. Thornton doing it to it. No, how about McGinley? The four moving on through. The one and the 17 as well. The 17 is going to be Thornton. Yeah, the one. How about McGinley and Alvarez? Oh, yeah, good to go. Okay. Dude, I'm, I'm a day off all the time. Oh, Donovan Long's coming your way. I got a three and a two. Looking good to go. Moving on through the three and the two. That's got to be, I believe, Navarro. Navarro's looking good. Cruella's right there as well. We got more young ladies coming your way. How about mode number 105? Four 12 year old expert ladies coming your way. Mode number 104, mode 104. Starkey, Lloyd, along with Keeter and Cardenas trying to get on in. Two of the spots up for grabs right now. Coming down the line. National League number 14 and 27. You know, it's got to be Starkey. The 27, of course, belonging to the punk herself. That's got to be out of Las Vegas, Nevada. Doing it for the moose. My good buddy. Miss him, Wrigley Lloyd, Wrigley Lloyd. More race action coming your way right now. What do we got going on as they head on in the final turn? 13-year-old young ladies, three of these gals moving on through. Three of these gals moving on through. Check out your lead rider in this one, straight up long gone. You know that's got to be Riley Smith. Smith's going to get on in. The nine and the two, the nine and the two. Is that Crane? Crane and uh, Charlie, Charlie girl. Is that you, Basket? Yep. Risen Unlimited out of AZ. Oh, yes. The Taylor up on the front side of Simi Valley, California. The Taylor up on the tippy top side. This one leading the singing. And I'll tell you what, Lottie Dottie, she's going to get on in down to the line, followed by the four ride. That's got to be the Flying Panda going one and two. We're moving on now. More 14 year old young ladies coming your way as they head on in the second turn. Is it? Could it be? Mad Maddie coming your way. No doubt about it. The Factory SE Racing for the Factory Squad. That's got to be all Maddie Braden. Braden to the tippy top side of this one as they come out of the final turn for the SE flag flying high. Todd Lyons, be proud, son. It's going to be all Braden getting on in for the win. She's going to sign, seal, and deliver that one. Followed by young, uh, is that a Hollinger? Yeah, for the Alpha National Team out of Glendale, Arizona. We got more young ladies coming your way. It's got to be Strauss, Hinton, Garcia, along with the bullet. Joseph coming on strong as well. Local Yokel looking good to go. In and out of the final turn. Two of these spots are up for grabs. And I got a two and a one coming your way. Hinton's going to get on in. The bullet is in as well. That's got to be Mickey Joseph going one and two. Number 109. Number 109 now. That has got to be, I believe, man, Palmer. Palmer is so B-A-D-D -D bad. It ain't even funny. Danica's out of this one. Merton. Oh, no. Palmer is straight up way fast. Way smooth. She has got, I believe, the 13 ride. That's going to be uh, Palmer. Oh, oh, S squared and S squared, right? Sheesh. That one's a doozy. That one's stacked. Van, Ren Van Rensselaer. 17, 20 year old young ladies, 17, 20 year old young ladies out of the final turn coming down, down the line. This could be, I believe, one of the Alpha Riders. How about the V8 herself? Sifford's going to take on home the top spot, followed by D Ride. Boston Reed getting on in there. Twenty-one to thirty. Twenty-one to thirty-year-old. We got more number one eleven. More number one eleven. I've got Wilsey Zimmerman. Wilsey Zimmerman. How about Wilsey Zimmerman? Boxwell is in the mix as well. Down to the line. The one-five ride. Wilsey's getting to take home the top spot. The two ride. That's got to be the monkey. How about Zimmerman? Morgan getting on through for the Colorado Mesa University crew. Looking good. What a great opportunity that is, right? It is all good. More number nineteen now. I mean, more number one twelve. Number nineteen coming your way. This is gonna be Pow Wow Powers. Powers to the front side. Bro, you've been working out? Yeah. 
Powers coming out of the final turn, bringing it on down to the line, looking good to go. And I'll tell you what, Anja Powers getting the job done. C-O-B doing it for my buddies over there. And I'll tell you what, Crane's going to get on in there for the two, followed by Jen Iverson, one, two, and three. More race action coming your way. This could be Mama Churhart. I believe it is. Yep, Churhart out of St. Cloud, Minnesota. We keep hearing about those Minnesotas, man. They're crazy out there. It is all good. In and out of the final turn, coming on down to the line. It's going to be Mama Churhart going to get on in out of St. Cloud. Yeah, girl. The 687 ride. You know that's got to be my buddy Cassandra Carone doing it for the Dream Team. Donnie Robinson out of Alameda, California. Susie LeVan. Oh, yeah. My buddy from the day. It is all good. TNT. Where's Mark Zalewski when you'll need him? It's going to be LeVan. LeVan's going to come out of the final turn, bring it on down to the line. Susie doing it to it. Shoo-wee. A legend in the BMX scene. Susie, I love you, man. You're so rad. Marish, the two, LeVan, the one, black on the top spot. More race action coming your way. Oh, yes. We got the experts on the track right about now. Dope. The Daylight Rider bonkles the gate, but he is charging. He's back on the gas. We're going to come back to that one. Let's see what he gets done. We're moving on down. Six-year-old experts coming on down the final stretch right about now. The one-two ride. That's got to be Ryman. Dino. Dino's on the top spot. The one ride's got to be Ayers. So Dino and Ayers, they'll be moving on through in the main event. The Daylight Ride trying to make up some room right now. Seven-year-old experts. What do we got going on? Norcal. Next generation. Ryder Davis. Oh, Davis looking good to go. You know, he's got fall wrist, the Daxonator on the back door. The Daxonator trying to break it on down right now. Seven-year-old expert style, but NorCal, the next generation. I'll tell you what, Lowry and the crew out there, they got something good going on. Davis Murray, you are in the 117. Number 117 now. Is this going to be a Colorado flag flying high, running the S-squared? It is all good. Check out the hard charge coming your way today. This could be, I'll tell you what, Hunt. Hunt's been looking good to go. The BioLab Rider trying to get on in there as well. That's got to be the peak performance kit coming your way. Hoffman trying to find a fast line right now as they come on down the stripe to these seven experts going on to the main event. It's still going to be, I believe, the five ride. Five and the one getting on in. The five and the one that was a uh, hunt going on through. I don't know who the five ride was. The five, a hey, the five rider, you need to get back up to the top of the hill. You jumped in the wrong moto, bro. Five rider, you jumped to the wrong moto. <laughs> you better get up to the top of the hill. I'd run, bro. I would run. Because I'll tell you what, that dude up there, he's kind of grumpy. Oh, he, yeah, he looks scary, too. Shoo wee Look, he went right back up. He's like, I knew it. Those were different dudes. No, I feel you. Now you're going to be tired. Well, give you a second. It's all. Oh, you're on an escort state team, bro. You're all good. You're all good. Is that, is that Huddleston? Oh, don't worry, Gary. Yeah, he don't listen to his mama either. I know. I feel you. No, no, she told him to clean his room before he, they came to the National. No, he didn't do it. What do we got going on? More race action. Oh, my God. Huddleston, are you kidding me? You want to win everything. Holy moly. It is all good. In and out of the first turn. This guy got two whole shots and two motos. Good Lord Almighty. He is all that in a bowl of chili with cheese and macaroni, if you know what I mean. It is all good. So what do we got going on now? Eight-year-old experts are coming your way today. He's going to come in and out of the second turn and bring it on down the line. Two of these guys moving on through. I got a rift ride on the front side. Huddleston's on the back door. So two of these guys moving on through. This is mode number 118. This this is mode number 118. So one more turn to go as they bring it on back. It's still going to be Huddleston trying to reel on in. The big dog on the tippy-top side of this one. The laser show is already long gone. So this has got to be, I believe, the three rides. That could be Cannon and Huddleston moving on through. We have got more number 119, guys. We've got more number 119. I got friends and friends in the list. Here comes Crazy Socks Dixon himself out of Chandler, Arizona. In and out of turn two. Oh, the race for two is going to be up for grabs. I'm just saying it right now. Bianchi's already out of this one as well. So it's Lish and Dixon. And then Fast Lane himself. In and out of the final turn. I told you so. I'll tell you, you could throw a blanket over those two dudes. They are going at it. Your lead ride guy coming on down the line going to be the two. He's going to be Dixon. Dixon is in. The one is going to get on in. Is that going to be the 
grasshopper hopping and skipping and jumping his way to the front side. Brian Lish. Oh, yeah. We got more race action coming your way right about now. One number 120, guys. One number 120. So what do we got going on? And this one is that bring it on down on the stripe. It's still going to be Nelson Knapp. Nelson Knapp and Hedges in and out. Bring it on back. The 21 ride. Is that Hedges? Yes, it is. Hedges is going to get on in the 35 ride. It's going to be Cash Nelson looking good to go as well. We're moving on. I got a Bassett rider up on the front side of this one. And I'll tell you what, this guy's looking good to go. He might be jumping on into the semi-main event. It's got to be, I believe, Meyer. Meyer and Whiteside. Meyer and Whiteside. Here comes Martin. Hort is in the mix as well. One more turn to go. Bring it on down to the line. The sixth ride still going to be Martin. Martin's going to take home the top spot. That's got to be the rocket. The 24 is in as well. Meyer is in. We are on to number 122. Number 122. And I have got the Stingray himself. Oh, Ray Sode out of San Jose, California. Sode up on the tippy top side. Holy moly, I tell you what, this guy is laying down the law. You might want to call him the sheriff. Call him the law. It's going to be Sode in the mix. The one ride is in as well. That's got to be the beast. The beast. We have got one number 123 now. I got a four ride on the front side. How about we go to the bullet train? Burnside. Burnside doing it, dude, for Sisu Racing. Another one of the Fort Collins kids coming on strong. Burnside trying to get on in. I'll tell you what, this one might be up for grabs. I got a Jet Racing ride. Is that going to be jamming Jacks at the line? No doubt about it. Jacks, the new pickup for Jet Racing. Keep your eyes on that guy. More jet racing. It's got to be Zayden McIntosh. I was talking to this guy. No, my bad. Zayden's sitting in the mix. It's going to be the Cyclecraft rider trying to get on in there. That's David Neff. Oh, his dad's a doozy. I love the guy. Neff looking good to go out of Henderson, Nevada. No, out of Erie, Colorado. It's going to be Cyclecraft in the R ride. They're going to be one and two. Dixon, you are moving on as well. David Neff, Erie, Colorado. You are in. Moving on now. What do we got going on? I've got a four ride on the front side of this one. How about we go to Take off. I got Gage Thomas for the regulators out of Kansas. He comes. He's looking good to go. So he's going to head on in the final turn, bring it on down the stripe. It looks like takeoff is taking off right now out of Wichita, Kansas. He's in, followed by the eight ride. Is that going to be the Ripper Boy? Yep, Hartley, you're through as well. The 126, 126. What do we got going on in this one? How about we go with Anthony Agron up on the tippy top side of this one right now? The Biolabs team, I'll tell you what, they're looking new and improved. The leadership of Leha is getting the job done. Agron is up on the tippy top side the five ride sitting in two let's go with Thompson the speed goat himself the speed goat himself that's right I said it young Agron leading the singing out of Tucson Arizona and he's got Montana hopping and skipping and nipping on his heels right about now as they come on down the line 10x 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 you know what we got going on we got the 10 year old experts are on the track and I got Wooten Wooten doing it for Cyclecraft where is Shaughnessy when you need him it's going to be the Cyclecraft ride trying to get on in there right now but he has got to deal with S squared and Rhino powered I got Diane Palmer doing the dance Diane Palmer doing the dance oh we might have some pass like gas coming your way today it's still going to be all two six ride Wooten is in the 12 ride Palmer, the wrecking ball, the wrecking ball. 11X is on the track right now. I have still got Hickey, Marchies, and Luke Dissert coming your way. Dissert was taking a soil sample earlier, but he's back on the track and looking good to go. Hickey, Hickey is in the 1 8 ride. Yeah, buddy. Out of San Mateo, California. Just happens to be where I was born. Yeehoo! Dissert taking it home. What do we got going on? I got a super cross. I got a super cross bike up on the front side right now. That's got to be nowhere looking good to go with Beckett B. Roland coming your way today. One more turn to go. Coming on down to the line. The L ride's going to get on in there. Looks like Tegan's going to take on the win. Roland's going to get on in there for the two. We'll see Leha next time around. I got a four ride. Is that going to be the elite jersey? No doubt about it. Vendetta. Rufio. Rufio Wood coming your way. Jacob Wood is all that and a bowl of chili, man. Out of Rockinland, in California. This guy knows how to straight up rock the party with Eakins. They're going to go one and two. You are in. I got a red jersey flying high right now as they head on deep into turn two. 11-year-old experts trying to get on into a semi-main event. That's got to be Dittman, the killer bee, swarming right about now as they head on into the final turn. Yep, no doubt about it. Crew. Dittman, Impact BMX out of Las Vegas, Nevada, is getting the job done right about now. He's going to come down to the stripe and looking good to go. Diddy's in. Diddy is in. The race for two. It's going to be Yahtzee. It's got to be all Tim Kiefer. Maxwell looking good. 
The double deuces up on the front side of this one belong to Michael Thomas for Sisu Racing out of Thornton, Colorado. Yep, Thomas, big Mike Thomas is leading the singing in this one out of the final turn. This guy is going to get on in, followed by Stewart. They'll be your 12-year-old expert semi-main event qualifiers in that one. We're moving on now. we got more 12-year-old experts in motor number 133, Cordova, Schaefner, Rojas, Rojas, and Bodie Bryson coming your way as well. It's got to be, check out this Supercross. Holy moly, that thing's hotter than my high school girlfriend, Cordova, Schaefer, Rojas. Bryson is in the mix as well. This thing looks smooth as a goose. I wonder if it comes with a battery pack to keep it so bright. Man, the six ride. Schaefer is going to get on in there with a seven as well. That's got to belong to the hitman, Rojas, the privateer out of Redmond, Oregon. Oh, yeah. You know what we got going on for the full tilt team. This has got to be Hulk himself. I said it. Benson Danilio coming on strong out of FLA Florida. It will be the nine ride getting on in there as well. How about we go with Fouts? Fouts for those guys out of Durango. Yep, those dudes. Those dudes. Acme BMX up on the front side. It's got to be Gardner working the field like a pair of crops right about now. It's got to be all Gardner. Gardner Cardenas here comes Jim and Jake Roth. One, two, three. The Jet Racing Riders sitting in the two spot right now. They bring it on down to the line. But out of Richfield, Utah, Gardner. Gardner going to be working it with his green thumb and all. Roth in there for the two. 13-year-old experts, what do we got going on in this one? I'll tell you what, this guy might be Haro mounted, looking good to go. How about Loco trying to get on in? He's on the outside. Loco on the tippy top side. He's going to rail the trail and come on back with a little ponies now. And that's going to be, I believe, the nine in there. The seven and nine. You are the one and nine. Nichols is the road runner. He's doing it for Beamers. And then we got Loco in there as well. Oh, boat ride. Race action coming. Oh, no, not a boat ride. My bad. These guys are just way up on the front side. Vicario, white side. Ashley. Vicario, that dude knows how to ride a bike, man. I ain't playing. He got some Rena fans, too. Canyon Whiteside has got to be Vicario, Hesperia, California. The answer, Army jersey on the front side goes to Chappie. Carter McCain, my favorite McCain. It is all good. Check out Chappie coming your way out of Clifton, Colorado for the Ansi Armor Camp. McCain's got company on the back door, but this guy's got more game than PlayStation. Son, he can get the job done. Chappie going to take it on home, followed by Gavin Waters. They're going to go one and two. One and two, the big guy in and out of the second turn right about now. You know he is straight up repping as he brings it on down. Maddox Shetler. Shetler's out of Northwest BMX. He's doing it to it out of Las Vegas, Nevada. But Shetler is up on the front side trying to get on into the semi-main event. Shetler, man, this guy got a little dog in him, if you know what I mean, man. Shetler's in the 1-8 ride. Right? That's got to be Tafoya. Aiden Ragel. I got stories on this dude. What do we got going on? Heading on in the final turn. He's got to deal with Julian El Fuego sitting in two. It's going to be Ragel Bagel. Bagel Ragel. He is all good in the hood. I'll tell you what, Ragel Bagel going to take home the win. Shao. He just got that brand new bike and it looks sweet. El Fuego in for two out of Rockland, California, out of the NorCal. 141. 141. What? These dudes, these dudes on a boat ride? These dudes on a boat ride? Man, you gotta run it, son. What do we got going on? Keener, Keener along with Iverson and Larkin is coming your way as well. Three of these guys supposed to do. Somebody's over there drinking some snow cones that they got from Dina over there and uh, they missed their moto, man. Oh, have you guys had those snow cone things over there? They're so good. They are so good. It's like lemonade with some cherry in it. Mm, mm, mm. Yummy. Go see Dina. Get yours. They're all good. River Martin, River Larkin going to get on in out of Francis, Utah. No doubt about it. He's going to head on over and keep cool, if you know what I mean. Followed by Pony Boy Iverson for the Gold Coast crew. Number 142 now in and out of the final turn coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? Is this going to be, I believe, uh, Another little uh, cruise control race, Caden Penn. He's going to get on in. Penn's got the double one riders of the Smoky Bear Jacob coming your way at IA. 14X, 14X. Man, I'll tell you what, what a great day out here. Grand Valley BMX, it is all good. It says Grand Mesa on the sign. I just get discombobulated. Show! You owned it, brother. Owned it. 
First name's Crash, right? It worked perfect. I'll tell you what, man. When your parents name you Crash, you know you got a future. It's just, that's just awesome. Yeah. We're checking on our downed rider. Want to make sure he's A-OK and good to go. Hey, guys, just want to remind you to don't forget to stop on by the Instagram page, Pool BMX. It is all good, all the latest and greatest information. If you're listening online and you haven't checked it out lately, definitely stop on by and do so. It is all good. It is all good. Wally World has been out of here, and I'll tell you what, bear in the hot sun, turn it into a lobster for your benefit. For your benefit. Oh, our downed rider is up. Come on, let's get a great big round of applause. Come on, let's hear it, son. Yee. He was out there snoring and napping, taking a little nap. You know, he's like, I'm just going to lay right here and hang out. It's all good, comfy, and cool. Oh. Can, next weekend? Next weekend, we're going to be out at Oak Creek BMX and those West Coasters for the state race getting ready for the state championships out there. That's going to be a doozy. 100 moto, 120 moto state race. I'm calling it. Oak Creek, and then I'm going to Idaho. You going to Idaho? Yeah, I love Idaho. Oh, da da, da da, you know. How about this kid? I'll tell you what. This dude is straight up mobbing through the hood, and I'll tell you what, he's riding that bike like he stole it. Good Lord Almighty. Cutter Gadare. It's got to be all Cutter Fly on the front side of the Mesa, Arizona. This dude is so B A D D bad. It ain't even funny, son. He's the real deal coming your way. Gadare going to fly down to the line and get her done, followed by the 30 ride getting on in there. That's got to be Shake and Bake himself. Big bag of chain doing it for the S squared Colorado kid. 15X, 15X. They're coming in out of turn two. What do we got? I got a bright right. Is that Ryder Robinette? No way. Looking good, son. Yeah, buddy. The Firebird trying to get on in there as well. And they got to deal with a guy by the name of the tightrope. That's got to be Riley Stewart. Stewart coming on strong. So let's go the five ride. Looking good to go. Followed by the 17, Radford and Stewart. More race action coming your way. Is this going to be an alpha flag flying high? And you know what it is. The two ride belong to the Dinger. The Dinger at a Mojave Valley, AZ, Arizona. Oh, check out that dude. He carved up that final turn like it was a Thanksgiving turkey. Holy moly. He has got Omara in two. Man, Omara, that kid knows how to ride a bike. I'll tell you what, teams, keep an eye on that kid. Shoo the 146 Biolab rider. You know what we got going on in this one. Holy moly, are you kidding? This dude's the real deal coming your way today. Ryan Randolph looking good to go. Randolph and Dale Owens going one and two right now. In and out of the final turn coming on down to the line. Owens and Randolph. Owen and Randolph. They're going to go one, two all the way down. Yeah, buddy. Catching a little air to spare. Somebody's going upstairs. Oh, man. We have got some serious hard charging coming your way in number 147 this time around the course. This one's going to be up for grabs. Don't ever count out fall risk. Those guys will blow up anybody. Oh, he stuffed them. What do we got? One more turn to to go in and out of the final turn. There's going to be a full pull down the line. The 99 21. Bergenson is in. Wells is in. Man, Rowdy Balch had a rough one in that one. He had a plan. It just got discombobulated in the last turn. Phew wee. More race action coming your way, and I'll tell you what we got going on in this one. The Stay Strong ride is going to be Twinkle Winkle trying to get on in. He's on the two now, but he's got some company coming. The R ride getting on in there. Scott is in 13. You are in Herman. Scott Pop-Tart looking good, son. More race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? 149. This is number 149. I have got Brocker, Brocker, and Lenners along with Mayfern and Oliver Parr. One, two, and three. Down to the line. It'll be the five ride followed by the double one getting on in. You know that's got to be Elliot and Campbell. Mayburn, they're going to go one and two. The Cobra is in. 1720X17 McCready. Cranking McCready is coming your way. This dude is straight up mobbing. He's got a Colorado kid. Colorado, where are you at? You got one and two. Trying to get on in. In and out of the final turn. Coming on down the line. Kerry McCready is going to come on through. It's going to be McCready is in. The 1 8 is going to be Blee. One number 151 now, guys. One number 151 now. I have got Scott. Scott and the Spartan along with Biscuits and Grady White coming your way today at a Cortez, Colorado. 
One more turn, they go, and I'll tell you what, this guy better lay down a little something, something right about now. The Spartan is in, Al Surin. He's going to take home the time spot, the seven ride. It's got to be Gregory Scott, Dirt Addiction, Dirt Addiction. Oh, yeah, Lottie Dottie. He likes to body. Ethan Robinson out of the NorCal, out of Santa Cruz, California, by way of... Mesa, yeah, it's all good. It'll be Robinson, followed by the one three ride. That's got to be Jumping Johnson. Ethan Robinson, a long way from home, going to school out here and loving it, son. 17, 20 year old experts now. 17, 20 year old experts are coming your way. This guy is GT mounted and looking good to go. The race for two is up for grabs. It's going to be Robinette. Nap. Here comes Coulter. Busk as well. One more turn to go. It's still going to be, I believe, the 247 ride. Busk is going on through to the show, no doubt about it. The K ride is going to be Robinette. Dirt addiction out of Colorado. Colorado. Check out the big dog, Dawson O'Gorman. Oh, man, Darson's got company of coming. That's got to be Evan Asado. Asado and Dawson, three of these guys going on to the main event right about now. But I'll tell you what, Evan Asado is leading the singing. He has got Dawson O'Gorman. They're going to go one and two. Then we have got a bright light, the 269, the 29. That has got to belong to Diego Lopez, Durango, Colorado. I just like saying it. More experts coming your way. More number 155 this time, guys. More number 155 coming your way. So two of these guys moving on into the main event. Looks like we got two of them coming on through right now. So this is going to be, I believe, Zachary Jacob or Jacob Reed. Stay strong. Los Cruz is coming your way. Down to the line, the nine ride. You know Murray's getting on in there. Yeah, Murray, a little style. Looking good to go. He's got the L bike or the seven bike of Jacob Reed. Stay strong. The Bio Lab Rider coming your way in one number 156, guys. One number 156. What do we got in this one? This has got to be, I believe, Reed. Three of these guys moving on through. Reed, look at the race for two. Reed's in, the 10's in, and the 103, your final qualifier, Casey McGibbon is, along with Mad Dog Meyer, is moving on through as well. We're moving on now to number 157, guys. Number 157. What do we got going on in this one? Keener, is that you? Keener, is that you? Out of Wichita, he comes for the No Excuses team. Keith Keener, this guy can ride a bike, man. He's pretty good. It's going to be the double fours. Keener is in. Shao! Keener followed by the 47, the 65, and the N. 65 and the N. 47, Marchese's in. The N is Davis. 65 is Mark Johnson. What do we got going on in this one? Headed on down to the line. I'll tell you what. Gainsford's gone. Diaz is gone. Is that you, Landine? Shut up. Landine, have you even been home in the past four months? Out of Santa Clarita, California. This guy traveled all around the country, went to Europe, hung out, Germany, probably ended up in Mars or Jupiter. This dude's been straight up traveling. Landine is in. The 29, Blee, you are in. Here comes my buddy, Hexamer, the firecracker, blowing up right about now. Hexamer looking good to go. He's got Bane on the back door. Bane and Hexamer, Leha trying to find the fast line to get on by. I don't know if it's going to happen today, bro. It's going to be all Hexamer down to the stripe. Kenny boy, you are all good. You find any Hot Wheels lately, brother? The 1-8 is Bane. Leha, Leha, we got to get a rope and tie it up to those dudes. They're good. They're good. Shoot, man. This dude, I used to have a poster of him up on my bedroom wall when I was 16 years old. When, like, some dudes had, like, you know, Christy Brinkley or whatever. I had Eric Roop. Roop was on my wall. The 33 rides got to be Jaeger. They're going to go one and two. They'll be your qualifiers in that one. <laughs> Oh, man. Rupi was on my wall. He was in mongoose colors. I remember the picture. He had Travis Chippers in there. Man, it was a good poster. It was like 1986 or so, 88. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go.
which is Scott and Keller. Man, you got some full pool in this one. Winkles way fast at a Las Cruces. The local boy, Keller's been on fire. You can't ever count out the pistol. He, he just, man, 50 caliber, man, he's hitting. Stand by. Pro-Am. Shoo. <laughs> Done, done. Last chance. Last chance to qualify. Last chance. Snap, crackle, pop. The gate is long gone, and so are these guys. What do we got going on as they head on into the first turn of Lozano's? Just going to put it on cruise control. We got an F1 design. Uh, Stay Strong Rider trying to find the fast line to get on in. Sanchez, Scott, Keller looking good to go. Elizondo trying to bring it on back right about now. Oh, turn two. Yeah, buddy. All over the tippy-top side of this one. Check out this young gun. It's still going to be Keller. Keller and Scott looking good to go. Sanchez in the mix. Winkle, Elizondo still sitting in three and four right now as they head on down to the line. It's still going to be I believe taking it home the 419 Elizondo getting on in there with the nine ride Sanchez for the three followed by the R ride belonging to Scott and the three of young Winkle more pro-am guys locked in low in the gate getting ready to go right now Hoffman Bailey Harlow Howes Molina The gate goes down one more time. I got a couple 16 and 17 year olds trying to reel on in the old man in this one. Harlow and Howes. Harlow and Howes. Let's see if the old guys can represent impact. Up on the front side. Didn't take them long to get there. You know that's got to be the national 81 and 42. That's got to be Howes and Harlow looking good to go. In and out of turn two. Bringing it on back our way. Harlow stuck in three now trying to battle his way back. Here comes Bailey. Bailey and Hoffman. That's got to be I believe Chevy Hoffman looking good to go. He's a regulator's ride as well. One more turn to go. Coming on down to the line. Looks like it's still going to be Harlow hanging up in three. 67, the Supercross rider. So Bailey's going to steal the show as always, along with Molina in there and Harlow Howes. All right, guys. Semis are coming your way. Semis are coming your way. Stand by to stand by. Semis are coming your way. Do, 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 do. Man, I just love it. I just love it. Aren't you those... I see the relationship with Stasic and BMX being pretty much hand in hand and kind of one to one. I think the beauty of what Stasic brings to BMX and to cycling and to um, moto is young kids at a very young age get to experience the excitement of two wheels, developing their skills with balance, control, throttle control, braking and all these kind of things. It's really amazing to me to watch the kids on Stay Six and how well they perform and adapt to you know, this new technology. Whether you're riding a Stay Six or you're riding a BMX bike, you're riding a moto, for the most part, you know, it's you and your machine. It's up to you what you can do with it and your passion and your skills and, and where it can take you. racing legacy is built from dedication, hard work, 
blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. Promax. Be your own pro. They're staging up semis, guys. If you are not there and you have a semi, you snooze, you lose. You snooze. You snooze. La, 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 la. La 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 Grand Valley Semis Semis This dude Man Here we go Oh, semi, semi, semi. What do we got going on? I've got Princess Hulk to the whole shot right now. And I'll tell you what, didn't take her long to get there doing it to it. It's got to be, I believe, yep, Kira. Kira's on the tippy top side of this one with all kinds of company coming on strong. Kira, Morano, Rory, how about we got Marchese, Sedano, Supergirls in the mix with Kayla Ganon, Gannon coming your way. Sisu Racing, Hulk on the tippy top side of this one. The 14, or the 1A trying to get on in there as well. But I'll tell you what, we have got serious action coming your way as they head on down third straight. So Sedano's going to get on in. Here comes the rocket. That's got to be Rory Strain. Strain has got Mieja in the mix as well. Viscuso down the line. Viscuso, Mieja. They're going to get on in. Strain's going to get on in as well. Your final qualifier. Yep, it's going to be the 1-3 ride. Sedano is in. We got more race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? They head on down the line. I'll tell you what, this one's going to be a doozy as they come on down stripe. The 1-5-1, one, one, the 59. What do we got? Oh, man. Is that going to be Lotham? Lotham's in. He's looking good to go. Lil, she's looking good to go. Lil Tornado. That's going to be Vega. Here comes so Boogie Barnes, Ratzlaff is in as well. In and out of the final turn, coming on down the line. It's still going to be Barnes holding on to the front spot. And then it's going to be the 1-4 ride getting on there. Barnes, the 1-4, the 40 in there as well. 
Man, these guys are charging. What do we got? Is that going to be Shark Week, as they say? No doubt about it. They got a shark right up on the front side right about now. Gallegos up on the front side. Gallegos is still got company coming. That's got to be Paxman. Gallegos and Paxman, they're going to be side to side. The squared ride getting on is going to be your Gold Cup number one. Noyola is in, followed by the five ride coming on through. Your final qualifier, the speed go Thompson, is in. Semi number four now is heading on into the second turn. Semi number four is heading on to the second turn. I got the four and the eight coming your way today. The four is going to come on through. Schmidt. Schmidt has got a Hartley Ripper board. Gage Hartley's in the mix for the Alpha Cycles team. We're going to pick up your final two qualifiers in just a sec. Schmidt's in. Hartley is in. They're sitting one and two. The final spot's up for grabs. Coming on down to the line. What do we got going on? Is that going to be the 3 0 ride and the 19? Yes. How about Ashford and Sode? Ray Sode, you are in. Here comes Waters. He's got a gang of guys. Waters going upstairs. Waters trying the pro section. Are you kidding me? This dude is straight up going upstairs. Waters got company coming on strong. It's got to be a one ride. Here comes Drama for your mama. It's got to be El Fuego. That's got to be Cumson sitting on the four spot right about now. Sorensen gunning. Here comes Kyle Octane Christopher right now with Meek in there as well. But it's still going to be the one ride. Gunning is getting on in. El Fuego coming on through. The L was Jacob Sorensen. More race action coming your way. It's going to be Tarango. Tarango's your whole shot hitter right about now. Here comes L R C Aguilar. He's going to rail the trail and try and fly right on by, but Gadare's going to be there. It looks like Gadare's going to get on into two. So it's going to break on down like this. Aguilar in one, Gadare in two, Tarango in three. Who's sitting in four? Holding on. The bull. The bull trying to get on in now. One more turn to go. In and out of the final turn. Woohoo! Holy moly. It's still Gadare, Tarango, Aguilar. Your fourth and final qualifier, the A ride. Nielsen is in. Moving on now, I got little guys on little bikes coming your way. This has got to be Chase Eckel. Chase Eckel, he's going to be leading the semi main event all the way around the track. One more time, Eckel going upstairs in that second straight, looking good to go. Claiborne answer, leading the singing in this one. Here comes Cowell. Biagi has been looking good. Cannon and Lish. Nelson in the mix as well. It's still going to be the one two ride coming on in. Oh man, Biagi dropping on back. Biagi's on the bubble. Biagi's in all kinds of trouble. One more turn. Whoa, ho, ho. Biagi Biagio takes the high side. He's going to rail the trail. So it's going to be Eckel is in. Biagio, he's going to be your fourth qualifier. The 87, the 35. That's got to be Cowell and Nelson. Cowell and Nelson. Here comes this one. Oh, man. Are you kidding me? Is that the laser light show coming your way? Lincoln Schumann? Yep. No doubt about it. Out of Washington, Utah, he comes. It's going to be the laser show. Schumann. Schumann. He's got the five right on the back door. That's going to be, I believe, Albie's very own uh, Jax Lafreniere. I don't know that one. Let for, it, well, let's go with this. Jax is up in the front looking good to go. He's got Lincoln and Jax one and two. They bring it on down the line. The laser shows on the top front side. Jax is in. The five and the 27 coming on through. The five's going to like Huddleston and the 27 is Hedges. Here comes John Kerr. This dude is so fast. I'll tell you what. Y'all might want to break out some pen and pad. Take some notes. Call him the bus because he's taking him to school. Whatever you want to do, it's all good. Kerr leading the singing. He's got company on the back door trying to reel him on in. That could be, I believe, Sode. Ray Sode is trying to reel him on in right now as they head on down to the line. What do we got going on? We got four guys trying to move on through. Here comes Jax. I can't even pick him on up. It's still going to be Kerr. Kerr is looking good to go. One more turn to go. Cravino, Kerr, looking good. Cravino, I don't even notice you in that jet jersey. Look and fly. The Sharks and the Alpha Ride are in. Good job, Stingray. Good job. What do we got going on now? I got a shark rider up on the front side. You know that's got to be DJ himself. Yep, the racer. Gallegos. Gallegos on the tippy top side. Then he has got Quincy Williams. No way. Smokey himself. Terrapin. Where you at? Terrapin. Where you at? You got one on the front side looking good to go. It's semi time to the line and Quincy Williams is all that in a bowl of chili, man. This guy is hotter than a hot, hot. He's a straight up BMX inferno, son. It's still going to be Gallegos and Williams. One and two. Gallegos, Williams are three. Oh, Oh no, somebody needs a road map. The Albi rides along with the one ride getting on in there. That's going to be Haslam. Haslam, the a Albi's ride, Kovacs. We'll see you tomorrow, Burnside. Don't trip, my man. You will be back.
What do we got going on? What do we got going on? I got a shark rider up on the front side. Bassett is into the sharks. That's got to be Hart. Bassett is Harp. So Hart and Harp sounds like a law firm coming your way. Then we got the four ride in there. Is that going to be Schmidt? Is that going to be the tarantula? Oh man, Hart, Harp, one and two out of California, both of them. They're going to come on down to the line. It looks like Hart's going to take on the top spot. Harp, the two, the bio lab ride. Is that going to be your national age group number 11 and the four? Yep, no doubt about it. Let's go with a grunt. Agron and Schmidt, Camarillo, California. Paxman, oh yeah. Paxman to the front side. Didn't take him long to get there. He's got an escort right trying to reel him on in right now. That could be Noyola. Noyola's been looking good to go. Here comes Neff, Neff, the McNiven, Harley Thompson, the wrecking ball, the wrecking ball, looking for somebody to blow up right about now. One more turn to go. It's going to be all Paxman taking home the top spot, coming out of the final turn, the D ride. Ir Irwin, he is sitting in two right about now. Irwin is in. Then we got the Gold Cup number one in the 17. That's got to be Noyola is in. McKibben is in. Man, Neff, Neff, you getting loose. You good, brother. Ha <laughs> ha, Neff's a good dude. Him and his pops. They've been doing BMX a long time. We're on to 11-year-old expert semi-main event. 11-year-old expert semi-main event. You know we got a big bad number one up on the front. Number three on the front side. The Red Rocket. The Red Rocket's got to belong to, I believe, Jet Hickey. Hickey is in. If it holds together, he's got company coming. That could be Loco coming your way. So it'll be Hickey and, Hickey and Rotney. They're going to go one and two. Your third and fourth qualifier is going to be the 16 and Jansen. So it was Lil Lily, Zayd, and Alex. You are in. You are in. More race action coming your way. What do we got going on? What do we got going on in this one? I'll tell you what we've got. We've got some more bad boys coming your way. Oh, man. Garcia stuck in the back of the pack. Is this going to be Knox Perkins? Yep, there ain't no doubt about it. Ox. Ox is up on the front side. They call him Perkins. Perkins got the tangent rip ride trying to reel him on your right about now. Then we got the one ride sitting in two. That's got to be in three. That's got to be the Shark Martinez. Zeno Martinez, that is. So Ox Perkins is going to get on in. Carter Garcia might be in as well. Martinez, he's sitting in three. Your fourth and final qualifier coming on down to the line. Is that going to be Aiden Trumpeteer? Trumpeteer for Black Crown. You are in. More semi-main events coming your way. More semi-main events again. Is this our Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle? No way. The Master Blaster is coming your way. 12-year-old experts. This guy is shot out like a cannon. Here comes Lanier's. Lanier's is in the mix. He's sitting in two right about now. I got a six ride and a big dog coming your way. Is that going to be Christensen? Christensen's in there as well. Here comes company. Those are bringing on down to the line. Jam and Jake Roth trying to find a fast line to get on in. No, he's stuck in the back of the pack. So it's going to be the four ride. White is in. The one, the one in the six, you are in. Man, Scrubs. Are you, Schaffner, did you make that? Schaff dog, you in crash? Shoo! More race action coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? What do we got going on in this one? The Sharks. Here comes Cohen James. Cohen James trying to get on in there. Montano. Montano's on the front side. He's got to deal with the 82 coming on strong. That's Skinner. Keegan Skinner is in two now. So he's going to break on down just like this. Montano's going to get on in. Four of these riders moving on through in the semi-main event. 12-year-old expert style. Montano's in. Skinner's in. Oh, no. We got to pile up in turn two. Three. In turn three, Cohen James is in. Your final qualifier, Speedster Gibbs. Oh, we're checking on our guys down to the final turn. They're coming your way, gents. They're coming your way. LSG is Colton Kid. The real deal is up on the front side. Kid, he's got to deal with a guy by the name of Young Vicario. Maddox Vicario. I tell you what, this guy is moving out big time as well. The Claiborne ride coming on strong. Don't count out this dude. What's going on with Chappie? Chappie's trying to find a little something, something in the tank right now. They're coming down to the line. LSG is in. The three, the ten, and the N. The end, your final qualifier, that was crew. Was that loco? Yes. Man. What do we got going on? Here comes trouble coming your way. Keep an eye on this guy, Perry Wagner, Gibson, Nicholas, Whiteside, McCain, Tafoya. What happened to the big dog? It's still going to be, I believe, Gibson. Gibson out of the first turn looking good to go. He's got the ROC number one coming your way. Wagner. Wagner's looking good to go. So it's going to be Wagner and Gibson. One and two. One more turn to burn. Oh, check out that dude. That guy carves it up out of the final turn. Gibson's in. Wagner's in. Then we have got the one. One, one ride followed by the two. You are in. How about we go with hard, hard and a west side. West side. 
Rago. Rago Bagel. Rago Bagel. It's got to be Aiden Bagel up on the front side right now. Looking good to go. And I'll tell you what, the factory escort rider is holding on. Here comes Danny Waters. Is that going to be, I believe, another hard charge coming your way? Waters and Rago. The answer riders are going 1-2 right about now. What happened to Owen Ostertag? We're trying to find him right now. Stuck in the back of the pack as they head on down the line. Rago's in. Waters in. Then we've got the 9 and the 1. You are in Aguilar along with the 9 ride. No, the one is, uh, my bad, it's going to be Sorensen, Waters, Tarango. More race action coming your way. What we got going on? This one, Nielsen, Aguilar, Herman, Gunning, Cumson, Everson, Penn, Gadare. Gadare's on the front side right about now. Gadare's got the LRC ride coming your way. Is that going to be Aguilar looking good to go? So it's going to be Gadare and Aguilar. Aguilar, new and improved. I'll tell you what, one of these LRC kids who are making some moves right about now. This guy's got it going on strong. Gadare's going to get on in. Aguilar's going to get on in. The one and the 19. Cumston, you are in. Gunning looking good. More semi-main events coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? 15-year-old expert. This one is stacked on the inside. Check out the big guy. That has got to be, I believe, Sloppy Nacho himself, Carter McCain. No, it's going to be Caleb McCain. He's in two right now, trying to make the jump to light speed. It's going to be the sixth ride right about now. What do we got going on? That's got to be Westover. Robinette's in the mix. Radford, along with Dale Owens and Wells. McCain in two, still trying to hold on. All the way down to the line, they're going to come on through the five. The five is in. The two, both fives made it in as well. Radford, Westover, she, McCain. Semi, deuce, deuce. Semi, 22. I have got a shark ride. Is that going to be the dude holding on? The dude now dropping back. He's going pro side. The dude is going upstairs. He's got a bride on the side. They're safe into turn two. It's still going to be the dude holding on right about now. He's got a 15 right on the back door trying to break it on down. Westerman. So it's going to be the dude and Westerman one and two. Here comes Omara. Omara with the hard charge at the line. What do we got up for grabs? The bio lab rider coming on strong. Your fourth and final spot. Omara. Gosno Westerson moving on through Omara as well. Holy moly. 99. William Bergenson, please check your plate. Please check your plate. Danger. Check your plate, brother. Oh, Velador is in two. Your lead ride guy is on the 16. You know Aaron Blee is in full control right about now. Blee, Velador, one and two. In and out of the final turn. Semi-time to the line as they bring it on down. Blee is new and improved. This guy's got it going on strong. Catching all the backside. Velador, the 15, and the Dirt Addiction ride. You are in the Dirt Addiction. That was uh, Alan Spartan. Alan Zorn, you're in as well. Dirt Addiction. Oh, the Dirt Addiction in this one. That was Scott. Oh, there's two Dirt Addictions jumping also. <laughs> What do we got going on? What do we got going on as they head on down to the line? This is going to be, I believe, the uh, Sharks Elizondo. He's in there. Oh, somebody getting squirrely whirly in the final turn. We got one full pull up for grabs. This one might be Elizondo. He's definitely in. Elizondo, the 14, the H, and Cyclecraft coming on through the Cyclecraft. McCready, the 14 is Carbona. The H was Darren Inglis, Utah. Whoo-wee. Man. Man. Dude.
Jones, a whole shot. I see the relationship with Stasic and BMX being pretty much hand in hand and kind of one to one. I think the beauty of what Stasic brings to BMX and to cycling and to uh, moto is young kids at a very young age get to experience the excitement of two wheels, developing their skills with balance, control, throttle control, braking, and all these kind of things. It's really amazing to me to watch the kids on Stay Six and how well they perform and adapt to you know this new technology. Whether you're riding a Stay Six or you're riding a BMX bike, you're riding a moto. For the most part, you know it's you and your machine. It's up to you what you can do with it and your passion and your skills and where it can take you. A racing legacy is built from dedication, hard work, blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. Promax. Be your own pro.
I see the relationship with Stasic and BMX being pretty much hand in hand and kind of one to one. I think the beauty of what Stasic brings to BMX and to cycling and to um, moto is young kids at a very young age get to experience the excitement of two wheels. Developing their skills with balance, control, throttle control, braking, and all these kind of things. It's really amazing to me to watch the kids on Stay Six and how well they perform and adapt to you know, this new technology. Whether you're riding a Stasic or you're riding a BMX bike, you're riding a moto, for the most part, you know, it's you and your machine. It's up to you what you can do with it and your passion and your skills and where it can take you. A racing legacy is built from dedication, hard work, blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. Promax. Be your own pro.
two, one, bang. I see the relationship with Stasic and BMX being pretty much hand in hand and kind of one to one. I think the beauty of what Stasic brings to BMX and to cycling and to uh, moto is young kids at a very young age get to experience the excitement of two wheels, developing their skills with balance, control, throttle control, braking, and all these kind of things. It's really amazing to me to watch the kids on Stay Six and how well they perform and adapt to you know this new technology. Whether you're riding a Stay Six or you're riding a BMX bike, you're riding a moto. For the most part, you know it's you and your machine. It's up to you what you can do with it and your passion and your skills and where it can take you. A racing legacy is built from dedication, hard work, blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. In the gate right now, getting ready to go, it's going to be Elder. Lixon Drew, Grassy Hinton, Merton, and Solana, na, 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 Solano. They are long gone. One more time. What do we got going on? Main events are underway out here. Grand Valley, Grand Valley. Here we go. The Sharks ride. Elder. It didn't take her long to get there. And out of the first turn, your whole shot. Hero's got to be Elder, no doubt about it. She's got company on the back door. Lixon Drew trying to reel her on in. She got a plan, rolling it out right now. One more turn to go. In and out of turn two. Ellen Elder, Lixon Drew. Here comes the line. Na 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 na. Little some some. But Maharo is on the roll right about now. That's got to be Merton. One more turn and out they go. Coming on down the line. Elder. Elder. The shark. Weak. Sharks in. Lixon Drew followed by the two right. Getting on in there as well. It's got to be Evil O. Hinton for the three. Tangent Pro-Am in the gate right now. Getting locked and loaded and ready to rock and roll. What do we got going on in this one? Coming on strong. Maxwell Keller. Brighton Bailey. P Peter Pistol Pete Elizondo. Lucas Howes. Harlow's the monster. Andrew Sanchez. Here comes Chevy Hoffman. And don't count out. Pop-Tart himself. Garrett Scott. 
Hey bud, thanks. Revving through the gears, they go right now as they head on down in the turn one. Pistol! It's Gabriel Elizondo in another first turn. He's got company on the back door. Here comes Hal. Hal trying to reel him on in. I'll tell you what, they got a gang of guys trying to come on through as they head on into turn two. Impact all over the two spot right about now. What happened to Harlow? We're trying to figure it on out as they bring it on back. He's sitting in five. It's still going to be, I believe, Elizondo winning out of the final turn, bringing it on down to the line. He has still got company on the back door. Elizondo, he is in. The Sharks are going to steal the show, followed by the 861. Bailey's gonna, oh, Bailey in there for the two of court. True Dad getting the job done. Man, Pistol Pete Elizondo is straight out, moving out with Cloud out of Bakersfield, California. Shoo wee! Elizondo, man, that guy was straight up motoring. Six and under open, six and under open, six and under. Here we go. Huddleston, Baxter, Mieha, Chadwick, Holiday, Cannon, Dissert, and Woodbridge. They are long gone. Amateur main events are underway. The escort ride coming your way is going to be the astronaut himself, Huddleston. Trot or Huddleston. This guy's going to be ga galloping away right about now. There is no trot in this guy. Full gallop mode around the course. It's going to be all Huddleston on the tippy top side of this one. He's still got Baxter Mieha in the back door. Here comes Chadwick and Holiday. Dissert, Colby Cannon. Woodridge is in the mix as well. In and out of turn two, the 36 right. That's got to belong to Dissert. Dissert out of Sam. Mateo, California, trying to take home his first main event win ever. What do we got going on? One more turn to go. Dessert. No way. The Nunchuck coming your way. It looks like Huddleston wants to get it on back. Down to the line. A full pool. San Mateo. It's going to be, I believe, Huddleston's in. Dessert is in. The 13 ride getting on in there as well. It's going to be the National Age Group. Colby Cannon. Man, those guys were charging. Seven and eight-year-old mixed open now. Seven and eight-year-old mixed open now. What do we got going on? noyola has been on the gas. Now tell you what, the S squared National Factory ride is going to be Dynamite Daisy. Daisy Noyola to the front side at a Littleton, Colorado. This young lady, I tell you what, she is straight up charging hard right about now. She heads on into turn two. She has still got Steed. Steed and little one sitting in three right now. That's got to be Antonio. So Steed and Antonio battling it out. The three ride. Antonio trying to find the inside ride, doing it to it for DFR and the Power Life Squad. Still this sitting in three. Noyola on the tippy top spot. I'll tell you what, she's going to hold on tight with all her might as she comes on down to the line. Noyola's in. Steed is in. Antonio taking over the two now. Antonio bringing it on back. Down to the line. Yee! Power Light looking good. Looking good. Nine and ten year old mixed open, guys. Nine and ten year old mixed open is long gone. The Hulk is trying to find a fast line to get around the company up on the front side. Check out that lead. Your whole shot hero up on the front side bring it on back the Hulk trying to figure out what happened princess Hulk that is Viscuso that's got to be the factory bombshell ride but your lead rider is your current reigning defending national age group number seven how about Zoe Boogie but Zoe Barnes coming your way out of Las Vegas Nevada for the RRC racing crew one more turn to go Barnes is going to come on through Viscuso they're going one and two here comes the bio lab team now that has got to be your gold cup number three is that going to be strain Rory the rocket strain is in there as well for the two. We're moving on now. We got more race action coming your way this time. It's going to be main event number eight. 11 year old mixed open. Navarro, Shatswell, Beatty, Walski. Here comes Cruella along with Dunn, Zachary Vilverdi, and then H Callum Hafner as well. In and out of the first turn. Walski stuck on the top side trying to bring back the momentum. Here comes it looks like Donovan Long's very own factory LSG throwdown ride. Navarro's on the inside. Oh, we got two LSGs in here. Your gold cup number three. That's got to be Cruella. Cruella's on the front. Oh, are you kidding me? Holy moly. Shatswell will not be denied today. One more turn to go as they bring it on down to the line. Shatswell's up on the front side looking good to go. Shatty going to take home the top spot. Shatswell is in. LSG. Walski at the line. Walski LSG. Two and three. 13, 14 year old mixed open now. 13, 14 year old mixed open now. It's got to be Thompson. Addison Thompson. Wow. On fire right about now. Straight up on spin cycle as they come on down to the line. Your goal cup number one. Klein is straight up turning on the turbos right about now as well. They're going to head on into the second turn. It's still going to be, I believe, all Thompson. Thompson and Klein. One and two. Trent and Klein trying to figure it out as they head on down to the line. Here comes Marissa. Marissa Brown, that is. The little missile trying to come on through out of surprise Arizona. Down to the line. It'll still be Thompson. Take 
taking home the top spot. And then I believe Daisy Robinson doing it too at the seven ride. You know that was going to be the little missile. That's got to be Miss Brown. Miss Brown. We're moving on now. What do we got coming your way today? What do we got coming your way? 15, 16, mixed open. Oh, Nelly. Holy moly. This dude straight up holding on. Is that going to be Hall and Hall? Hall and Hall? In and out of the back turn coming your way down. No way. Ryland, here comes Nab, Nap and Young, Thompson, Nielsen. It's got to be the bullet is in here as well. In and out of the back turn coming your way. You know Mickey Tom, Mickey Joseph is up on the front side. They call her the bullet out of Grand Junction, Colorado. The local yokel coming on. Oh, man. Turning and burning. She turned on a dime and left a nickel change in the final turn. Good Lord, Thompson. Joseph is in. The 56 is going to get on in there for the two. That's got to be Riley Knapp. Riley Knapp. One of the Knapp family. I think there's like 32 of them. Holy moly, that guy. <laughs> More race action coming your way. More race action coming your way. What do we got going on? 31 and over mixed open class coming your way. It's got to be Jackson Wright, Hafner, Stitham, along with Chris Wooten. And then we've got Hedges in the mix. He's doing it to it for the Iron Man's BMX Army. Your lead ride guy on the front side is going to be all Chris Wooten right about now. Wooten, Wooten at a good year. Arizona coming on strong. He's trying to seal the deal. Oh, inside ride now. These guys are swapping like chickens as they head on down to the line. The 20 ride. Is that going to belong to Stidham? Steve in? Steve's going to get on in the 81 and the 50. That's got to be Hafner, Hafner, and Wooten let out the sandbags. Six, six and under open. Six and under open. What do we got going on coming your way? Mantis out of the NorCal. Nino Kamura. Mantis racing. Another one of the San Mateo kids coming on strong. Whatever's in the water out there must be good for BMX because these kids are laying down the law right about now. He has got Ayers and Ryman coming on strong as ways. They head on down the line. But Mantis racing is up on the tippy top side of this one and looking good to go. This dude is straight up stronger than 90 proof. Good luck. Lord Almighty, can I get an amen from the congregation? Kamara, Kamara, he's going to take it on home. He has got the Mack truck trying to reel him on in. Your Gold Cup number one, followed by Dino Ryman. Seven and eight year old open. Seven and eight year old open. What do we got going on in this one? How about we go with the laser show? The laser lights are up on the front side right about now. Lincoln Schumann showing you how he got that national age group number one trying to seal the deal one more time. This guy is straight up turning on the turbos and heading on down the line. Schumann's going to get on in. Schumann's got the daylight ride sitting on the back door saying knockity knock knock knock. I want to come on in and play today. That's got to be a guy by the name of Elijah Emery. Elijah Emery sitting in too. But I'll tell you what, he's got a full plate on his plate right about now. Wow, check out this dude. That's got to be Cannon himself. Down to the line. Woohoo! Cademan, good comeback, son. Nine, ten-year-old open. We still got one down on the ground. Gonna make sure he's a okay and good to go. Yeah, come on, Mohawk man. You're back on the bike and looking good. Not the way you want to end a Friday afternoon out here at Grand Valley BMX, but he'll be back tomorrow. Tomorrow. One coming up. There's one coming. Nine ten open. The gate goes down, and one more time, I got a shark's ride on the inside. What do we got going on in this one? How about Noyola Gallegos, Paxman, Thompson, Schmidt, Hartley, Ashford, and Ray Sode out of San Jose. In and out of the first turn, bringing it on down the line. It's got to be, I believe, we have got a BMX shark's ride. Gallegos, the racer, is up on the front side, looking good to go. Ecole muchacho. Gallego is moving out big time. Oh, Noyola trying the low line, taking over the two. The four ride's going to belong to Schmidt. The tarantula, Dominic Schmidt, is sitting in there in three right about now. Noyola trying trying to hold on to three as they come out of the final turn. It's still going to be, I believe, to Racer Gallegos. He's going to get on in. Oh, man, check out Noyola. He wants more. The four. Woo. It looks like it was going to be. It looks like it's going to be Falrus. Paxman got on in there. Man, Noyola for the four. Whoo -wee. Hey, double check everything. Okay, bud? Okay. Gate goes down one more time. The big dog on the inside. Is this, could it be Ox 
Perkins knocks the ox. Oh, yes. It's got to be Perkins. Zip one up on the front side right about now. What do we got going on? Oh, Perkins leading the scene in this one. He has got a big dog. Reel him on in. I'll tell you what, Cordova's the bulldog. He's been coming on strong as well. But don't count out the goat. The goat's going mad, mad, mad. He's at a Laverne, California, trying to reel him on in. Headed in the final turn. It's still going to be the ox with the goat on the back door trying to reel him on in down the line. Oh, man. Ox Perkins looking good. He's going to take home the top spot. The seven rides got to be Rojas, the hit man, followed by the three. One, two, and three. Gibson taking home. Man. The N is nag one. Oh. Lenners. You won that, freaker. Freaking Lenners. What do we got going on? More race action coming your way right about now. It's still going to be, I believe, 13, 14 year old opens coming your way. In and out of the final turn, bring it on down to the line. It is still going to be, I believe, your big dog. He's got Donovan's kid sitting into the deuce, deuce, and the one followed by the two. The deuce, deuce is going to be Larkin. The one, of course, is going to be Kid. Man, how did I get that one wrong? Lenners, my bad, son. What do we got going on? Oh, yeah. It's got to be Double Trouble. Omara coming your way right about now. This guy's going to go pro side. Omara looking good to go. woo hoo 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 In and out of turn two. Omara's on the tippy top side. 15, 16 year old. He's had another one of the hard charges on the back door. Trying to reel one in. Gosnell Swift. Here comes Fausto. Radford is in there as well. Don't count out the Dragon Fire pedal. And one more turn to go. It's still going to be Omara. Omara's on the K. The one three ride. No, the three getting on in there along with the National Age Group number nine. Of course, that is going to belong to Smith. Smith and Pedal, the Dragon Fire Pedal getting on in. But he was battling fifth and sixth, right? So bad. What do we got going on coming on back of your way? You know, there's got to be the big dog up on the front side. How about we go with Harlow, Hemet, California. Harlow. Harlow's got the long hair rocking the party in the back door right about now. But I'll tell you what, Harlow's going to sign, seal, and deliver this one. The H ride. Inglis is going to get on in there, followed by the 1 3 ride. Johnson, they're going to go 1 2 and 3 as they come on down the stripe. 17 20 open. Man, Harlow, you're looking good. Justin to the finish line. Justin to the finish line. Big bad just dog, you know where to be, brother. Just into the finish line. More race action coming your way this time. It's going to be Gordy's very own. Yeah, Nap. He got Nap and Nap all over the front side. Chris getting treated by the little brother. What do we got going on? It's still going to be Tim Nap on the front side. Welcome back to BMX, the Gordy's Bike Shop ride. I tell you what, it's always a bummer when little brother's smoking you, huh, Chris? It is all good. Tim Nap going to get on in for the win. No doubt about it. Tim looking good to go. Chris Nap taking home the two, the 10 ride. That's got to be Casey McNiven. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way. Eight and under. Ah, oh, eight and under. Ladies Cruiser is on the track right about now. We have got Zoe Bear along with Sour Patch, Joy, Joy, Gay, Sky, Sky, Martin coming your way as well. So it's still going to be your lead rider railing the trail and coming on back. That's going to be the Albies ride coming on strong. How about we go to the 422, 432? Is that going to be Charlie Gay up on the tippy top side of this one? Yep, Albie's box ride out of Lakeside, California. Looking good to go. One more turn to go. Charlie Gay is going to get on in for the win, no doubt about it. If it holds together, and I believe it will, he has still got company coming in and coming quick. The H ride. The H ride is going to get on in there for the two, no doubt about it. Followed by the 09 ride, the 454. That's got to belong to young Joy Gonzalez getting on in for the 09 team. Another one of the kids out of Lakeside, California. We got nine and 10 year old girls cruising. Nine and ten year old girls cruisers. This time it's got to be Princess Hulk, young factory bombshell rider Vescuso. Kira Vescuso coming your way. Vescuso's got the Biolab rider coming on strong as well. You know it's got to be the Rocket Strain, Rory Strain coming all over, sitting in two right about now. Oh yeah, Princess Hulk and Strain one and two. Here comes company though. That's got to belong to Savannah Banana trying to reel them on in. And in the foul turn, one more to go. <laughs> Shutting the door. Holy moly, that has got to be, I believe coming on down the line. Biolab strain in for the win. It looks like the Princess Hulk going to drop on back down to three. It's going to be the banana getting on in there for the two. The Priest. 
Living in 12 year old girls cruisers coming your way now. I'll tell you what we got going on. 11 and 12 year old girls cruiser. How about the ladies in the place with style? They're side by side in and out of the first turn. Oh man, I tell you, they are coming on strong down to the line right about now. Sharks is in the mix as well. Too much trying to find a little something, something, but stuck in the back of the pack. They're going to rail the turn too right about now. It's still going to be Kylie. Kylie's on the tippy top side of this one. She's got company on the back door trying to break it on down as they head on in the final turn. Fall risk racing sitting in the mix as well. One more turn to go. This one one's going to be up for grabs, y'all. Starkey trying to hold on with a Kung Fu grip. Your national age group number seven, Viscuso at the line. Viscuso, Starkey, the three ride. Wow, that was going to be Priest. Alexa Priest. 13, 14 year old girls cruisers getting ready to rock the party right now as they head into the first turn. Huffman, Wells, and Hinton. Huffman, Wells, and Hinton. Wells in the back of the pack right about now trying to reel on in the power light DFR ride. That's got to be Tiger Lily. Lily, Hinton. Hinton up on the front side. But here comes company. That could be, I believe, the Gertie rides, the Gordy rides of Huffman. Huffman trying to roll out the master plan in and out of the final turn. Hinton, Huffman, and Wells. Hinton, Huffman, and Wells all the way down to the line. The one ride's going to get on in DFR in the house at a monument, Colorado, Colorado. 15, 16 year old young ladies are in the gate right about now and snap, crackle, pop. That's gotta be Danica Anderson. Lil Avalanche on the front side, hopping and skipping and jumping into the tippy top side. I'll tell you what, it's gonna be Palmer sitting in the mix, sitting in two. So it's gonna break on down just like this. It's gonna be all Anderson and Palmer, one and two. Barrett trying to hang tough like a new kid on the block. That's gotta be Barrett, Lil Savage Barrett. And then we got Isabella Myers in the mix as well. Danica Anderson, your two time national age group number. No, they got 30 time nag number one and national number one a couple times. Danica's won everything. It'll be Anderson, your former world champion as well. Palmer's going to get on in there for the two, followed by Lil Savage Barrett. Ladies cruisers are long gone. See you later. Bye, guys. Long gone. See you later. Bye, guys. What do we got going on? The Alpha Factory ride's got to be the V8 rider coming your way. Oh, man. Check out this one. Full risk racing's all over the back door out of Eagle, Colorado. So it's going to break on down just like this. Sifford, Sergeant, one and two. Here comes Boston Reed. One, two, three. a single file through the rhythm section. Who's got the skills to pay the bills? In and out of the final turn. Alpha Factory ride is up on the front side. I tell you what. She is all good as it comes on down. Sifford, Reed, Sergeant to the line. Moving on now, 31 to 35 year old more ladies cruisers on the track right now. Got Horde Powers and Crane. Pow, pow, Anja Powers been looking way fast and way smooth out of Apple Valley, California. Let's see if she can be a deja vu all over again one more time as she heads on down to the line. Powers and Crane and Horde. One, two, and three. C-O-B coming your way in and out of turn two. It's still going to belong to young Pow Pow Powers. She's going to take home the one, one, one all day long. Followed by, I believe she got company coming. It's got to be Mama Crane. They're going to go one and two. Powers, Crane, Horde, one and two and three in and out of the final turn. Down to the line. The Misfits bringing up the back of the pack, but it's going to be all Pow Pow taking home the top spot. We got more ladies coming your way, more ladies coming your way. Cruiser time to the line. What do we got going on in this one? Oh, uh, yes. I tell you what. We have got Hedges, Wells, Cannon, Irwin, along with Iverson in the mix as well. Bring it on down to the line. What do we got going on? They're going to dive down deep into turn number two as they head for home right now. Your lead ride gal. Gold Coast is in the mix. Jen Iverson, Irwin, Christy Gannon's trying to get on in there. Oh, we got a J and a K and a couple twos coming on strong. Jen Iverson is in the mix as well. So the J is going to Along to Sherry Bomb blowing up the competition right about now at a Porta Puna Gorda. Irwin's going to take home the top spot, followed by Iverson. They're going to go one and two. The K ride is going to belong to Wynema Wells. Nema Joe getting on the box. On the box. Here. Here we go one more time. Jill McGuire out of Elizabeth, Colorado, looking good to go. Looking to chase down that future national age group number one. McGuire, this gal races BMX and downhill and road bikes and gravel bikes. I'll tell you what, this girl's a peddler. McGuire is up on the front side looking good to go. She comes out of the final turn. She's got Cassandra Caron doing it for the Dream Team, sitting in three right about now. Cherhart is sitting in two for the Prodigy crew. So it's going to break on down like this. McGuire, Chipart, Caron, one. One, two, and three down to the stripe. 
What do we got going on now? More ladies are on the track. More ladies are on the track. The legend herself, LeVan, is up on the front side. Partee and Susan Black trying to reel her on in. Susie LeVan doing it to it. I'll tell you what, she chased the points for years and years as a teenager and brings it on back to BMX. She is straight up living the dream with TNT bicycles out of Aurora, California. Good to see you, brother. It's going to be, I believe, Susie Le Did you guys know the gold medalist Connor Fields is in the house? I'm not kidding. I think that was him. He's kind of like a ghost, you know. I just, man, I love seeing that dude. Shoo! Susie LeVan going to come on down to the line. No doubt about it. LeVan's going to get on in for the win. Shoo! Followed by the two-ride party in Susan Black. What's that? I wish. Man, that's Connor Fields. Kind of my hero, man. What do we got going on now? More ladies coming your way as they head on in the second turn. Psycho crap. Oh, yeah. Amy Lee. Amy Lee is in the house. She's got an escort right on the outside trying to find a little something, something in the gas tank. It's going to be the body armor ride. Maresh. Paula Maresh. So Lee, Maresh, one and two. Then it's going to be Don Beach, one, two, and three. Ferrado racing as they head on down the line. Oh, man. This one's up for grabs. Who's got the full pool down the line? It's going to be Yahtzee. How about the 10 ride? Amy Lee pumping her way to the tippy top. Little in college. Colorado, followed by the cycle grab ride, getting on in there for the top spot, Marish and Beach, Marish and Beach. We got more cruiser race action coming your way. Oh, cruisers are on the place right now. They are on the track and on attack. And I'll tell you what, this could be Hicks. Hicks out of the turn. The 47 rides got all kinds of company coming. Weston Hicks, Alpha Factory out of Peora, Arizona. But this guy's got a gang of guys trying to reel him on in right now. One more turn to go. Hicks going to get on the throttle, roll the wrist, and bring it on home for his mama. It's going to be all oh, Hicks now. Hicks down to the line, followed by, I believe that's going to be the 388 in the J ride belonging to McConnell, McConnell, and Davis. More cruisers coming your way. The eight-year-olds this time. The eight-year-olds this time. Huddleston, Lish. Here comes Biagi and Mason Biagi. They got two of the Biagi clans. Nelson, Shirley. It's got to be Jaxie Boys in here as well. The Kamikaze Kid coming your way. It's got to be Jacob Colwell. But the Albies ride on the front side. How about we go with Jaxie Boys showing you what's up? There ain't no doubt about it. This dude is straight up hitting harder than Mike Tyson. Good Lord. It's going to be Jaxie Boy to the front side. Santee, California. Jaxie Boy leading the singing. He's going to bring it on back home right now. Who's got the ponies left in the tank? It's still Jaxi. Jaxi's going to get on in. Your ROC number one. Cowell. Cowell. The deuce two sign touching up for two. But I'll tell you what. The S squared Arizona rider was right there as well. Man. Jacob Colwell looking good. Nine cruisers now, guys. Nine cruisers. Nine cruisers, guys. We got a BMX Sharks rider. That's got to be Gallegos. Gallegos up on the tippy top side of this one. Ho oh, ho. Gallegos got a trailer on the back door trying to break it on down right about now. Gallegos got the two ride. That's going to belong to a guy by the Supersonic. No, that's going to be Cravino. Cravino in the new Jets jersey. I couldn't even pick him up. Cravino. He has got Gallegos one and two in and out of the final turn. Gallegos and Cravino. Cravino new and improved. This guy's been putting in the work. Son, it's gonna be Cravino for two. The 14 ride is gotta be Hype Beast Haslam Auto Racing. More race action coming your way. We have got an outside ride. How about the Bassett charge? No doubt about it. Bassett's got to be the hummingbird himself. Chase Harp up on the front side. Here comes Fall Risk. Fall Risk trying to get on in there. The Pac-Man trying to find the fast line to blow on by. And he's bringing the mullet power with him. What do we got going on as they come on down? The Biolab rider's got to be Anthony Agram. Agram hardly in the mix. They got company coming on strong. That's going to be Irwin. Irwin in the wild card. Thompson. Wooten's coming back as well. The Bassett Rider's going to sign, seal, and deliver it. Chase Harp. Harp is in. The Biolab Rider to the National 9 and 8. That's got to be a gun, a gun, and Paxman. 2 and 3. 2 and 3. Moving on now. 11-year-old experts, guys, are coming your way. They're going on into the first turn. Oh, yeah. The big dog up on the front side. The bombshell rider looking good to go. And I'll tell you what, Hickey. Hickey has been straight up on fire. Another one of these kids. You might want to nickname him the Whirlpool because he is straight up on spin. 
spin cycle right about now. Jet Hickey, the red rocket is coming your way. One more turn to go, and he's going to straight put it in cruise control like he's driving that 55 T-Bird with company coming by the name of Carter Garcia. So it's going to be the bombshell ride. Hickey, Garcia, the 884 getting on in there. It's got to be Jacob Speedy Gonzalez, the 09 factory ride out of Ford Collins, Colorado. We're still checking on our down rider down on the first turn. Going to make sure he's a OK and good to go. Good to go. Yee-hoo. 12 cruiser, 12 cruisers getting ready to come your way. What do we got going on? Oh, man, check out these nicknames. The Slingshot, the Speedster, Scrubs is in this one. Yeah, buddy. Super B, the Enforcer, Sam Squatch, along with Jam and Jake. But don't ever count out on a veil, Colorado, Kalen White. They are long gone. I got a wheelie machine at a lane number one. Is that, could it be the Speedster Gibbs? We're going to figure it on out as we bring it on back our way. It looks like I have got a hard charge on the back door sitting in two. That's our Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. You know, that's the leader, the clan man. What do we got? Bring it on back. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. The three, five ride, the Gibbs. Gibbs is the speeder. Brayden Gibbs, bring it on back. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle coming on strong as well. He's sitting in two. We're going to get him on down. Gibbs is in. No doubt about it. He's looking good. He's going to rail the trail and cruise it on in your national age group number 10 followed by the 13 that's going to belong to Kalen White Kalen White and the 13 is going to be all crash himself crash himself out of Mojave Valley Arizona good job scrubs good job scrubs here comes Ian Gibson Ian Gibson is straight up new and improved holy moly this guy must have ate his Alpo this morning because he is straight up running with the big dogs it is going to be I believe Gibson Gibson he has got the Sharks ride sitting on the back door right now has got to be Vicario Max Vicario trying to find out what he's got left in the tank so Gibson Vicario one and two then we've got sitting in three how about we go with the 64 right that belongs to Levi Hart is in 14x 14 x cruiser my bad 14 cruiser Gate goes down one more time. What do we got going on? LRC. Where are you at? DT. It's going to be the banana kid himself, Brandon Aguilar. Oh, here comes Waters. Waters going upstairs. It's going to be Aguilar and Waters now. One and two. This one might be up for grabs. Aguilar we're on the run for the roses right about now. One more turn to go. Aguilar, Waters, one and two as the final turn. Bring it on down the line. This one might be up for grabs. Aguilar is going to get on in. Waters for two. The three is going to be the district number one ride. Is that going to be Gasset. Yep, gunning in for three. 15-year-old cruisers, 15-year-old cruisers in and out of the first turn. Oh, ha, ha. This one's going to be up for grabs right about now. The DFR ride coming your way, trying to hold on tight with all his might. It's got to be Westover. Cheddar Bob coming your way. Oh, Cheddar Bob just got treated in turn two. That's got to be Westerman now. Westerman, he's got the factory black round jersey on and looking good. Oh, Westerman, here comes company. Westover, Westerman, Caleb McCain is in for three, followed by, I believe that was going to be Ryder Robinettes. Woo. Hey, cleared at the line, man. Those guys are coming in hot. Those dudes are coming in hot. 16 cruisers now. 16-year-old cruisers. Keep your eyes on this one. This one's going to be a doozy. I know it. What do we got going on? The National Age Group ride coming your way today. We got the seven in there. Is that going to be? No. That's going to be Warrior Racing. Is that going to be Franzen? Oh, man. We're going to figure it on out as they head on down to the line. We got an S-square jersey flying high. Looking good to go into the final turn. Oh, Nelly. I thought he was going to try the low line and blast him right about there. Down to the stripe. National Age Group number 10 is going to get on in with the 13 and the 7, 10 to 13 and 7. So it's going to break on down with uh, Mayburn, Elliot, and then Franzen. What? I didn't hear you. What'd you say? Shark Week. You know what time it is. It's time to get scurred because it has got a shark ride. Oh, Velador trying to hang on in turn two. The Shark Week ride up on the front side. Aaron Blee is straight up on fire. Velador's in two right about now. One more turn to go. Blee, Velador. Here comes the cycle ride. ride. That's got to be the laser. Lotham. Lotham in there. Blee looking so good. Velador. Lotham. One, two, and three down to the stripe. We're moving on now. We got more cruisers getting ready to rock the party as they head on down. The first straight right about now. The 
big dog. You know that's got to be Mr. Mullet himself, Cavallaro. Jacob Cavallaro coming on strong out of Colorado. He comes. Yeah, buddy. Dressed in black and on attack. I'll tell you what, this guy reminds me of my wife's heart. Good Lord Almighty. Cavallaro's got some ponies, man. Lucas Tabor. They're in the mix right about now. It's still going to belong to the lead ride guy up the front side. Mr. Mullet Cavallaro himself is bringing it home for his mama. Shoo-wee. Jacob Cavallaro, keep an eye on this guy. He looks like he got some serious game coming his way. Cavallaro's going to get on in, no doubt, followed by the 1-3 ride. How about Lucas and the 117 of D Dustin Tabor? Cruiser. Cruisers are long gone, coming your way this time. It's going to be 36 to 40 year old cruiser class. How about we go with main event number 43? Main event number 43, Tim Knapp. Oh man, I tell you what, this dude is straight up moving out with clout big time. Knapp, he has got company coming on. You know who it's got to be, Ripper. Here comes Big Mike. Big Mike's got the rooster. Tim Knapp don't need a nickname. He just got some skills. Knapp trying the inside line. Oh man, holy moly, are you kidding me? No way. We call this guy jujitsu because he not stop choking out. It's going to be Mike Meckham getting on in. Nap in there for the two. Meckham, Big Mike with the win. <laughs> oh, so good. So good. Yeah. Little brother. More race action coming your way. I got a bio lab rider up on the tippy top side of this one that's gonna to belong to Brian Randolph. Brian Randolph, you might want to salute him as he flies on by. Randolph has got all kinds of company on the back door trying to reel him on in right about now. Holy moly, are you kidding me? The dude serves 20 years in the United States Marine Corps. Then he comes out to race some BMX and he wants to win everything. It's still gonna be at the line, the A ride getting on in. It will be Hallworth and Randolph. They're gonna go one and two, followed by the 24 ride of Marchese. Oh, Gainsford. No way. Corky for Punk coming your way. He's got company on the back door, and he goes by the name of Diaz. Christopher Diaz, that is, for the TNT Bicycles. It's still going to be Corky, Gainsford, Diaz, one and two. Then we've got company coming, Ferris and Simpson. What happened to Simpson? What happened to Blee? Where's Chris Knapp? All the way down to the line. It will be Corky. You're in, my man. Followed by my good buddy in the 1-3 ride. That's got to belong to Gene Ferris in there for the three. Diaz the two Corky the win Bro what are you doing in Colorado my man Oh uh, you're blessed How's your pops doing Good So good Now just kick him in the shin for me I own one What do we got going on Hex Hey dude If you didn't know the gold medalist is here I'm not letting out any secrets Or telling you to go get an autograph But man he's walking around with some good looking company I'm just saying I'm just saying what do we got going on? Hexamer. Hexamer. It's going to be his first win of the year. Are you kidding me? It ain't over till it's over. Win number one for Hexamer. Follow by my good buddy David Neff. David Neff in the 28 ride of Quintana. We're moving on now. We got the big daddy up on the front side. The big daddy up on the front side. Ha 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 yeah. Lottie Dotty. Lottie Dotty. Eric Roop is leading the singing in this one just like he's been doing since 1824. It's going to be all Roop on the tippy top side. The cycle craft rider trying to reel him on in. I'll tell you what. Roop is on the tippy top side. And Glenn Castle. You know Castle's been trying to chase down Roop for about four generations. Six decades. In 19 years. I don't even know how long that is. Good job, Castle. They ride getting on in there. has got to be my good buddy, Don Ho Miller. Yee -hoo -hoo -hoo. My favorite classes in all of BMX. The little guys are in the house. The little guys are in the house. We've got five and under novice riders coming your way out here at uh, Grand Valley BMX, the Grand Mesa National coming your way today. You are in the place where you're supposed to be today. It's going to be Shable, Picario, Hurdle, McMullen, along with Cunningham, McIntosh, Edmonds, and Grayson Cooper. Oh, no, we lose one. We lose two. Oh, man, I hate when that happens. Your lead ride guy over the front side is trying to hold on, but he's got all kinds of action on the back door saying, knock, and he knock, knock, knock. Let me come on and play. I want to get on in the box too. So what do we got? Bringing it on back. It's going to be a bright light up on the tippy top side of this one as they come on down the line. Shable, Picario, the jetpack is right there. Our downed riders are getting on up, but it's still going to be, I believe, the 303 ride of Shable's Gajace is in. The 234, that's going to be Cooper. He's going to get on in with the 58 ride of Maddox McIntosh coming on down along with, I believe, his good buddy. That's 
got to be the shark himself, Mick Mullen out of St. George, Utah, Utah. And then the 490 ride, that's got to be Jack Pack himself. Picario has got young Cunningham right behind him. Yes. Man, they all get up. Oh, our, we got one over there hanging out with the medics. He's like, I need some Skittles, and I want some ice cream, and I'll be good. Dude, I feel you, bro. I feel you. Shoot, when I was five and I was racing around BMX track, I had to change my diaper two or three times a day. Phew. They're amazing. You good, little man? You got mom with you now? We'll see you tomorrow, my man. We'll see you tomorrow. He's ready. He's... He just needs some ice cream. Hey, Nap, is this one of yours? We got one coming down the first straight right now. Six-year-old novice Asher Knapp along with Z Money and Axel Desbien is in the mix out of Brighton, Colorado. I'll tell you what, all day long Axel's been leading the singing in this one. He's been like just cruising around the track with his Tupac on the headphones. He's just beating out. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, buddy, you got it, Axel. You got it, my man. <laughs> Rupe, I thought you were going to come over here and kick me. I was getting nervous. <laughs> What do we got going on? It's still going to belong to the 124 ride. Axel Desbean. Desbean out of Brighton, Colorado is looking good to go as he heads on down to the line. Desbean out of Brighton, Colorado. One more turn to go. It's going to be a perfect day of racing for this dude. Shoo-wee. Get her done, buddy. Get her done. Axel Desbean, Colorado. He comes. The local boy looking good to go. Catching a little air. Yeah. He's riding his mongoose bike. He's looking good to go. The double seven ride is going to be Asher Knapp. Oh, no. Asher Knapp went down. The 76 ride. Oh, the 16. You good? Man, Knapp is still up. Yeah, Knapp. Woo-wee. Looks like a... Uh, <laughs> Poor Ashen and Xander. They're brothers out there and they're crashing each other. That's the second time they've crashed each other today. Oh, man. It reminds me of Tim and Chris back in the day. Oh, that's too much. Roop, I love you. Love you too, brother. I love you, man. <laughs> what do we got going on? Eight year old novice is coming out of the final turn, bringing it on home for his mama. I tell you what, Currell, Moore, Ellison, Hargrove, and Wharton bringing it on back. The 239's got to belong to Moore. Moore trying to get a little some some. Oh, check out the air. The 839. Oh, I don't know. That might have been the win 30 ride. Ellison might have got Hargrove at the line. Z Tornado was in the mix. In the mix. Sitting down at the line. Oh, oh. I never seen Connor Fields do that. Number, main event number 51 now. Main event number 51 now. What do we got going on? Borba, Richard, Cooper. Borba, Richard, Cooper coming your way. In and out of the back turn now. Bringing it back. Oh, is this still going to be the big dog? Bora, G. Bora, G. Bora, is that you, bro? Oh, yeah, no doubt about it. He's going to shake his head. The All-American Arborist is coming your way out of Peoria, Arizona. Gabriel Bora bringing it on back. There ain't no doubt about it. He is straight up turning it on. Bora's going to get on in. The 2 3 5 ride. Cooper's going to come on through. And then we have got, I believe, the 1-3 ride. That's got to be out of Callahan, Colorado. How about the attorney? The attorney. 14-year-old novices now. Urban Simchek, Desbean, and Fleming is coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? We got one of the local boys looking good today. That's got to be Antonio Urban. Urban knows the track like the back of his hand. We'll see if he can hold it together right about now. Out of turn. Oh, man, the 713. Simtech, Simtech trying to bring it on back now. Here comes Urban. Desbean is right there. The m and kids got to be Fleming doing it for Iron Man's Ladies BMX. One more time. Oh, they're swapping paint in the final turn. Bring it on back our way now. It's still going to be, I believe, Simtech. At the line, Simtech is in. Urban for the two. And then it's going to be Fleming, the M&M boy, for three. Hey, Nap. Chris, that little guy's tougher than you ever were. I'm just saying. Yep, no doubt. No doubt. 
36 to 40 year old, 36 to 40 year old, novice rider, Desbian, Crane and Cooper, Crane and Cooper, whoa, Nelly, this guy's getting loose in and out of turn two, the 737's got to be Brian Cooper, and I'll tell you what, this guy's got the engine on full blast right about now, Cooper trying to hold true to the cause right about now, and a surprise, Arizona, it's going to be all Cooper, Crane and Desbian, Cooper, Crane, Desbian, one, two, and three, bringing it on back to the stripe, coming on down to the line, oh, upper grabs, the 116 ride's going to steal it at the line, hoo, 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 no breaks, brother. Brenton Crane, Minden, Nebraska. Good run, son. Good run. Hoffman up on the front side one more time. The Biolab rider, Hoffman. Hoff dog. He's got Pruitt. Johnny Boy Pruitt along with Dustin Fall coming his way for Rigid Racers right about now. Bringing it on down into the final turn for Jamie Leha's crew. That has got to be all Chad Huffman. L Hoffman looking good to go. Hoffman's got somebody trying to reel on low momentum now in the 63 ride. Dustin Fall. Doesn't fall now. The door is open and he flies right on by by a lab. Hoffman trying to figure out what happened in here. Hoffman, oh no, he's getting loose from one to three. It's going to be, I believe, falls in. Pruett's in. Chad Hoffman going the wrong way from first to third. More intermediates now. Oh, my bad. We're starting intermediates now. We are starting intermediates right now. Little guys coming your way, five and under. Mieha, it's going to be Coda and Holden trying to get on in there as well. Colden, Holden, the little dog. Adams trying to find a little sum sum as they head on in and out of turn number two and bring it on back your way. The little guy up on the front side holding on tight. He's got the 93 sitting in two. That has got to be Mieha sitting on the two spot trying to reel on in. The big guys, they head on down the line. But I'll tell you what, Holden, the little dog, he's been looking good, man. Little Holden Adams, this dude's doing it to it for Davis Ray where he's got two ones out of Fontana, California. He's going to take home a win today. National age group number 17 getting on in. It'll be Adams for the win, followed by, I believe, Mieha and Coda, two and three. Six-year-old intermediates, and I'll tell you, Baxter might be the bad boy rolling out the master plan right about now as he heads on down the stripe. Yep, no doubt about it. I got a Colorado S-square jersey at a Longmont coming your way. The guillotine, Baxter looking good to go. He's going to head on into the second turn right about now. He's still got Cannon and Woolbridge. Here comes Dissert. Dissert trying to get on in there. Huddleston, DeSomber, Vercuso, and then the machine. Carell is in the mix as well. One more turn to go. This dude's going to try and get on in. The main of it. Win might be all his. It's going to be all hero. Baxter coming back your way now. Baxter's going to get on in. Sitting in two. He's got another one of the hard chargers. Dissert. Dissert's in there. San Mateo representing the 118. Ryan's got to be Cannon. That's going to be your box. One, two, and three. Seven-year-old intermediates are on the track right now. Seven-year-old intermediates are on the track. Salerno, Antonio. Here comes the snack attack. Lynn trying to find a little sum sum as well, along with, I believe, Adam Schrader at an S-squared Colorado crew. That's your lead ride guy up on the front side out of Edwards, Colorado. This guy looking way fast and way smooth. Schrader in the mix, but Schrader's got all kinds of company on the back door. That's got to be your gold cup number three. Little Joseph Antonio in the mix right about now. Antonio trying to catch up to the big dog, but I'll tell you what, Schrader want no part of it. Schrader's like, peace, I'm out of here, son. It's like I am moving out, mobbing like an 18-wheeler. Schrader's going to take on the top spot. Antonio's going to get on in there for two, followed by the 28 ride. That has got to belong to Snack Attack, young Marshall Lynn. Eight-year-old intermediates are into the first turn right about now. Eight-year-old intermediates are into the first turn right now. Steed. Steed's got the flying J on the back door. Zayden Skinner is in the mix as well as William Crane. Crane coming on strong as well. One more turn to go. Oh, yeah. No way. Max Biagi. Biagi's out of Brighton, Colorado. It's going to be Biagi. He's got all kinds of company on the back door, though. It looks like it's going to be young Steed trying to get some right about now as he comes out of the final turn. How about we go with all Max Biagi. The A-Ride on the front side. Getting the job done right about now. He's still got the 1-3 ride. That's got to be Zren. Biagi, Zren. The 150 belong to Zayden Skinner for the S-squared AZ. S-squared AZ. 
Here comes drama. The nine-year-old intermediates. Now tell you what, this guy's looking good to go. Hurdle, Cunningham, Barton, Gilliam, Linares, along with Vega. Here comes the dead set Tiki. That's got to be Nico Marchese. And then Gavin Petrucci is in the mix as well. Your lead ride guy. That's got to belong to young Josh Linares. Is up on the front side. Justin Josh, Hurricane Utah. Linares is going to get on in and out of the final turn as he comes on down to the line one more time. Josh is looking good to go. Jumping Josh. Bringing it down to the stripe, the 159. Yep, Josh Lenars is in for the win, followed by the 71 and the 76 ride. Getting on in there of Barton and Gilliam. They're going to go two and three out here at the Grand Mesa National number one right here at Grand Valley. The 10-year-old intermediates are in and out of the first turn right about now. It's going to be Van Isterstein, Kenny Duncan. How about Peter Fifi's Lutham, Lutham and Howarth, along with Pony Boy Robinson in the mix as well. Pony Boy Robinson looking good to go, but how about Jet jumping, jumping Jet Duncan in and out of the turn and bringing it on back your way. It's still going to be, I believe, yep, there ain't no doubt. Lincoln, Nebraska, this guy is straight up rocking the party right about now. It's going to be all Duncan for Liberty Racing. In and out of the final turn, coming on down to the line. Liberty Racing, no way. We got a new lead ride guy, Kenny. Kenny's going to get in. Liberty Racing, and then, woo, close to the line for the three. Could have been Peter Fifi's. I ain't touching that one with a 10-foot pole. 11-year-old intermediates, 11-year-old intermediates. What do we got going on? Davis, Cancino, Nowell, Collins, Romero, along with Warner and a Hafner. In and out of turn two, coming on strong. This could be the 6-5 ride. Is that going to be Hafner on the double nickels? Oh, yes, Hafner up on the front side. He has got Cancino right there on the back door. Here comes Lightning Warner in the mix as well. So it's going to break on down just like this. They head on down to the stripe. The double nickels out of Frederick, Colorado, doing it for Viking Racing Team. Callum Hafner. Hafner is in the deuce deuce coming on through the 28 and the 44 you know Cancino is in there and then how about cash money himself cash Noel Noel the S squared ride is out of Utah. Mace Money. They call him Mason Matthews. Oh, no. Oh, they're head over tea kettle. Holy moly. We got something going on strong right about now. The bile. He's going through the pro section. Are you kidding me? That guy's straight up getting loose, son. It's going to be the 170 ride. Chandler Cutler. Cutler's on the tippy top side of this one as they head on down to the line. They're going to head on into the final turn. Cutler might have got a gift from the BMX gods. It's going to be a main event win out here. No way. Las Vegas, Nevada. Nevada? Yeah, buddy. You earned it, son. You kept on pedaling to the end of the road. Cutler is in for the win. The 153 has got to be the Jet. How about Peak Performance's very own Benjamin Meyer? The S squared rider is up. That is going to be uh, young Mace Money. Mason Matthews. We're still checking on our downed rider. We'll make sure he's A-OK -okay and good to go out of Thornton, Colorado for Sisu Racing. You good, bro? Yeah. Come on. Let's put your hands together. Let's get a great big round of applause. A round of applause for this dude. Shoo Zachary Villavetter there. Man, that guy, his feet were up above his head, and he was like cartwheeling out there. Man, he was getting all discombobulated, but he straight up hung tough like a new kid. What's that saying? Uh, tougher than a pair of woodpecker lips. Thirteen-year-old intermediates are long gone. The COB ride. The COB national team rider out of Bullhead City, AZ. He's got to be the mad dog himself. Here comes Spencer Patterson, y'all. Spencer Patterson's up on the front side looking good to go. He's got three guys trying to reel him on in. Four guys. Romero. Romero and Michael Fifi's. The Razzle Dazzle's got to be Samantha Reed. And then how about Sean Billings in there at a Grand Junction. The local boy looking good. In and out of the final turn. COB coming your way today. These guys are straight up way fast and way smooth. It's going to be all Patterson, the Gold Cup ride. Patterson is going to take home the win, followed by, uh, I believe, the 76 of Romero. And then how about we go with Michael Fifi's Denver, Colorado. We're moving on now. We've got 14-year-old intermediates on the course. 14-year-old intermediates are on the course, and they're coming out of the first turn and bringing it on home. Brown, Bass, Seneas. That's got to be a little squishy out there. Trenton Klein. How about Baker Callahan, William White, Brown, and Kyle Christopher at a turn two. The 1-6 ride coming your way. Manuel Daniel. That's got to be Daniel Brown for Pack BMX Racing. 
If this man takes on the top spot, no, no way. It's up for grabs. Does he want the expert title at the line? It's going to be 16 ride. No way. Manuel Daniel Brown is going to be your newest UA USA BMX expert racer. We'll see him tomorrow in 14X. Congratulations, Daniel Brown. More race action coming your way. This time is going to be main event number 65, guys. 15-year-old intermediates. 15-year-old intermediates. What do we got? This dude's going to be shaking his tail feather all the way around the track one more time. How about Trey Press, Stearman, Sergeant Hull, Ryland Knapp, and T-Bone Nelson himself in and out of the final turn. Coming on down the stripe, it's still going to be the 3-1 ride on the front side. Hall is in for the win. The 56 and the 9 ride. That's got to be Knapp and Nielsen. Knapp, you got another kid out there racing? Holy moly. I don't want to see. I don't, man. He's got his own team. He's got like 13 rostered children. Whew. Six... You know I love you, Chris. 16-year-old <laughs> intermediates now coming your way. What do we got going on? Burhar doing it to it for McFarland boys in New Mexico. Coming on strong at a Farmington. I love Farmington. That's where, uh, oh, no, he goes down. Oh, the ROC, Isabella Meyer. Meyer takes it on over for the S-squared ride. Meyer did the low line and straight up launched by the buddy. The 64 ride, Young, Meyer and Young. Verhar, are you good? Man, you good? This dude is, Verhar is from the same hometown as Felker. He's the only two dudes I know from Farmington. There's like half a high school out there. 13 people graduated last year. Man, that's crazy. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, man. What do we got going on now? 17, 20-year-old intermediates coming your way. 181. It's going to be the 257 at the line. That's got to belong to Cornwell and Alex Loreno. <laughs> no joke. Hey, you're not old enough to have a bad mouth like that. Come on, son. Oh, man, that was so funny. I was just about to say Farmington and give him some props and press, and he straight up blew up. Man. What do we got going on now? More intermediate riders coming your way. They bring it out of turn number two. It's got to be the 4-6 ride of Tro Trevor Devspike at a Sparta BMX camp. This guy is straight up repping the party from Prescott Valley, Arizona. It's going to be all Devspike bringing it home for his mama. Yeah. Oh, dude, this guy got some trail skills. A little turn bar. Shoo-wee. Looking good, son. The two ride getting on in there is going to be Penn, followed by the 26 of young Steve Stitham. That boy can ride a bike. What do we got going on now? This time it's going to be, uh, ah, yeah. Oh, he's going upstairs. The intermediate's going upstairs. Oh, dope. he fell on the, yeah. I hate when that happens because I always talk like that. What do we got going on? It's going to be, I believe, it's going to be Hedges, Jackson, Wooten, Picario, and Reed. What do we got in and out of the final turn? This one's all discombobulated. Oh, don't we almost lose him again. This guy's crashed three times in one moto. The Gold Cup number three coming across line with the 143 rather. It's going to be Reed. Reed and Hedges. Oh, man. He straight up jumped those doubles and landed on the gibble bits. And I hate when that happens. <laughs> Moment number 70 now. Moment number 70. What do we got going on? 46, 50-year-old intermediate riders coming your way. The big guy on the front side. Right. Cutler, Shirley, Bartosh, and Eaton are bringing it on back. Yeah, dude. The 7-0 ride. Eaton. Terrence Eaton out of Albuquerque, New Mexico. My future home, no doubt about it. It'll be, I believe, Eaton bringing it on back for his mama right about now, doing it out for the 7 crew. It will be all Eaton in for the win. Yeah, buddy, you got that straight up owning it. Eaton, the 85 ride, and the 62 of Shirley and Bartosz. They're going to round out the box with color and right, reeling them on in. Well, 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 as Eric would say, welcome to the girls club, son. It's going to be Brindley Chadwick and Johnson coming your way. Sassy Pants and Brindley have been swapping them out right about now. Let's see what we got going on. Skittles has been consistent as ever with two threes. So we're going to figure it on out. Does Sassy Pants want the win? Is Tatum Brindley going to take it on over? In and out of the second turn now and bringing it on back our way. It's still going to be, I believe, the nine ride, the one-one holding on. Chadwick, Chadwick. 
Chadwick, no way. This one's all discombobulated. Chadwick got two thirds and now is up on the front side. Johnson got a second and a first and trying to reel on in the leader. It's still going to be Skittles now, bringing it on down to the line. The 1-1 one, one ride up on the front side. Chadwick, Chadwick for the win. Chadwick in, followed by the nine ride, Brindley. One and two, five, six, seven. Yep, the five ride is going to be Johnson. Oh, man, what a turn of events. What a turn of events. Seven-year-old experts now are coming your way. Seven-year-old expert girls are coming your way. And I'll tell you what, Joy Joy Gonzalez has been looking good to go. She's on the 0-9 flag, but she's sitting in the back of the pack trying to reel them on in right now. It's got to be, I believe, Sour Patches in here. comes Hart and Cummings. Edmonds is in the mix. And then we've got Holiday Hawes and McKinley is in here as well. Bringing it on back, I'll tell you what, Supercross Mountain looking good to go. McKinley's been turning on the turbos. She's your national age group number six. And then we've got the five. That's got to be Sour Patch herself. Briella Salmi is in there out of Las Cruces, New Mexico. The five right Right up on the front side is going to be the District 5, that is. No, Briella is going to get on in. The Gold Cup 2 and the 1-1. One, one. The Gold Cup 2 is going to be Kinsley in the double ones, of course, is the Little Ripper Hawes out of Henderson, Nevada. Henderson, Nevada. Eight X-year-old young ladies. What do we got? The factory S squared. Noyola. Noyola up on the front side. Here comes Albie's very own Charlie Gay. Noyola and Gay. And then we got Sky Sky Martin coming your way. Doing it to it for the dead set crew. So one more turn to go as they head on through the rhythm section. We're going to pick up who's got the skills to pay the bills. Noyola's got them all laid out right about now. Daisy, Noyola, Charlie Gay. One and two. Albie's in S squared. The factory squad doing the job right about now. Skyler Martin in there as well. They're going to go one, two, and three down to the stripe. S squared for the win. For the win. Hey guys, just a quick reminder sign ups end at the end of racing, and don't forget to turn in your team ups. Sign ups for Saturday and Sunday end at the end of racing, and team sheets get turned in. Team sheets get turned in to the trailer, please. Thank you. The princess is up on the front side. Factory bombshell. Did I forget to say that she is Princess Hulk? That's right. The green machine is up on the front side one more time, but I'll tell you what, the door might be a little open as they head on through. Oh, she's going to slut it on down. She's going to shut the door and head on down to the line. What do we got going on? It's still going to be the Hulk. Hulk and the A-Ride. It's got to be Meha. Meha getting on in there for the two. The three's got to belong to, I believe, Strain in there. That's got to be Rory Rocket. The door was shut. Ten-year-old young ladies are on the course one more time. Ten-year-old young ladies are on the course one more time. Barnes, Barnes and the Goose. And then we've got Priest in the mix as well. In and out of the first turn, they go. Your whole shot hero coming on back our way. The Banana, Savannah Banana, that is looking good to go. The seven ride. National age group number seven has got to be Zoe Boogie Barnes. Zoe Boogie up on the front side of this one. Another one of the Las Vegas kids rolling the dice out here. And I'll tell you what, she is straight up turning on the turbos and bringing it on home to the line. Barnes, Priest, Barnes, Priest and the Goose. They're going to go one, two and three. National age group number seven. Barnes looking to drop that a couple spots. It looks like the banana going to get on in there for the two, followed by young Lucy Chaffe. 11-year-old young ladies, 11-year-old young ladies are in and out of the first turn right about now. This one's going to be a doozy, no doubt about it. We got eight hitters heading on down in and out of the second turn now. Ferris, Albridge, McKinley, Moody, Thornton, Viscuso, Bodie, and Dune. It's going to be, oh yeah, Fall Risks, very own, the Blue Raptor, Moody. Moody on the tippy top side of this one. In and out of the final turn, bring it on down to the line. I'll tell you what, Fall Risk in full control. It'll be Moody. Moody is in. Your national age group number 11, followed by the three ride getting on in there. That's got to be Moody. No, my bad. Moody for the three. The fall risk ride. That's going to be the fast cat. Avon Beatty in there for the win. Two of the fall risk riders going one and three. They're both on the box with crash done. 12X coming your way. What do we got going on in this one? Walski getting stuck in the back of the pack. Shatswell, Albies in the mix. In and out of turn two. I'll tell you what, here comes Shatwell now trying to bring it on back. Oh man, are you kidding me? LSG sitting in three, trying to get on in there as well. It's still going to be Kovacs. Way fast and way smooth. One more turn to go. Kovacs and Albies doing it to it for Angus. One, two, and three. It looks like it's still going to be the one ride getting on in there. LSG and Walski for the four. 
13 year old young ladies are on the course right now 13 year old young ladies are on the course right about now what do we got going on is that going to be Thompson one more time there ain't no doubt about it I'll tell you what Addison Thompson out of Montana coming your way Thompson has still got Charlie along with Crane and Smith and Brown and then we got Kaylin Van Rensselaer in the mix as well bring it on down to the line I'll tell you what we got going on fall risk Miss Brown trying to come on strong for two fall risk velocity velocity has got to be Van Rensselaer bring it on back your way it's still going to belong to Addison Thompson in for the win followed by the fall risk ride Van Rensselaer velocity one two and three 14 year old young ladies are on the course they are long gone see you later Gordy's the bomb blowing up the competition right about now the flying panda it's got to be I believe young Churhart up on the tippy top side of this one but here comes company Salon na 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 trying to reel her on in now one more turn to go Gordy's Gordy's in 21 productions Gordy's 21 productions with company coming that's got to be Wells one two and three in and out of the final turn bring it on down to the line Full pool time to the stripe. It's going to be Gordy's for the win. Solano, Wells, followed by Mady, Maddie. One, two, and three. Here comes trouble. It's got to be, I believe, the little avalanche. The little avalanche on the front side. They have got company coming in and coming quick. The horror ride trying to get on in there as well. Way fast and way smooth. That's got to be Darren Merton. Merton sitting in two right about now. Avalanche on the tippy top side of this one. One more turn to go. Danica Anderson. This girl has straight up won everything possible in BMX. World champion. National champion. National age group champion. Merton's for the two. The 28 ride. Getting on in there for the three. That's got to belong to Brooklyn. Van Rensselaer, Super B, Super B. 17 to 20, 17 to 20. The V8 trying to take over the lead. Oh man, they are straight up swapping paint. Here comes company though. That's got to be Sam Hammer. Sam Hammer don't like to play those games. What do we got going on now as they come out of turn number two? It's still going to be the Alpha Ride. Alpha Ride's got company coming on strong. Is that going to be Izzy, the sergeant for the Fall Risk crew, sitting in two? So it's going to break on down just like this. Sam Hammer sitting in three right now, coming on down the line. The Alpha Ride, the V8, Sifford is in. Fall Risk is in Sam Hammer for the three. More ladies coming your way. What do we got going on? Kaylin and Morgan. Morgan along with Maria Wilsey is in the mix as well. In and out of the first turn. Bringing it on down the second straight. I'll tell you what, they are straight up moving out with Cloud big time. Teammates doing the dance out of the Colorado Mesa University. Zimmerman, little monkeys out there turning on the turbos. Right about now, the 1-5 ride's got to belong to Kaylin Wilsey sitting in two out of Goodyear, Arizona. So one more turn to go. They're going to bring it on back. It's still going to be Zimmerman, Wilsey, Wilsey and Wilsey doing it to it all the way down the stripe. The 38 and 15. So Wilsey and the 10 ride. Wilsey, Wilsey and Zimmerman. Wilsey, Wilsey and Zimmerman. More ladies coming your way right now. What do we got going on in this one? I got pow, pow all day long. I'll tell you what, straight up moving out big time. Iverson and Crane trying to reel on in the custom optics BMX rider out of Apple Valley, California. And she goes by the name of Anja Pow, Pow, Pow is coming your way. Hitting on all cylinders for the COB team. I'll tell you what, she might have a four barrel carburetor underneath that hood because she is straight up hitting on all them cylinders. Son, Powers has got it. 420 horses under underneath the hood man powers is in crane and iverson gonna battle it out for the two and three powers for the win crane iverson More ladies are in the place right about now. It's got to be Jill McGuire. McGuire is straight up doing it to it for Sia BMX out of Elizabeth, Colorado. So McGuire's up on the tippy top side of this one as they head on in and out of the second turn, bring it on down the line. This girl's been showing Lance how to ride the course for about 20 years now. McGuire's going to take home the top spot, get her done, followed by Cherhart and Carissa, my homie out of the NorCal, out of Alameda, California. So it's going to break on down with McGuire with the win. Sure, Arthur two, Corona three. 
Gate goes down in main event number 85. The gate goes down in the main event number 85. What do we got going on in this one? We have got Susie LeVan up on the front side. TNT bicycles coming your way. Zalewski's crew out of Aurora, California. LeVan's going to get on top to the front side of this one, but she's got company coming. That's got to be the S squared. Colorado kid coming on strong out of Littleton. How about we go with body armor herself? Paula Moresh. So be LeVan and Moresh one and two with Suzanne Black one, two, and three. They head on down the third straight. LeVan knows how to ride a bike, and if you don't know, her brother might too. He goes by the name of Jimmy. Jimmy, TNT Bicycle is going to take home the tippy top spot of this one. Susie LeVan for the win. Moresh the two. Susan Black in there for the three. S squared. Oh, yeah. Don't call it a comeback. Nino Camaro's been here for years. Actually, he's only six years because he's only six years old. But you know what I'm saying. It's going to be all Kimura. Nino Kimura rocking the top spot like a 1980s hip-hop song. This guy is straight up moving out big time. Oh, yeah. Kimura rhyming. Here comes the Mack Truck Ayers in the mix as well. Nino Kimura from Mantis Racing getting the job done right about now. They're going to head down in the final turn. Kimura, Kimura. That's all you need to know right about now. Ryman's trying to reel him on in. Flex Racing at Ayers. Ayers is looking good to go. But it's going to be all Kimura. Nino in for the win. Nino is in your Gold Cup ride. It's going to be Ayers for Flex Racing and Dino Ryman. One, two, and three. Congratulations, Nino. Here we go. 7X, 7X. Right about now, the dads start getting a little bonkers. It's going to be Hicks, McConnell, Murray, Davis. Here comes Martinez. Winders in here. The cop, Coop Dog Hunt and G Amber Boy as well. The Sharks rider. He's sitting in two. In and out of the second turn now. Bring it on back our way now. Is the Sharks going to try and reel on in this guy? But I'll tell you what. Dax Murray. Murray trying to hold on. Here comes Sharks. Here comes Alpha. Oh, man. This one's going to be a doozy at the line. Woo. Woo Sharks on the front side. There ain't no doubt about it. He's going to get on in for the win. The 69, the 5, and the 7, or the 7 and the 5. Hicks and McConnell too close to call. Murray looking good. Man, Amber Boy is bad. What do we got going on now? Eight-year-old experts has got to be Donovan Long's young gun up on the front side right about now as he heads on down. How about the laser show Schumann? Lincoln Schumann. Schumann's doing it to it out of Utah. He comes. The factory LSG ride has got company on the back door. The Alpha Squad trying to reel him on in. has got to be the Kamikaze kid. Colwell. Jacob Colwell, that is. One more turn to go. Colwell and Schumann. Schumann and Colwell. Schumann, Colwell. The Albies riders sitting in three on the box right about now. has got to be Jack C. Boy. Left for an ear is in the mix as well, followed by the Colorado West Squared Rider getting on in there, Huddleston. Just add it up. Use your count. Okay, use your calculator, add it up. Did you do it? You did it already? Did you did it already with your calculator? Okay, add it up. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way as they head on down the line. Oh, nine-year-old experts. Nine-year-old experts are on the track. It's got to be Williams. Smoke it. Terrapin Racing. Where are you at, brother? It's still going to be, I believe, Quincy Williams all the way down the line. The Terrapin, the North Cal Baller is going to get on in, followed by Kerr. Followed by Kerr in the 12 ride. Keep your eyes on Jammin' Jacks. He is moving out with clout. Moving out with cloud. Jammin' Jacks is right there in the three. Kerr, the two. Your big dog. Local boy looking good. We got more experts coming your way. Ten-year-old experts this time around the track. Ten-year-old experts on the track. You know it's got to be Shark Week when you got a hard on the front side. Carterman, Carter, a hard on the tippy-top side of this one. The Bassett ride trying to reel them on in as they head on down to the line. That's got to belong to the hunting board Harp. So Hart and Harp, Hart and Harp, one and two. Hart, Harp, LSG, one, two, and three. No, that's going to be the BioLab rider now dropping on back to four. One more turn to go. It's going to be a Hart and Harp all the way down to the line. The Sharks ride holding on to it. The Bassett's going to get on in there for the two. The one-one ride, that's going to belong to Agron, Anthony Agron doing it to it for Biolab. He's on the box. He's on the box. Here comes Hickey. Hickey, he's got a whole lot of trouble right about now as he heads on down to the line. We got a big dog looking good to go as they bring it on through. What do we got going on in this one? Hickey has got to deal with holy moly, the real deal. Bring it on back. The factory S squared ride holding on. Then we have got another hard charger. Is that going to be Garcia's in there as well? Perkins looking good to go. One more to go. It's still going to be the factory S squared ride. Perkins going to get on in at the line. Bombshell the two. Garcia the three. The 20 ride. Getting on in there, Aiden Trompeter. 
Trumpeter. Trumpeter? Trumpeter. Sheesh. We still checking on our downed riders. We're going to make sure they're A-OK and good to go. Looks like we got lost one of our Acme and Sharks riders. Man. They were going for it in that turn. Straight up, crossed the lines, took a soil sample. The crazy one, Lokens. Look at that, man, giving each other a high five, a little fist pump. Good race, son. Sheesh. That's some good sportsmanship right there. They, they both deserve ice creams. They both deserve ice creams. Good job, man. They went down, shook hands, a little fist pump. We'll see you tomorrow morning. It's all good. It's all good. The gate goes down one more time. What do we got going on in this one? It could be the devil dog on the front side. 12-year-old experts. Yep. No doubt about it. How about we go with the BMX Sharks rider leading the singing of this one as they head on down to the line. Sharks. Sharks. Sharks are in the water. Blood's in the water. Whatever you want to say. It's got to be the devil dog. Montano's on the tippy top side of this one out of Roseman, California. Montano. Here comes company. S squared's all over the three and four right about now. It's going to be, I believe, freaking freaking's got to get on in there with the mix as well. It's got to be Skinner. Skinner sitting in three and four battling on out with his good buddy. Down to the line. Sharks going to take on the win of the four ride. Is it going to be white? White is in. The Sharks, the two. S squared, S squared, three and four. I ain't calling that one, but I'll tell you what. Freaking was right there. Man, going at it. 13X. 13X is long gone. Ian Gibson with the sugar snap right about now. This guy must have ate his uh, cocoa puffs this morning because he is straight up going cuckoo, cuckoo. It's going to be Gibson. Gibson, he has got company to come in. He's got Levi Hart and Whiteside. Here comes Bakari and Wagner. Tyler Wagner. That's got to be Colton Kidd coming on strong and Tegan as well. But Gibson, Kidd, one and two. Then we have got Wagner. Wagner, this dude knows how to ride a bike. One life. Health and fitness coming your way. In and out of the final turn coming on down the line. Ian Gibson going to sign seal and deliver it. Gibson is in. Kid for two. ROC for the three. Tyler Wagner. 14 year old experts are long gone. See you later. Bye guys. Aiden Ragel. Ragel is up on the tippy top side of this one. Here comes company. Water's trying the outside now. They got company. Is that going to be Cumson trying to get on in there? Off Wego as well. In and out of the second turn now. Bring it on back your way. Bagel. Bagel and Waters. Ragel. Bagel. Bring it on back. The factory S squared. Riders got Waters on the back door. Then here comes company. Aguilar and Gunning and Elf Wego as well. Down to the line. Aiden Ragel. Waters are going to go one and two. Elf Wego. Go. <laughs> Who got that one? The 17, Aiden Rago for the win. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way. DFR on the front side. Westover. Westover's got company coming. Here comes McKay now. He's trying to bring it on back. He's stuck in the back of the back. It looks like DFR. We got a Sharks right on the tippy top side of this one now. Gosnell, the dude. Gosnell, Westnar, Caleb McCain throwing around everybody as they bring it on down to the line. The Sharks are going to get on in. The five, Omara, the three. Man, I ain't touching the three and four. Omara was right there by McCain. Sheesh. 16 extra, 16 expert, 16 expert coming your way. The DFR, whole shot hero all over Molina. Molina moving out with Cloud Big Time. He has got company coming in a coming on strong. You know that's got to be true to Bailey. Bailey's the impact ride. This guy got some skills to pay the bills right about now. Oh man, straight up gapping him through the rhythm section. True to Bailey being the real deal. This guy's trying to Stay true to the cause. Bailey, the 1 5 in the R ride, getting on in there. Molina, Molina with Pop Tart Scott for three. Did you see True Dat? Did you see that? Good Lord Almighty. I've been praying since I was 13 for those skills, and they just ain't come yet. What do we got going on now? It's got to be a shark try. It's got to be the pistol, Pete. Elizondo. Elizondo's got company on the back door. Here comes Velador. Velador trying to get on in the mix as well. How about we go there and Blee? Blee's in the mix, trying to look sick right about now. They're hitting the foul turn. Oh, Blee trying a little something, something. Making it happen today. Pistol, Pete. Elizondo's going to go wire to wire, coast to coast. Elizondo's in. Blee's in. Velador, one, two, and three, followed by the one, three ride. Getting on in there. That's going to be Brendan Jumping Johnson, Dirt Addiction.
21, 25 year old experts are long gone. Another one of our DFR riders coming on strong. Is this going to be Cavallaro? No way. He rode that lane one all the way to the first turn and made it work for him. Oh man, somebody's trying the pro line. Let's see what we got going on. Where are they going to meet in turn two? It's going to be. Oh, Cavallaro holding on. The guy just dipped his shoulder and said, Sorry, bud, I'm straight up out of here. I'm stealing this one and I'm riding the bike like I straight up stole it too. It's all good. Cavallaro down to the line. He's going to take home the win. The Biolab rider in there for the three. Your national agent number nine, Andrew Sanchez, for the two. For the two. More race action coming your way one more time. It's got to be the monster. How about Shane Harlow? Harlow up on the tippy top side of this one. The long hair going upstairs, but it ain't going to happen today. The factory and vendetta ride out of Hemet, California is going to be all Shane Harlow leading the singing of this. Oh, Shane, you make it look so easy, son. It's going to be all Harlow bringing it on down the line. Harlow is in. The L ride's got to belong to Baxter. They're going to go one and two down the stripe, followed by the nine ride. That's got to be Jacob Murray. Jacob Murray. Ho, Joe. Remember, you only had four. Ho, Joe, up on the front side. Ho, Joe, up on the front side. Are you kidding me? The factory S squared rider trying to get the job done one more time. It's going to be all Hojo leading the scene in this one out of the factory answer camp. He's got company coming on strong. Meyer, Meyer, Meckham, Reed, along with Casey and Jason coming on down strike. Meckham going to settle for the three. The national age group number 12, Jason Michelson for the two. Meckham the three. We're moving on now. we got more guys coming your way today. What do we got going on in this one? I'll tell you what. That guy's going to hop and skip and jump his way to the front side. It's going to be El Jefe. Marchese trying to get on in there with Keener. Keener, Basquette, Davis, Haworth, Mark Johnson, and Lance McGuire. It's got to be all Lance Botchler up on the front side for out of Elizabeth, Colorado for Sia Racing. McGuire. McGuire on the tippy-top side, but he's got company coming on strong. How about Keener trying to find a little something, something in the gas tank? Oh, last turn race action. Keener trying something. It's going to be McGuire. Wire to wire McGuire, that is. The 71 ride getting on in there followed by the 70 that's got to be Howarth Howarth and John Basquet one two three so now we're moving on in I got 46 to 50 year old guys coming on strong this dude jumping his way is that gonna be Blee no way Landine nope Christopher nope it's gotta be I believe the big dog on the front side Corky Gainsford come on say it with me so everybody can hear Punk Racing's very own Corky Gainsford is back and on attack I just love seeing it son it's gonna be Gainsford Gainsford my good buddy on the back door, Christopher Diaz. He's sitting on the TNT ride, sitting in two. So it's going to break on down just like this. Corky's in. Diaz is in. One, two. Blee is in. Landine, you ever going to go home? That dude ain't been home in six weeks. What do we got going on now? More race action coming your way this time. It's going to be Swifty O'Gorman. O'Gorman. He has got a guy by the name of the Firecrackers sitting into Ken Hexamer out of Glendale, Arizona. So it's going to break on down. And I tell you what, oh, Swifty O'Gorman is going to take home this one all the way home to NorCal. Man, it's all good. Sean O'Gorman, Swifty O'Gorman, SupercrossBMX.com, followed by Hexamer, one and two, and then Bane. Bane, what happened, broski? The gate goes down one more time, one more time. The gate goes down. What do we got going on in this one? It's got to be ha -ha, Harry, Larry, Larry. Larry has got Castle. Castle's got Jaeger. Jaeger's got Roop, one, two, and three. In and out of the second turn. Man, I'll tell you what, this is like a moto from the 1982 Grand Nationals. Harry, Larry, and Castle. And Roop is in there as well. Man, Stephen Jaeger, you're riding with the legends, my friend. It's still going to be Harry, Larry, Daylight Racing, taking home the win. Harry's in. Castle. Castle's in, followed by Jaeger, Jaeger, and Big Daddy Roop. Big Daddy Roop. Well, well, well. That's going to round out a Friday afternoon out here at Grand Valley BMX, Grand Mesa. It's a national coming your way. We'll see you guys tomorrow morning, Saturday. Don't forget, team sheets need to get turned in. Sign-ups are shutting down shortly. Sign-ups are shutting down shortly. If you're not signed up right now, you snooze, you lose, son. You snooze, you lose. Sign-ups are going to be shutting down, so head on over there. Get squared away today. Um, for tomorrow? Tomorrow's team sheets need to be turned in. A racing legacy is built from dedication. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
hard work, blood and sweat. Discover your purpose. Unlock the passion. Inspire the next generation. Create your own legacy. Promax. Be your own pro.